Hello, YouTube. All right. ME3, the final of the trilogy. Oh, and uh, I'm, yeah, come here. stupid microphone. I don't know if I'm, will you stop going away from my face? I'm trying to, speak. there we go. I don't know if I mentioned it before, but uh, I will not be playing Andromeda. All right, boot it up a little. Okay, new game. Support my Mass Effect 2 character. Uh, do not. Uh, yep. Yep. You know what? Okay. And I'm, of course, I'm sticking with Vanguard. Yep. Radio Shepherd. Shepherd's current health bar will generate. I was reading that, but it went by too fast. How bad is it? Bad. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? Yes. I'd stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. Oh boy. God help us all. All right, one Red Bull down. Oh, I was like, Neom. <laughs> oh, hey, Shepard. Oh, hey. Commander. You're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The defense committee wants to see you. Sounds important. <laughs> What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. Oh, hey. Oh, he's Anderson? in. Anderson? Admiral. You look good, hey. Shepard. Maybe a little soft around the edges. Hey. You're holding up since being relieved from duty. It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. <laughs> we'll get it sorted. Hey, Terry. And yes, we have just started Mass Effect 3. Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? Aw. If I knew that. I'm your bestie. You know we're not ready if it is them, not by a long shot. Tell that to the defense committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the committee is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've seen. You face down a Reaper. Hell, you spoke to one. Hey, Akira. You've seen how they harvest us, what they plan to do to us. Yeah. You know more about this enemy than anyone. That way they grounded me, took away my ship? <laughs> you know that's not true. The shit you've done... Any other soldier would have been tried, court-martialed, and discharged. It's your knowledge of the Reapers that kept that from happening. That and your good word. Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the committee. 
I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need You're a very good soldier. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reavers. Did you do the DLC? Uh, I did the Shadow Broker. Because I'll be legit. After I did that, I completely forgot about the other DLC. Oops. Anderson. Hey. Uh, I did not. Ashley. What's up? Lieutenant Commander. How'd it go in there? I can never tell with them. And I perfected the suicide mission. Lieutenant Commander. You hadn't heard. What? No. I'm a bit out of the loop these days. Sorry, ma'am. Didn't mean to keep you out of the loop. Don't worry about it. I'm sure you had your reasons. Yeah, I guess I did. Still, good to see you. Admiral. Come on. Damn, she got a glow up. Go to the Asari for a few fucking facelifts? Jesus. Do you know the commander? I used to. I always appreciate having you here, Terry. Hope you're healing well. <clears throat> Admiral Anderson, Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. You don't send more with the crew. You don't have on your final team dies. Oof. Everything beyond the soul relay. Yeah, he's a scientist, not a not a soldier. It's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. The Reapers are here. Then how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are, more powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us, and they'll never take pity on us. But there must be some way. Unit unification. If we're going to have any chance at surviving this, we have to stand together. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Lunabase. Well, hold oh, on. They couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? They're Reapers. Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. We've dealt with Sovereign and Harbinger. Big boys are here. Why haven't we heard from Admiral Hackett? What do we do? Oh, why? The fact you wouldn't fucking listen to me? The only thing we can. We fight or we die. We should get to the Normandy. <gasps> They're hitting everything away. This is just a full fucking. Uh, this is uh, an invasion. Oh <laughs> Fuck, might as well call that one Tango Muerte.
Props if anyone actually understands what Tango Muerte means. What the? I was going to say, why do I have... Oh. Okay, I've got 20 points already. I like that. Okay. Hmm. Okay, but get nobody to that. Hmm. I do have a s What are we thinking? Actually. What's my, uh, what's the level cap in Mass Effect 3? Do I want to do more damage? Or do I want to do that? Cost of reducing damage. Mm. I think ha having it... We'll go with that. And I've got four left. Okay, there we go. Come on, sir. Yep. Full. Why? Our As we headed to the moment, they'll pick us up if we can get to the space. Let's move. Let's go. Look out! How do you stop them with no power? Rockets. Lots of fucking rockets. Generally shot from. Take a running jump. It's farther than it looks. There we go. Let's go. All right. I will say this already feels so much smoother. Oh fuck. Shit. Come on. We'll have to go this way. Hey. Look there. Let's go. 
Lieutenant Commander, you read me. I'm patching in Shepard. We're almost to the Normandy. I've got Lieutenant Vega with me. Are we taking care of him? Yep. Husks, take him out. Shoot him. I'm out of ammo. Come on, we gotta move. Oh. Oh, okay. Bap. Bap. Don't let him grab you. I'm not gonna. Let me know how the audio levels are as always. Shit, 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 shit. Anything just also, I, I love the fact there's a fucking roll now. Watch it. Oh, get fucked. Through this way. Come on. Anderson. I heard that. Oh, shit. Kidlet. It's okay. Kid's like, no fucking ain't. Come here. I need to get you someplace safe. Take my hand. You can't help me. Shepard. Get here. Are uh, the uh, powers on different cooldowns now? Goddamn mess! Every minute these machines are here, thousands of innocent people die. Yeah, we're working on it. It's hard enough fighting a war, but it's worse knowing no matter how hard you try, you can't save them all. Exactly. They hit so fast. Uh, I thought we'd have more time. We knew they were coming. And they still just cut through our defenses. Because nobody would fucking believe you. We need to go to the Citadel. Talk to the Council. The Citadel? The fight's here. It'll be everywhere soon enough. You said it yourself. <sighs> the Reapers will destroy everything if we don't stop them. Okay. The Council has to help us. <clears throat> Are you sure about that? No, but you're a Council Spectre. That has to count for something. Gotcha. Thank you. Thanks. I owe you one. Oh, thermal clips. More than one. <laughs> fuck you. Grab some ammo. Oh, thank fuck. Reload. Let's keep moving. That is so fucking cool. Wow. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Normandy, we're going to reroute. Do you copy? Normandy, come in. Friendly. Down. 
Okay, it won't let me charge. I guess because I... No way to get back. Shepard, over here. In a minute. Oh, shit. How you doing, bruh? What happened here? Our gunship was shot down. We barely made it. You have a radio? We're trying to contact our ship. No. There's one in the gunship, but it's going to be crawling with those things. We need to get to it. Stay here, son. We'll get you out of here. Oh. Come on. Uh, Let's get to that gunship. Will do. That how you get up there? No. Oh, yeah. Get fucking wrecked. Shepard, over here. I found a radio. Give me a second. I'm just checking. Covering all our backs. Alright. Normandy, this is Anderson. Do you read? Admiral, what's your location? By a downed gunship in the harbor. I'm activating his distress beacon. Send support. We've got wounded down here. <laughs> Lieutenant! <laughs> Damn it! I've lost the signal. Let's hope that beacon does its job. And fast, we've got company. Oh boy. Oh hi. Woo! Joker! About time. Let's go!
welcome back, Shepard. Thanks. Shepard! saw those men back there. There's a million more like them, and they need a leader. We're in this fight together, Anderson. It's a fight we can't win. Not without help. We need every species and all their ships to even have a chance at defeating the Reapers. Talk to the Council. Convince them to help us. What if they won't listen? Then make them listen. Now go! That's an order. Yes, sir. I take orders from you anymore, remember? Consider yourself reinstated, Commander. You know what you have to do. I'll be back for you, and I'll bring every fleet I can. Good luck. You too, Shepard. Okay, yeah. Get oh shit, get the kid and get your get fucking evac. That's a great intro sequence. <sighs> what the hell's going on? Where's Anderson? Where are we going? Hey! We're leaving. Leaving? What's going on? Anderson wants us to go to the Citadel, get help for the fight. Bullshit, he wouldn't order us to leave. I don't like it either. We don't have a choice. Without help, this war's already over. Forget it. Drop me off someplace. Enough! Don't you think I'd rather stay and fight? We're going to the Citadel. You want out, you can catch a ride back from there. Commander! Joker? You? Alive and kicking. Got an emergency transmission from Admiral Hackett for you. Patch it through. Shepard. Insane heavy losses. The Marine force was overwhelming. There was no way we could defeat them conventionally. Anderson's already ordered me to the Citadel to talk to the Council. First, I need you to move the outpost on Mars. Yes, sir. All right. I've been researching the Protean archives with Nassassan, Dr. Tassoni. We found a way to stop the Reapers. The only way to stop them. Contact soon. Hack it out. Joker, set a course for the Mars archives. Mars? Roger that. 
This is Loco. Yeah. Why Mars? What does he think we'll find there? I don't know yet. It helps us win this war. Grab your gear. All right. Were there colonies on Mars in this? I forget. I know it said Mars Archives, but it might just be like a research station. storm headed our way how long till it hits half hour tops after that we're gonna have difficulty keeping up comms with the normandy understood okay now oh, that's me okay i've still got four i'm gonna hold off on And I'm going to save up for five. Because then I'm going to get half blast. Oh. That's Damn, that's a huge storm. Looks a lot bigger in person. Come on, Lieutenant. It's not that bad. about the war back on earth or the fact that nobody here is reporting in that is fucking Turn terrifying out. I unlocked it at least. Oh. Holy Cerberus. Cerberus.
Bop. I was gonna say, where's the fucking. Boop, boop, let me in. I need a straight answer, Shepard. I just gave you one. About what? Do you know anything about this? What is Cerberus doing here? What makes you think I know what they're up to? You worked for them. How am I supposed to believe you've cut all ties? We joined forces to take down the collectors. That's it. Built you from scratch. They give your ship, resources. Let me be clear. I've had no contact with Cerberus since I destroyed the collector base. And I have no idea why they're here now or what they want. Commander Shepard's been under constant surveillance since coming back to Earth. No way they've communicated since. Sorry, Shepard. I just I shouldn't have to explain myself to you, Ash. <laughs> Please trust me. I do. It's just that. Oh, hey. <laughs> Motherfuckers. Get fucked. Double tap. Easy there, Lieutenant. She's with us. Hey. Shepard, thank the goddess you're alive. You too, Liara. I was so worried when the reports came in. I'm sorry about Earth. Yeah, it was difficult to leave. Ashley. I'm sorry, but why'd you come here? Hackett ordered us to come. Said you'd know what was going on. I do. Oh boy. Hallelujah. Some answers, finally. Maybe. I've discovered plans for a Prothean device. One that could wipe out the Reapers. Here? On Mars? In the Prothean archives, yes. I guess I'll believe it when I see it. Where do we find this weapon? It's not a weapon, not yet. It's plans for a device, a blueprint. It's more than we had a minute ago. How do we get it? The archives are just across that tramway. Okay. Assuming Cerberus hasn't locked it down. What are they after? Yeah, they Why? seem hell bent on catching you. They want what I'm here for. What we're all here for. But why? The Protheans came close to defeating the Reapers. They had plans to destroy them, but ran out of time. And anything powerful enough to destroy the Reapers. Cerberus is going to. This might be something Cerberus would be interested in. Oh. So it's a race to the archives. We got company. Bring it on. Not this time, James. What? Get back to the shuttle. If Cerberus beats us to the archives, I need you covering the exits. But. Trust me. Now, Lieutenant. They're getting closer. We should take cover. Looks like they found us.
Wrong thing. You can't hide forever. You're going to need more than guns to finish them, Shepard. Can't just shoot them. around. This is a secure station. How did Cerberus get in? Not sure. One minute we were getting reports of the Reaper invasion. The next, there was chaos. Didn't even realize it was Cerberus at first. Could they be working with the Reapers? Doubtful, but I suppose anything's possible. Checking around for supplies and salvage. Yeah, that's where I gotta go. Already found the other way up. And my roommate did something really nice. They brought me a they brought me a white chocolate mocha from Starbucks. Bye-bye. Okay, here we go. We'll need access to the pedway. Control should be nearby. If I do all of them. Okay. Okay. I just so I have a bit of both. the live feeds but hey did you see that who's that woman in the vid that's dr ivacore she got here about a week ago well any luck 
Headway's been locked out. All right. Looks like there's construction nearby. We can get out on the roof. We can find a way around from there. Yeah. Great. Let's move. Oh. Gear. Oh boy. You have to override security protocols. Someone vented the air from this room while they were still here. Looks like they died trying to claw their way out. This is brutal, even by server standards. Mary. Twenty five percent and not using up a barrier. Cerberus got in. I should have realized it when I met her. I was just so focused on finding a way to stop the Reapers. Don't blame, yeah, don't blame yourself for Stopping that. Stopping the Reapers is the only thing we should be focused on. It's not your fault. But what if we're wrong? What if there's no way to stop them? What if these are our last days and we spend them scurrying around trying to solve a problem we can't fix? Liara. I know. I shouldn't think that way. I don't know how you do it. You've always stayed focused, even in the worst situations. When there's so much at stake, I think about my friends, loved ones, what I'd lose if I failed. Me too. We'll stop them, Liara. Together. I believe you. Or I believe that you believe. Maybe that's enough. Uh. OK. 
Okay, doors open. Very touching. Get to the labs and tram station through there. Good. Let's move. What's my uh Oh yeah, I've got, oh yeah, I could get. I'm probably gonna save up for uh, bio uh, biotic power synergy, and then probably barrier. Okay, that's basically the weapon loadout thing. G Ultra Light Materials. Ooh, I like that. Hi. How's it going? What's up? Absolutely. <laughs> they just backed up and they're like, fuck it, seal it, seal it.
Do we have a cipher any? Okay. Got that. Anything kicking around here. Okay, nope. Well, I know I want that for later. On it. Ah, there we go. Got everything on that side, and obviously we need to go through here. That's the tram line. Takes us right to the archives. No doubt Cerberus has it locked down. Hopefully we can override it at the security station. It's just through here. Okay, just checking. Searchy, searchy, nothing. All right, what do you got? Look out! No kidding! Is that the only way in? It's the only way I know of. We'll skirt around it. Stay out of its sights. I'll move up first. Don't let it target you. Yeah, no shit. Hi, friends. There we go. Okay.
Looks like they've made it to the archives. And it looks like they won't be sending a tram anytime soon. Can you override it? The archives are on a separate network. We're completely locked out. Not completely. What if we could find a short-range transmitter? Helmet to helmet. And? And then we convince them that we're with them. And the Alliance forces have been taken care of. Good idea. See what you can find. What? The Lieutenant Commander has become very capable. Agreed. Commander, I found something. Oh shit, we got something. What have you got? He's got a transmitter in his helmet. If I can... Oh. Oh, oh. God. He looks like a husk. Yeah, not quite. They've definitely done something to him. Engineered by Cerberus? They claim to stand for humanity, and they do this to their own people. That could have been you, Shepard. For all I knew, that's what Cerberus had done to you. How can you compare me to that thing? I don't know what you are. Not since they got their hands on you. Is it really you? Would you even know if they were controlling you somehow? That's not fair, Ash. I'm just talking out loud. I don't need you to answer. I, I doubt there's anything you could say to convince me. I guess I just need some time to get to know you again. I haven't changed. I'm the same person I always was. Time won't change that. But if that's what you need, I understand. Thanks for understanding. It's what you I bet. do. Let's see if we can get that tram sent over here. Hello, this is Delta Team. Anybody there? Where the hell have you been? Never mind, what's your status? We're at the tram station, waiting for extraction. All hostiles terminated. Roger that. Echo Team will ride over and secure the station. Think they bought it? If they didn't, they'll figure it out soon enough. We should get in position. Flank them when they get off the tram. Good thinking, Elsie. On it. Okay. God, they made Vanguard so good in this game. Oh, and that shotgun's just fucking dirty. Uh, someone described a good shotgun sound sounds like God slamming his car door. Just bleh.
All right, let's go. Oh boy. Singularity and Inferno grenade. Yeah. Surprise, bitch. Oh. Woo. All right. Barrier shield. Armored targets. doing that because that'll make my Nova just absolutely ridiculous. I'll give that to uh, Ashley. It's a beacon. <sighs> Fuck do you want? Shepherd. Elusive man. Fascinating race, the Protheans. They left all this for us to discover. But we've squandered it. The Alliance has known about the Archives for more than 30 years. And what have they done with it? What do you want? What I've always wanted. The data in these artifacts holds the key to solving the Reaper threat. I've seen your solution. Your people are turned into monsters. Hardly. They're being improved. No. Improved? That's what separates us, Shepard. 
Where you see a means to destroy, I see a way to control it, to dumb it and harness the Reaper's power. Imagine how strong humanity would be if we controlled them. <laughs> You've gone too far. The Reapers will kill us all if we don't stop fighting each other. I don't expect you to understand, Shepard. And I'm certainly not looking for your approval. You were a tool. An agent with a singular purpose. And despite our differences, you were relatively successful. But like the rest of the relics in this place, your time is over. Enough talk. Liara? Don't interfere with my plan, Shepard. I won't warn you again. Duly noted. Fucking Shepherd. psychotic. What? The data, it's not here. Goodbye, Shepard. Damn it! How's he doing it? It's local. Someone's uploading the information. Dr. Ava. Hey! Step away from the console. Now! Ow. The there she is. Stay on her. She's getting away. Watch out. Over there. Good job, James. She's by the whoa. Let her go. Orders finish. Oh shit. Grab that thing. Bring it with us. Shepard, we got Reaper signatures in orbit.
we were taking this in orbit. We need to get the fuck out of here now. Needs medical attention. I know. We have to leave the soul system. I know. The Citadel is our best chance. We can find help there. That was my plan. Get us to the Citadel, Joker. Roger that. Hold on, Ash. See what you and Edie can learn from that thing. Commander, I'm receiving a signal over the secondary QEC. I believe it's Admiral Hackett. Oh, shit. Patch me through. Can you clear this up? I'll do my best. Did you get to the archives? I was there. So was the elusive man. I was worried Cerberus might try something. <laughs> Did you get the data? Most of it. He downloaded some before I could stop him. Edie and Liara are analyzing what we recovered. What have you learned? Was it worth the effort? Preliminary evidence suggests the data is a blueprint for a Prothean device. Device? A weapon, massive in size and scope, that's capable of unquantifiable levels of destruction. Send me the data. We'll do our own analysis. If Liara's instincts are right, this might be the key to stopping the Reapers. Yeah. I hope so. Lieutenant Commander Williams was critically wounded. We're taking her to the Citadel. Sorry to hear that, Shepard. But we both know this is just the beginning. Talk to the Council, show them what you found. With luck, They'll give you all the support we need. And if they don't? Do whatever it takes to get them on board. Mm. I'll be in touch soon. Hack it out. Oh, Normandy. Shepard. Edie is extracting data from the Cerberus machine. We'll have details to present to the Council by the time we reach the Citadel. And Lieutenant Commander Williams? I've done what I can for her. She needs proper medical attention soon. Mm. The Admiral's right. It's going to get worse, isn't it? Unless we stop the Reapers, yeah. I've looked at the data. This weapon could be the answer if we can build it. I get the sense you don't quite believe it, though. Hard to believe. See what they did to Earth. How is one weapon supposed to stop them? What are our options? You know we can't win this conventionally. Shepard. Isn't it worth trying at least? I'm gonna check on Ashley and James. Make sure we're ready to present our findings to the Council. I'm sure the Council will see the need to help. It'll be a hell of a short war if they don't. Here's hoping they'll fucking help. Back on the Citadel. Barely got a pulse here. Move him out. Where are you taking her? Where it's a memorial. Best care in the Citadel. We're not going with? We need to see the council. Right.
looks like they might be coming to see you. Commander Shepard. Oh. Got word you were arriving. Hey, Bailey. Captain Bailey. Good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Though it's Commander now. Oh. Congratulations. Uh, thanks. Now half my job is dealing with political bullshit and escorting dignitaries around. No offense. <laughs> None taken. So you're here to bring us to the council? I'm here to tell you the council is expecting you, but they are dealing with their own problems with the war and everything. Uh, they apologize for the inconvenience and blah, 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 blah. Meet them here at Odina's office. They'll be ready soon enough. All right. You might have time to go by the medical center if you want to check on progress over there. Thanks. I might do that. You go on ahead. I'll head up to Adina's office. One of my men can show you the way. Thank you. You? I'm just a tourist today. I'll try not to get in any trouble. Commander, we've got a situation in the embassy quarters. We could use your help. Ah, oh, God damn it. I'll be right there. The other half of my job. I'll see you around, Shepard. No doubt. Oh, I see. What's up? What's going on here? Commander, just who I was looking for. Diana Allers, Alliance News Network. I think we can help each other. I suppose you want an interview? Even better. I'm a military reporter with a show called Battle Space. We're carried on just about all council planets. My producers want me embedded on a human ship, and I want that ship to be the Normandy. Why would I want that? Wars can be won or lost in the editing room. And this war needs to be won. I've got Alliance security clearance and operate without a crew. You get veto power over the segments I file. Can you handle an arrangement like that? Or do I keep looking? You know what? Yeah, let's do a trial run. Tell your producers yes for now. We'll see how it works out. Report to the ship as soon as possible. Any questions? Is this the porn actress? I have... Here can I bring? One footlocker. Aye, aye, Commander. I have no clue. War asset. Ooh. Actually, I'm going to save quick. Okay. All right, I want to go through the security checkpoint now. Web. Web. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. One moment, please. We're going to the Huerta Memorial. Well, I want to check in on everybody. Now arriving at Huerta Memorial Hospital. Uh. Oh, patient line. Oh. I like how it shows you, like, people to talk to. Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to Huerta Memorial Hospital. The human specialist medical officer in charge is Dr. Michel. Also, please note that specialists for all known Citadel species are on call. Please ensure that you observe proper decontamination protocols at all times while in this area. Thank you. Please speak with me again if you recall. Oh, hey! Doc! Shepard, there you are. Dr. Chakwas, you're here? I'm working at an Alliance R&D lab down in Chalterwarm, coordinating closely with Admiral Hackett. I heard you escaped Earth in the Normandy and that someone was critically injured. I came as fast as I could. We had a run-in with the Cerberus synthetic on Mars. Ashley took the worst of it. 
How's she doing? Very well, all things considered. I'm impressed with Lieutenant Commander Williams' resilience, as well as Dr. Michelle's expertise. I wish I could have been there to help on Mars. Your place is in Normandy's med bay, not some lab. I couldn't agree more. You say the word and I'm with you. Fuck yeah. And Normandy wouldn't be the same without you, Doctor. Get your things. Docking bay D-24. Yes, Commander. And thank you. Don't thank me so soon. Remember, Joker's still aboard. And I'd be surprised if he's been remembering his medication. <laughs> A. Alright. Just checking around for everything. Oh, sir. Uh. No problem. in with her commander shepherd good to see you dr michelle it's been a long time i've come a long way from that small clinic down in the wards because of you i don't know where i'd be if you hadn't dealt with priest and his thug now i'm med physician in a presidium clinic you gave me this chance i assume you're here about lieutenant commander williams she okay how is ashley doing the head trauma was severe but we reduced the swelling quickly these types of injury can go either way she hasn't regained consciousness yet, but her vitals are strong, so I'm optimistic. Good shit. Go see her if you like. She's just down the hall. How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I can't say I'm not worried about the future. We've posted guards on our reserves. More profiteering has already begun. With a center of this size, you must have a lot of direct reports. We've got 12 full-time doctors and over 50 support staff. Jesus. It can be overwhelming, quite different from my days in the wards. Keep up the good work, Doctor. You too, Commander. Splints still the best course of action. I'll see if we have the required spatial binding. Meet you back here. You got pretty banged up there, Williams. Had me worried. I just wanted to check in on you. See how you're doing. Despite all this, it's good seeing you again, Ash. Get some rest, okay? I'll come by when you're feeling better. We'll talk. If you need anything, Doc, let me know. Okay, Ash. You take care. See you soon.
Okay, checking everything. Cause I'm fucking nosy. All right. Okay, I'm right there now. Okay. Make a left first. Good to hear. I don't know how heavily deep I'm going to go in on this one. Conspiracy here, Ms. Al Jalani. The council's simply not granting interviews at this time. My viewers are going to know that CSEC and the council are denying them access. Listen, lady, you think I like playing gatekeeper between the paparazzi and the politicians? I don't have time to babysit them, and I'm not here to hold your hand. Well, I'm camping out until I'm granted an audience. Fine. I hope you brought a sleeping bag. Commander Shepard, Commander Humanity has questions. Yeah, that's how much I give a fuck. Damn press. See, you're keeping the peace. <laughs> yeah, I feel like a glorified doorman. Most people would see it as a move up. Wedged in here with all the stuff, shirts. I'd rather be back down on the streets. I appreciate the higher pay grade, but I'm not a political creature. Don't lose your edge. We might need it. I oh, wouldn't mind an excuse to get my fingers dirty. <laughs> it's killing me about Earth. Yeah. You and me both. I haven't been back in years. Now I may never. If this ain't the end of days, it's pretty damn close. Checking in with everything. Get it as many Paragon points as I can. Or what? Oh, oh boy. Ooh, that's expensive. Uh, no. 
Hang on, let me get a look at this back. Some of these are just dirty. Okay, just checking around. Now we go in. Commander. Hey, what's up? Councillor Udina said you'd be coming. What's up? If you'll follow me, the council is already in session. We've got our own problems, Councillor. Earth is not in this alone. But Earth was the first council world hit. By our reports, it faces the brunt of the attack. By your reports. The reports are accurate. Earth was attacked by the Reapers. And it's just the beginning. We need your help. Everything you can spare. Each of us faces a similar situation. Even now, the Reapers are pressing on our borders. If we lend you our strength to help Earth, our own worlds will fall. We must fight this enemy together. And so we should just follow you to Earth? Did we say that? Even if we were to unite our fleets, do you really believe we could defeat the Reapers? I don't expect you to follow me without a plan. Counselors, we have that plan. A blueprint created by the Protheans during their war with the Reapers. A blueprint for what? We're still piecing it together. But it appears to be a weapon of some sort. Capable of destroying the Reapers? So it would seem. The scales. It would be a colossal undertaking. No. I forwarded the plans to Admiral Hackett. The remnants of the human fleet are already gathering resources to begin construction. Our initial calculation suggests it is very feasible to build. Yeah. If we work together. Have you considered that the Reapers destroyed the Protheans? What good did this weapon do? It was incomplete. There was a missing component, here. Something referred to only as the Catalyst. But they ran out of time before they could finish building it. Do you really believe this can stop the Reapers? Liara believes it can work, and so do I. And while I haven't always agreed with you, Dina, he's right about this. We need to stand together, now more than ever. Ye the Reapers won't stop it, Earth. They'll destroy every organic being in the galaxy if we don't find a way to stop them. The cruel and unfortunate truth is that while the Reapers focus on Earth, we can prepare and regroup. We are convening a summit amongst our species. If we can manage to secure our own borders, we may once again consider... Go fuck yourself! I'm sorry, Commander. That is the best we can do. Shepard, meet me in my office. I hope that's an offer of support. I'll be digging up what I can on this Prothean device, Shepard. No, it's not an offer of support. That's, uh, we're gonna let you die. You're a bunch of self-concerned jackasses, Shepard. There we go. I'm actually with Udina on this. But humanity will always be considered second-rate. How can they be so blind? They're scared, and they're looking out for themselves. Our people are scared. And we are looking out for them the best we know how. Hey! Counselor? Commander, I can't give you what you need, but I can tell you how to get it. Now we're talking. I'm listening. Primarch Fedorian called the war summit, but we lost contact with him when the Reapers hit Palavin. Those meetings won't proceed without him. The Normandy is one of the few ships that can extract Primarch Fedorian undetected. So far, you've only explained how I can help you. It might seem that way. Yeah. But the leaders of this summit will be the ones deciding our future. The fate of our fleets, where they fight, and with whom. A grateful Primarch would be a tremendous ally in your bid to unite us. We're at war, and you want me to play politician? If it gets you what you need, what does it matter? <sighs> I just want to... Yeah. Our latest...
latest intelligence says that the Primarch was moved to a base on Palavan's largest moon. I've done all I can to help. The rest is up to you. There is one other thing. The Council wanted me to tell you. We've chosen to uphold your Spectre status. Obviously. Various resources will be made available to you. Good day. Well, that went well. It's a start. I'll talk to the others in the meantime. See if we can support this summit. Move things along. Thanks. The Council. You saved their lives. And for what? Apologies that boil down to maybe later. If we don't figure out something, maybe later will be an epitaph on a mass grave of 11 billion. I know what I'm gonna do. What are you gonna do? Humanity has created some goodwill in the galaxy. Now we cash in our chips. I will get what funding I can, what materials I can, and spread the message. Help the humans, help yourselves. I'll institute a draft in our colonies and order all civilian ships armed. Work on the Prothean device will be around the clock. You're a Citadel counselor. Don't you have options when the others block you like this? With Parliament destroyed and Shastri gone, I have more power than any human in history. But today, you saw how little that is. Mm. Rest assured, I will not be counted out long. I know I can move mountains. Do not lose sight of that, because the task before us is moving planets. Did you know a lot of people on Earth? Many. It's monstrous to think of them being snuffed out, of course, but the part that gets me is Arcturus. Mm. I must know, I must have known most of the Alliance Parliament on a first name basis. I required a second VI just to track all their birthdays and anniversaries. Rose garden <laughs> stuff, but to have it all gone. Hmm. What's your read on the counselors? Any angles I could pursue? Tavos is a diplomat and compromiser, but she's wrapped up in defending a sorry space like a mother panther. Valern is out of his depth. The Salarians like their wars won before they start. They're frightened now. Use that. And Sparatus. I'd take what he offers. It's strange days when the Turians are the least hostile to humans, and there's a need there. I should go. I'll be here. Okay. All right, they're being stated, stated my stuff, so. I was seeing if it just unlocked anything else. To look at my journal. So priority is just the main mission. Wait, what the? Shepard, Kalisa bent seen in Algelani. Isn't it true that you were on Earth when the Reapers attacked? How do you justify running away while millions of people on Earth die? Is that the best we can expect from the Alliance? I came to get help for Earth, for everyone. What about all the people suffering while you play politics with the Council? What about them? How can you stand here while our families 
die. What are you going to do? Kalisa, we're doing everything we can. Before they cut the feeds, there were so many dead. I'm gonna stop the Reapers or die trying, but I need your help. Keep asking the hard questions. Don't let the Council forget about Earth. I will. Thank you, Commander. Don't. I think I'm the only person on Earth who doesn't punch we the fucking reporter. Eye eye, yeah. But I'm glad you're on our side. Yeah, because you always try to go for fucking hit pieces. Paparazzi bullshit. All right, to the docking bay we go. Now arriving at docking bay B24. Okay. First of all, there's someone with caliber. Reports say not to depend on comms. I'll leave vid messages then, and you can do the same. Well, they said that due to concerns about signal protection, they were told to avoid sending messages at all. All right, let's go back to the Normandy. Oh, what the fuck? Um, what? Oh. Nightmare episode. Okay. Oh. I was like, shoot it! I'm not quite that cruel. Wait. Oh. That's the kid. No, give me. Where'd you go? I'm looking for like a Reaper ship in the sky. Yeah, it's not going to be fun. Oh, hey. Ayara, can I help you? I've been forwarding the Turian Counselor information on the Prothean device. Hmm. It can't be built without Council support, but he's not budging until their Primarch is safe. I know. Are you all right? I've been better. I didn't get what you'd call a good night's rest. There's more to it than that, isn't there? What's really bothering you? When the Reapers hit, I could hear people screaming in the streets below me. We left a lot of them behind. There's no way for you to save them all. But I know you're doing everything you can, and you'll get back there in time to help. I hope you're right. Don't blame yourself, Commander. Commander Shepard, I'm Specialist... Oh, uh, I, I beg your pardon. I thought you were alone. Uh... I was just leaving. Commander Shepard, I'm Comm Specialist Samantha Trainer with Alliance R&D. Oh, hey, what's up? I was up? part of the team retrofitting the Normandy after you turned it over to the Alliance. 
There weren't many of us aboard when the Reapers hit. Slow down, specialist trainer. You're doing fine. Thank you. I worked in a lab. I never thought I'd be serving on a ship. Why don't you tell me about the retrofits? Yeah, I'm actually the curious about those myself. The Alliance regs now, and it has new, top-of-the-line, quantum entanglement communicators. In fact, Admiral Anderson had intended to use the Normandy as his mobile command center. That's no longer an option. Yes, I heard he chose to stay and fight. I in any event, I'm honored to serve under you, Commander. Damn. For as long as you need me, that is. They only sent me here to oversee the retrofits. Shepard, some of our systems require further testing, and Specialist Trainer has been extremely effective during installation. I would prefer that she remain. Got it, Edie. Oh, wait, since when does a virtual intelligence make requests? Edie's an AI. Fully self-aware. Oh, I knew it. I knew Joker was lying. Jeff requested that I pretend to be a simple VI to protect myself. I apologize for the deception. Thanks, ED. And I apologize for all those times I talked about how... Um, attractive <laughs> your voice was. <laughs> anyway, shall I give you a tour? Yes, please. I think you'll be impressed by the new upgrades. In the CIC, you'll find the galaxy map where you can set the Normandy's destination. You can also check your messages at your private terminal. Oh. The war room houses a strategic command center for mission-specific intel and war analysis. The shuttle bay contains an armory where you can modify your equipment between missions. Good shit, good shit. Finally, Liara has set up a lot of hardware down in the old XO office on deck three. I think she's claimed that room. Yeah. And there you are. Still the same ship as before. It just flies Alliance colors now. Speaking of which, I believe Admiral Hackett would like to speak to you at the VidCom. Hmm. Commander. Udina updated me on your meeting with the Council. Sounds like they're running scared. We did present them with a lot of unknowns. They're feeling threatened and want immediate solutions, not theories. Hmm. Theories are all we've got right now. What's your plan? I'm trying to get the Turian Primarch for a summit meeting with the Asari and Salarians. I'll bypass the Council and appeal directly to their leadership. That's good. I like it. This is where we start laying the groundwork for our counterattack. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot to back it up right now. Then build alliances. Gather everything and everybody you can for the cause. What about the Prothean device? Mm. Find me people who can help build it, and if you can't, I'll take ships, soldiers, supplies, whatever you can get. We need to keep hitting the Reapers across every theater of war they open. Buy us time to figure out the device. And when it's finished? Assuming it ever is, we pool all our resources. Think of it as a giant armada for delivering the device, when the Reapers are most vulnerable. The stronger you can make that armada, the better the chances of punching through. What about Earth, sir? We'll just have to hope Anderson and what's left of the Alliance forces can hold out until we've dealt with the enemy. I understand. Good. Then make it happen, Commander. I'll be expecting regular updates on your progress. Hack it out. Okay. Armor mod kit. People accumulated effect the final battle. Tech lab. Adorable. up all right commander the alliance has found a new 
Cerberus lab on Sanctum. Admiral Hackett would like to investigate. Okay. In Prime. Sony. Emergency traffic. Okay, in the name. Okay, good to know. <laughs> Sorry about that. I swear I'm not sick, I'm just fucking coughing. It's annoying. I'm gonna go talk to Super quick. Hey Commander, you know I had my doubts about the Council. But after years of ignoring your warnings, they're finally willing to step up and tell you they just can't help. <laughs> they're doing everything they can. Should they at least validate our parking? <laughs> well, let me know if you want me to get them on the channel and then hang up on them. You know, for old time's sake. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. I'm not gonna open the airlock. That's death. Jug, 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 jug. What's up, trainer? Commander, come to check on your new recruit. Of course. Just wanted to see how you were doing. Still trying to get my bearings. When I was working on the Normandy's upgrades, I left at the end of the day. I didn't even have a toothbrush or a change of clothing until I made some emergency purchases in the Citadel. Next time you need something, just ask. You're not alone here. Oh, it, it, it's no trouble, Commander. <laughs> I'm sure you have larger concerns. We can put in a requisition order. My toothbrush is a Scission Promark 4. It uses tiny <laughs> fields to break up plaque and massage the gums. It costs 6,000 credits. <laughs> okay, yeah. You're on your own with that. <laughs> in any event, <laughs> I appreciate you giving me a chance to Six. Oh. Is there anything else? No. Carry on, specialist. Uh. Let me just go up here quick. Ah. Oh, my face hamster. No. No. Yeah, I like my hoodie. Okay, Brian Cage. Uh, I think I need to go to this one.
And this was Samara's room. Yep. Oh, it's got to be like a VI thing. Thank you. Ready, just doing my thing, checking in on my crew. See if they got anything for me to loot. That's medical lab. Reassign. Oh, that'll be handy. Commander. Hey, what up? Everything okay down here, Doctor? The Alliance team cleaned up and restocked, but it's still my old med bay. Feels like home. Welcome back. Thank you. Let's waste no time. If I may, I'd like to examine you. Yeah, uh, I said sorry. I guess a checkup never hurts. Just no scalpel this time, Doc. Alas, to my great disappointment, it is nothing invasive. I'm just going to run some diagnostics on your implants, and it'll take a few readings. Good. Your implants are showing little sign of rejection. Just keep up that positive outlook of yours, Commander, and your scars shouldn't return. Hey. That's it. You're the picture of health. See you around, Doctor. Take care, Shepard. Oh, shit. Oh, I guess she's here because we could just erect a field she can't get out of. And... Yeah, I was going to say 90% sure this is fucking Liara's place. <laughs> Didn't realize Cole Carnage had his setup in in this room. Wow, fuck. Commander Shepard, it's a pleasure to see you again. Hello. You're the drone from the Shadow Broker ship. Doctor Tassoni now refers to me as Glyph instead of Info Drone, ninety-five percent of the time. If you have a moment, I'd like to draw your attention to a terminal in her office. It analyzes information packages. If you find any useful data, I can research upgrades for you. Hey. And what should I be looking for? I'll inform you if you found relevant data. When you do, return to this terminal for your choices. In the meantime, Dr. Tassoni would like to speak with you. Have a pleasant day. Thank you. Anyone to counsel didn't go too well. Uh. It was less than ideal. At least the council can't deny the Reapers exist. But I'm not sure how much comfort that is while they bicker over which portion of the galaxy to save. Uh... Becoming the big info broker has turned you into a real cynic, Liara. I like it. I'm flattered. I think. <laughs> Get the shield, the shield shrink. Like you brought more than just that drone from your ship. <laughs> a few things were necessary. I'd be a very silent shadow broker without data feeds. So you have access to your resources? What I can get. We'll need it to research this Prothean device. Understandable. Until we understand precisely what it does, it's far too dangerous to use. Great. It'd be nice to know we're not kids playing around with a loaded gun. Absolutely. The damage it could cause if it backfired is unthinkable. This will be difficult even for us. If something happens on a mission, if either one of us are hurt. Oh. Shepard, there's something I need to ask before we go any further. It's been years since we were together. Are you still interested in us? Yes. I didn't forget you, Liara. I want to make us work. Good. I was getting worried. 
There are a lot of reasons I was happy to see you on Mars. I'd like that list, but later. <laughs> There's so much left to do. <laughs> I'm working with Edie. Hopefully we can discover what the Protheans left for us. But I'm looking forward to talking about something other than business. Maybe later. Beep. You can't see it, but there was a thumbs up. I swear, I, I need a little animation or just like a little thumbs up to pop up. Hey, pop up. A new notification is available on the private messages terminal. What? Oh. Thanks, Cliff. Yeah. I think uh, we need to go down one more. Actually, yeah, let's check in with everybody. Because I... Okay. Okay, check you, check you. Get all the rep, everything I can. Yeah. Look at that Paragon level. Rise. We'll start with engineering. Might as well go through everything since, you know, first visit to the ship. Oh, hey. What's up? How's your new assignment working out, Alars? Fairly normal, except for the unshackled AI, Matriarch Venezia's daughter, and the communicator that can reach Earth. The first two, I can deal with. That last one gets my attention. Hmm. So what are you asking for exactly? Anything from Earth is the lead story right now. That's not opinion, it's fact. Fair. Maybe I can pass on a few non-classified progress updates. Seriously? You just doubled my ratings. I don't need FaceTime, just the data upload. Tell people what's really happening on Earth. We need long recruiting lines on every planet after you air a story. I can do this, Commander. Remind me to tell you about the time I made an Elcor cry. <laughs> good shit, good shit. Oh yeah, I guess. An Elk. How the fuck did you make an Elcor cry? I'm actually impressed. Oh hey, Adam. Commander, welcome back to the Normandy. Or maybe you should be saying that to me. Engineer Adams, what are you doing here? I was put in charge of the drive core retrofits. My experience on the Normandy SR-1 made me an obvious choice. So, what do you think of our SR-2? She's incredible. There's one nice thing I can say about Cerberus, it's that they know how to build a ship. And about them, Cerberus, I mean. I owe you an apology. How so? Back when you got this ship, Dr. Chalk was contacting asking me to help with your mission against the Collector. I refused. I didn't have your back. I'm sorry for that. Don't apologize. All good. Your alliance first. That's the way it should be. Thank you, Commander. Glad to be aboard. Carry on, Adams. Aye, aye, ma'am. And I'm checking. I'm just checking everywhere. Hey. Oh shit. What the fuck? Hey. Hey, you little. Wait, what the fuck was that? Is that a pie jack? I. Hamster! Come here! Oh, you little bastard. I'm watching. Where are you? The most difficult enemy I've ever faced. A fucking space hamster. I heard you squeaking. Where are you? Oh, almost had you. 
Okay, I gotta like aim it right. Okay, I'm gonna grab you. All right, come on. Ah. Can I not get it? <sighs> I'll come back here for later. There's probably like food or something. Well, my space hamster back. Oh yeah. Port cargo is locked currently. All right. Oh, hey. Lieutenant Steve Cortez, shuttle pilot. We've got news about our supply chains, Commander. At ease. Nice to meet you, Lieutenant. What's going on? Sorry to just jump in, Commander. There's so much to be done, I get caught up in the tasks at hand. He's always like that. You need to chill out, Esteban. So you do care, Mr. Vega? Or is that Mr. Vesa talking again? So what's happening with our supply chains, Lieutenant? Alliance procurement chains are in chaos, but the Citadel's economy is still running. Okay. I can network to Citadel retailers. You can view inventory and make purchases right from this console. When I network to a new store, I'll let you know. It does cost more to coordinate delivery to the Normandy, so it's cheaper to buy supplies when you're there. So you're my shuttle pilot, but you're setting up procurement chains? I wasn't assigned as Normandy's pilot. Not much need for one on a dry dock ship. But I was overseeing the retrofit of the cargo hold. I'm quite familiar with the operation and maintenance of the UT-47 Kodiak and the M-44 Hammerhead. All right. From my experience, it made sense for me to take over as shuttle pilot when we left Earth. Especially given Mr. Vega's love of mid-air collisions. Ah. To save the day, pendejo. I'm also responsible for logistics, making sure the armory and shuttle are properly stocked and maintained. Keep up the hard work, but don't kill yourself. Yes, Commander. All right, what do we got? Okay. Uh, oof. Oof. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I want that Inferno armor. Spare shot. A city by fifty. Ooh, but give me that inferno armor. Okay, that's for my armor. There we go. Nothing. Not armored targets. Honestly. Uh, oh shit. I have no weapon mods. Weapon upgrades. Uh.
Okay. Oh, he's got a full fucking setup over here. Hey, buddy. Oh. Hi. Come here, come here, come here. Let me pet it. Good dog. <laughs> hey, you got anything in here I can grab? Hey. Hey, Shepard. How'd it go with the castle? Same as usual. Non-committal. Unhelpful. Bet they still wanted you to help them out, no? Yep. We want to rescue a Turian Primarch from Palavan. <sighs> Sounds like fun. Never been to the Turian homeworld. It's a beast. <sighs> you come down here for something? Or are you just looking? <sighs> I did just come to chat. But it might stay for the show. <laughs> <sighs> Have to work harder than that if you want me to blush. <laughs> Not sure what there is to talk about. You already know my service record. I don't actually. I didn't have access to personnel records when we met. Right. Forgot about that. Well, get up. Think you can dance and talk at the same time? Oh, I can dance. Okay, Lola. Let's do this. <laughs> Don't let my good looks fool you, Vega. I got my share of scars. <laughs> you remind me of my old CO. Jab, jab. Oh, yeah. And who was that? Jab, uppercut. Captain Tony. He was a hard ass son of a bitch, but a good leader. No, I'm not. Right hook, left hook. Was. Died with most of my squad, protecting a civilian colony from a collector attack. Jab, uppercut. And the colony? It was either them or the intel we had on the collectors. Intel we could use to destroy them. I chose the intel. Oh. Tough choice, but it was the right call. You think so? I would have done the same. That's what's funny. You were doing the same thing. You took out the collectors. We never needed that intel. You didn't know. You can't blame yourself, Vega. Who says I'm blaming myself? I'm not going for the cheap shots. Just a guess. Are you a shrink too? No, but that stunt back on Mars was reckless. You're lucky to be alive. So? So. Maybe you don't care if you live or die. Or maybe. Oh. I'm just willing to do whatever the fuck it takes to end this goddamn war. Maybe you are. But if you're half as good as I think you are, we need you alive. Thanks for the pep talk. No problem. Anytime. Hey. Thanks for the dance, Lola. Lola, huh? You kind of look like a Lola. <laughs> You're cute. So I'll let you get away with it. For now. That's it. Now you made me blush. <laughs> hey. Okay. Okay, I need yeah, I need twelve points so I can get body charge and Nova maxed and then probably salt. Melee damage. I'm probably gonna go with barrier recharge and durability.
All right. Plus, there's already conquered other creepers. Well, actually, let's, uh, strike a Bissell. Where that is? Next. The strike a Bissell. Up here. Right, Mark. Oh, okay, I guess there's no scan. Alright, let's go do Eden Prime. We only got two right now. Okay, that's that remove mine. It does not. That was my, honestly, my concern. All right, let's see what you got for me. Prime. This is where it all began. Where the Prothean Beacon gave you the vision that warned us about the Reapers. And where you went up against Saren and the Geth for the first time, no? Yes. And now, with Cerberus here, Eden Prime's colonists are under attack again. <laughs> they deserve better. I know. The Alliance did what it could to evacuate colonists, but... Cerberus came in so quickly. If we find survivors, we'll do what we can. What about this artifact? Is it part of the Prothean device we found on Mars? The Alliance didn't get any specifics about what Cerberus has uncovered. But whatever it is, it's better off with us than with Cerberus. Mm. I'm bringing you in as close to the dig site as I can. Thank you. No way we'll avoid detection, but you should have a few minutes. Understood. All right, everyone. Get ready to move. With luck, we can get to the dig site before Cerberus knows we're here. Here's open. Come back from this. 
The city on Earth where I grew up was hard and dirty. You can see it as a war zone. Even Prime doesn't deserve this. Nobody does. Look at that. Bits of Prothean tech sticking out of the ground like an old bone. Hey, Liar. You ever find dinosaurs while you're digging around? <laughs> no. Dinosaurs and other fossils would be paleontology. I'm an archaeologist. I study artifacts left by sapien species. The two fields are completely different. And... Uh, you were joking. There you go. Hey, I just like dinosaurs. I'll take any salvage currently. Okay, grenades. Uh, pacified neighborhoods. Shepard, this server said you could help the colonists still alive on other parts of Eden Prime. How? I can get this intel to Eden Prime's resistance. Maybe it will help them fight back against Cerberus. Good. Fuck you, Cerberus. There. That's the elevator that leads down into the dig site. I'm just checking to make sure we're not gonna get fucked. Gonna have to hop off for a bit? Alright. Well, thanks for looking for a while, Akira. Goddess, that doesn't seem possible. What's up? It's not a Prothean artifact. It's... Reaper? Prothean. You oh. mean the collector? Those things the Reapers turn the Protheans into? No, an original unmodified Prothean who's still alive. Say what? You're right. That doesn't sound possible. You saw Prothean stasis chambers in the archives on Ilos. The only reason those failed was a lack of power. But Cerberus found this in an underground bunker. It still has power. It's just He's an... been in stasis for the past 50,000 years, waiting for us. Think of what we could learn. Then I'm glad you're here. Prothean expert. I hope I can help. If this single Prothean was sent into stasis, he could be the foremost scientist of his time, or perhaps the wisest counselor. <sighs> Cerberus damaged the life pod when they excavated it. The life signs are unstable. Hydration complete. Let's get him out of there. No, breaking open the pod would kill him. We have to find the command signal that ends the stasis mode. We also need to figure out how to physically open the pod without doing more damage. Cerberus took over the labs nearby to research what they found at the dig site. That's likely. I heard a carbonated plan. drink. Yes, that's hydration. Oh fuck. Heads up. Well, they know we're here. And yes, that is hydration. Thank you very much. Oh, oh, he's in. Okay, I was like, why the fuck I can't I shoot him? And then I'm like, oh, he's in stasis. Fine. If it makes you feel better, this is not carbonated. This is just water. Hydration complete. That better? I have two here. One is carbonated. One is non-carbonated. Resistance. Okay. Intel to help the colonists. The more we find, the better chance they'll have. Okay, we went up there. Oh. Oh, jeez.
Hey. Okay. Okay. Uh, I was just, I, I was getting fucked up. <laughs> that was dirty. Hi. Oh, you're still alive. Let's change that. There. That lab found footage of the Protheans. Cerberus is studying it to find the stasis deactivation signal. It's there. Oh, jeez. They were gunned down while having drinks and watching the game. Son of a bitch, this was somebody's home. Oh. Who's shooting? Oh, there you are. I was going to show you why that was a terrible fucking idea. Oh, hi. Hi there. There. That lab found footage of the Protheans. Cerberus is studying it to figure out how to physically open the pod. Oh, shit. God damn.
How many have we lost? Reaper forces have destroyed approximately 300,000 life bars. I think I can duplicate that to open the life pod. You understood that? You didn't? No. All I saw was static. Cerberus was trying to make sense of it without success. The Prothean cipher you received on Pharos, it lets you see the images as a Prothean would and understand their language. Mm. Whatever it does, I saw the video and how they sealed the life pods. Perfect. Then we just need the signal they use to activate stasis mode. Okay. Okay. Oh. I thought that was something. It's like, it is not. And so we already checked in here. Yeah. Oh, I can go up here though. Can always check. Never know what you might find. Stompy, 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 stompy. Return to dark space, then we will rise a million strong for the empire. For the empire, get to your stasis pods. Victory, broadcast the stasis readiness signal to all life pods and the refugees who have yet to reach the bunker. Their sacrifice will be honored in the coming empire. Yep. Yeah. I've got the signal the Protheans use to activate stasis mode. Excellent. Then we have everything we need to open the pod. Backup forces are here. Pop your fucking head up.
Okay. Get fucked. Okay, find another way to the pod. Okay, we got it. Okay, where do I go? I'm transmitting the signal. Perfect. It'll take a few moments for the life pod to process it. Lots of bogeys inbound, Commander. We'll have to hold this position.
Okay, now that they're mapped, this is gonna be much more useful. Main reason I'm using my machine pistol right now is just like they're not. I'm not like charging them. Looks like we got a second to catch our breath. Wish my corner man was here. I could use an ice pack. <laughs> Has the life pod ended stasis mode? We're almost there. All right. If anybody's low, there's a Cerberus supply cache in the building next door. I can lay down a singularity to block enemy access. Uh, spoiler, ow. Fucking ow. Good shit. Take him some time to fully regain consciousness. Yeah, no kidding. Now he's up. He just like. Oh, easy, 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 easy. Dude. You just had a fifty thousand year. Is it? Is Be careful. He's confused. <laughs> Remember, it's been fifty thousand years for us, but for him, it's only been a few minutes. No, the bunker is falling. There is no other option. There are pods on that. Those soldiers are still alive. Their sacrifice will be honored in the Cunning Empire. Preparing neutron bombardment. Get to your life pod now.
clarify. Sensors are damaged. Automated reactivation is not an option. You will remain in stasis until a new culture discovers this bunker. This may lead to a power shortage. Do not shut off more pods. I need the few that are left. Power needs will be triaged appropriately. You will be the voice of our people. Hmm. Damn. Yabek. How many others? Just you. <clears throat> you can understand me? Yes. Now that I have read your physiology, your nervous system, not to understand your language. So you were reading me while I was seeing you? Our last moments. Our failure. Your people did everything they could. They never gave up. And I could use some of that commitment now. Shepard, whatever you did got Cerberus interested. Asari. Human. I'm surrounded by primitives. <laughs> it's not safe here. Will you join us? You fight the Reapers? Yes. Then we will see. Boy. A living Protean. That's correct, Admiral. But he's not quite what we expected. Commander, our scientists barely understand what they need to do here. If the Protean can help us construct this device, we need his cooperation. Understood, Admiral. We're losing colonies faster than we can evacuate. We've never seen a force like the Reapers. He has, Admiral. Can he help us? I intend to find out. Good. Cerberus slipped up and gave us a new weapon. Don't let it go to waste. Hack it out. Shepard, I need you down in the port cargo hold. It's about our new guest. Oh boy. I'm on my way. What's the problem? I've tried to make the room more accommodating, but they're not letting me talk to him. Apologies, Doctor. Contact protocol with a new species. Assume hostility. We had to dust off the regulations. But he's not new. I've spent my life studying Protheans. At ease. I don't think our guest will be a problem. Will he? That depends on you. I can sense fear in you. Anxiety and distress. The Reapers are winning. What do you mean, you sense? All life provides clues for those who can read them. It is in your cells, your DNA. Experience is a biological marker. Then what exactly did I experience back on Eden Prime? That was a hell of a flashback. The battle left its own mark on me. I communicated this to you. It can work both ways. Like your beacons? Yes. Which? saw it all. Our destruction. Our warning. Why weren't they here? Why didn't you prepare for the Reapers, human? It's Commander. And nobody could understand your warnings. The beacon nearly killed me. <sighs> then communication is still primitive in this cycle. We pieced together what we could and used it to stop a Reaper invasion three years ago. Then the extinction was delayed. Now we have your plans for the device. We're going to build it. Device? The weapon your people were working on. I'd hoped you could tell us how to finish it. Hmm. We never finished it. It was too late. Then I'd 
take it you don't know anything about the catalyst. No. I was a soldier, not a scientist. Skilled in one art, killing. What was your mission? Among my people, there were avatars of many traits. Bravery, strength, cunning. A single exemplar for each. Which are you? The embodiment of vengeance. I am the anger of a dead people, demanding blood be spilled for the blood we lost. Only when the last mover has been destroyed will my purpose be fulfilled. There's no other reason to exist. Those who share my purpose become allies. Those who do not become casualties. Nothing in our fight against the Reapers has been that cut and dried. Because you still have hope that this war will end with your honor intact. Nah. I do. Stand in the ashes of a trillion dead souls and ask the ghosts if honor matters. This silence is your answer. We found this at the dig site. I assume it belongs to you. It is a memory shard. Could it help us with the device? No. It contains only pain. But I will help you fight. And the last thing the Reapers hear before they die will be the last voice of the Protheans sending them to their grave. If you don't mind, I have a few more questions I'd like to ask. Here it comes. I've written over a dozen studies on your species. I've published in several journals that... Amusing. Asari have finally mastered writing. <laughs> I'm sorry. Never mind. What do you wish to know? We've never seen a species with this sensory ability you have. It was common among my people. Imparting experience through touch. The chemistry of life. Complicated ideas could be absorbed in seconds. That sounds very useful. We evolved as hunters. Reading a thousand details in our environment ensured our survival. I'm beginning to understand the beacons a bit more. Later, we developed technology to harness our ability. Information could be stored in certain objects through touch. Oh. Memory has its own biomarkers, its own chemistry, as do knowledge and skills. The beacons could remember these things. Things like Reaper invasions. Yes. I can still sense the turmoil in you, witnessing the extinction of our empire. The fabric of your being was forever marked that day. So, could you read something about this room? There was liquid, a form of incubation, the DNA of a Krogan who lived here. He was powerful, prone to violence. Brunt. I'm impressed. His name was Grunt. And if he were my enemy, I would have given him a wide berth. There is great strength in his genes. Liara here would never forgive me if I didn't ask you. What was Prothean civilization like? Yes, I've always wondered. What sort of government did you have? And can you tell me about your religious beliefs or perhaps the... <laughs> we are dead now. What does it matter? I'm sorry. Studying your history has been a lifelong passion of mine. When I was born, our empire was already at war with the Reapers. Ah. The first thing I remember was seeing my planet on fire. What was your civilization like before the Reaper attack? We were the dominant race of our cycle. We ruled the galaxy. My studies indicated you were the only race engaged in space travel at the time. I always found that curious. We were one empire composed of many subjects. All eventually called themselves Protheans. What if they didn't want to? They weren't given a choice. Is there anything more you can tell us about this device your people were trying to build? We heard only stories. They said our scientists were constructing a great machine that had the power to defeat the Reapers. You never saw it? By that point, the Empire was smashed into pieces. None of us knew 
what the others were doing. Well, if we don't finish it soon, the same will be true of us. Thank you for talking with me. I never imagined actually meeting a Prothean. This has been amusing. Oh? To discover the most primitive races of my time now rule the galaxy. The Asari, the humans, the Turians. There's also the Salarians. The lizard people evolved? I believe they're amphibian. They used to eat flies. <laughs> Javik. Though I still need time to recover, the shock has not worn off yet. I understand. This must be a hell of an experience for you. We're just glad to have you aboard, Javik. <laughs> yeah. He's just like, Jesus. Six. Okay. Uh. Because if I can get Slam back, that would actually be very useful. Because I'll be honest, I'd fucking replace Shockwave. Okay. Up to two additional targets. Nova.
There we go. Biotic Charms, Nova, and this. This is, oh God, this is gonna be, this is gonna be all sorts of nasty. Non-essential correspondence from your allied forces. Dr. Tassoni has granted you access. Okay. You all right? Hello yeah. again, Shepard. What's been happening with you is the broker, Leah? It's been exciting. The old broker's ship, impressive, but it was never meant to be space-worthy, which meant the elusive man eventually tracked me down on Hagalaz. What happened? I knew he was coming. Theron and I loaded as much of the ship's specialized hardware onto a shuttle as we could. We got away from Cerberus's ships after arranging an appropriate distraction. <laughs> what kind of distraction? Sending the broker ship exploding into a Cerberus cruiser. Oh! I don't think the elusive man expected me to give up my resources in such a spectacular fashion. So did I. He still operate as the broker without the ship? Well, I couldn't let the elusive man have it. I saved what was crucial. My network of agents is intact, although the Reapers have taken a toll on their numbers. Okay. It's taking a while to reestablish contact. So where is Theron if you two escaped? He convinced me he was recovered enough to work. And I do need more agents. Agent Farron didn't report any injuries during his last call to you, Doctor. True. Given what he survived, I should probably worry less. We'll talk later, Liara. Of course. There we go. All right. Can we just go back down there. Oh, hey, good shit. Good shit. Give me one second.
Go rescue the Primark. Oh, there's a fuel depot, thank fuck. All right, let's go. Don't. All right, let's go. Are those like Turian escort ships? Oh, and those are Reapers. Oh boy. Stealth mode engage. military in the galaxy and the reapers are obliterating it was it like this on earth yeah yes Shepard I'm so sorry yeah commander the LZ is getting swarmed oh boy James open that hatch I want I want slam to be in my LB. Alright, get in, get out. Let's move. 
Skeet shoot. Thank you. Gotta salvage what I can first. Good. Bong. Oh, he didn't do sniper. Try them again. Respectfully, sir. Been getting Domestic, get your men up on that north barricade. Yes, sir. Sergeant Barnes, find a way to get that comm tower operational. Sir. General. Commander Shepard, heard you were coming, but I didn't believe it. General Corinthus. I've come to get Primarch Fedorian. Primarch Fedorian is dead. His shuttle was shot down an hour ago as it tried to leave the moon. That's gonna complicate things. I'm sorry. I hear he was a good man. And a friend. He would have been an outstanding diplomat. So what happens now? The Turian hierarchy provides very clear lines of succession. Right. General Corinthus? With such heavy casualties, it's hard for me to be certain who the next Primarch is. Palavan Command will know. However, at the moment, contacting them is impossible. The comm tower is out. Pasks are swarming that area. We can't get close enough to repair it. Don't worry, General. I'll get your tower operational. Thank you, Commander. I'll take care of things on this end. All right, let's go. Tower to the left of the main barricade in front of Palavin. Let's go. Yeah, I got you.
There we go. Get up here. Picking around. Any salvage, any supplies. Shit. Oh. Oh, we got backup. Skate you. Ah, skeet shooting. Commander Shepard, come in. What's up? I have information from Palavin Command. Please return ASAP. On our way. Ah, I remembered why I loved playing a fucking Vanguard in this game. <laughs> Succession is usually simple, but right now, the hierarchy's in chaos. So many dead are MIA. I need someone, I don't care who, as long as they can get us the Turian resources we need. I'm on it, Shepard. We'll find you the Prime Mark. Hey! I know that voice. Garrus. Vicarian, sir. I didn't see you arrive. Oh, he said... At ease, General. Woo! James, this is Garrus Vicarian. He helped me stop the Collectors. He's a hell of a soldier. Lieutenant, good to see you too, Liara. Good to see you in one piece, Garrus. General Corinthus filled me in. We know who we're after. Palavan Command tells me that the next Primarch is General Adrian Victus. Victus? His name's crossed my desk. Know him, Garrus? I was fighting alongside him this morning. Lifelong military, gets results, popular with his troops. Mm. Not so popular with military command. Has a reputation for playing loose with accepted strategy. You think he can get the job done? We both know conventional strategy won't beat the Reapers. Right now, he could be our best shot. And I trust him. Okay, let's get him on the shuttle and get out of here. Commander! Shepard, come in! Oh, shit. Can this wait, Joker? We're in the middle of a war zone. Shutting down systems, powering up weapons. I can't find the source. 
I need the Normandy standing by. We may have to bug out. Should I go back and take a look? Do it. Okay. Garrus, you said you were with Victus this morning? Yeah, but we got separated. He went to bolster a flank that was breaking. Could be anywhere out there. We're trying to raise him, Commander. Mm. Incoming harvester! Headed for the airfield! General, tell Primarch Victus we'll rendezvous here. In the meantime, let's go take care of whatever that thing dropped off. Coming, Garrus? Are you kidding? I'm right behind you. Ha! Hell yes. Concussive shot is going to be nasty. Wait, do I have Oh yeah, I was gonna say, no, I want your fucking overload. I was like, Garrus, get behind cover for fuck's sakes. Oh wow, he fucking bounced. I think we're done here. Good shit. We might be done here, but gotta check for supplies and scavenge. Good, we're good, we're good. Let me in. Shepard, come in. Come in. Go ahead. Still trying to raise the Primark, but we've got trouble back here at the main barricade. If the Reapers breach it, we're done. On my way. Going, 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 going. Turret sections.
boy. Oh, fuck. Oh, please give me some good news. What's the word of the Primarch? Still can't get a stable comm link. Okay, I'm going on foot. Shepard out. Garrus, take me to the last place you saw Victus. Okay. Should be pretty quick unless we find trouble. Spoiler, there's probably going to be trouble. Damn it. Look at Palamon. That blaze of orange. The big one. That's where I was born. That's rough. Still have family there? My dad. How bad is it? Three million lost the first day. Five the second. Oof. How's your military holding up? Look around. That should give you some idea. They putting up a good fight. For now. But how long does it take before the fight's kicked out of them? If they'd only listened to your warnings about the Reapers, we might have been ready. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Hard to figure how you prepare for something like this. That just looks so fucking cool. chance we've got. None of us is beating the Reapers alone. Oh. Soldier, you okay? Yes, sir. We'll make it. Have you seen General Victus? Half hour ago. And it's stealth. Okay, good luck. Yes, sir. Commander, how many troops in that crash? 50? 75? Not sure. Sounds right. Hard to see a beautiful ship like that go down. Oh, Woo! That was a little closer than I'd like. I'll say. Yeah. No survivors. Damn it. A crash like that is not surprising. Reaper sons of bitches. So Lola, you really think this summit will work? I mean, Asari? Salarians? Where's the Krogan and Batarians? Where's the meat? It's not that easy. The Batarians took the first hit when the Reapers arrived. Not much left of them. And the Krogan have never forgiven us for the Genophage. Right. Turians sterilized them. Salarians came up with it. And the Krogan hate them both for it. So they won't be joining us. <laughs> Too bad. I fought with the Krogan. They're tough sons of bitches. Yeah. Just checking around every corner. Yeah. Hey, double time. 
No Reapers taking this Primarch from me. Right behind you. Doggy. He's a big nasty fuck, ain't you? Moving to the compound. Moving. Right behind you. Going, going, going. Okay. Get fucked. Oops, wrong one. Hi. Okay. General Victus? Yes? I'm Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Not Commander. I know who you are. I can't wait to find out what brings you out here. Vicarian, where did you go? Heavy Reaper unit on the right flank. I believe your exact words were, get that thing the hell off my men. Appreciate it. General, you're needed off planet. I've come to get you. It will take something beyond important for me to leave my men or my Turian brothers and sisters in their fight. Fedorian was killed. You're the new Primarch. You're needed immediately to chair a summit and represent your people in the fight against the Reapers. spent my whole life in the military. I'm no diplomat. I hate diplomats. War is your resume. At a time like this, we need leaders who've been through that hell. I like that. You're right. And honestly, uniting these races may take as much strength as facing the Reapers. You see this devastation, Primarch? Double that for Earth. I need an alliance. I need the Turian.
give me a moment to say goodbye to my men. Without him down here, there's a good chance we lose this moon. Without him up there, there's a good chance we lose everything. Look at that. And they want my opinion on how to stop it? Failed CSEC officer, vigilante, and I'm their expert advisor? Yep. Think you can win this thing, Shepard? Yeah. I don't know, Garrus, but I'm sure as hell gonna give it my best shot. I'm damn sure nobody else can do it. For whatever it's worth, I'm with you. Welcome aboard. Are you ready, Primarch Victus? One thing. Hmm. Commander, I appreciate your need for our fleets, but I can't spare them. Not while my world is burning. But if the pressure could be taken off Palavin... That's a pretty tall order. Yeah. We need the Krogan. I can't see us winning this thing without them. Get them to help us, and then we can help you. The Krogan? Looks like your summit just got a lot more interesting. <laughs> He needs to go talk to Rex. The Asari have been down this road before, Commander Shepard. But, Madam Counselor, let me... I tried to smooth things over with the Samarian Dalatras. To say she's upset would be a monumental understatement. Some of these issues are hundreds of years old. Time to let go. Sad to say, but any effort to ally these disparate groups seems doomed to failure. And I'm sure you understand that we cannot afford to waste time with the Reapers knocking at our door. This must be my final word. I'm sorry, but the Asari will not be at your summit. Our alliance would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. I wish you luck, Commander. Go fuck Commander. yourself. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on midcom. <sighs> yes, sir. But the Asari are staying on the sidelines. They'll regret that. The time for unity is now. The Salarians will be there, though. You don't sound very optimistic. We expect the Krogan will be joining us, too. I see. Well, then you've got your hands full, Commander. Was there something else you needed to discuss? Hmm. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Commander, thank you for allowing me the use of your ship, and for going along with this plan. Garrus said he had to attend to the Normandy's weapon systems. Something about calibrations. This sounds like Garrus. I'm sorry to say the Asari counselor won't be joining us. She thinks there's too much bad blood with the Krogan. She may be right, but there'll be a lot more blood. Real blood, if we don't try. When you put it that way. The sooner we have this summit, the sooner we'll know. Is there something else I can help you with? How is it being the Primarch? <laughs> Not what I imagined. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away, reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be with my men, so there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I understand. Leaving Earth to save it, it's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of you. You never ask to be a leader, yet your people will die if you refuse. We find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. Thank you, Primarch. My thoughts are with Palavin. And mine with Earth. Thank you. Very nice. All right. Then 
and this is uh, the CIC. Oh fuck. Commander, EG just went offline. Uh, we have a problem. What do you mean offline? I don't know. She's not responding, and I can't access the AI core diagnostics. You better get down to deck three. Yeah, I'm going right now. Commander, comms systems are going haywire. Whatever's happening. Well, where was? Oh boy. Move! Joker, what's that sound? Fire extinguisher, Commander. Could be an electrical fire or something. I'm going in. Edie, talk to me. Is there a particular topic you wish to discuss, Shepard? Oh! Edie? Yes? You're in Dr. Eva's body. Not all of me, but I have control of it. It was not a seamless transition. Edie, you need to alert us about incidents like this. You shouldn't have done this alone. Bringing the crew up to speed would have been counterproductive. All attempts to help would have been limited by reaction time. So if you're in there, are you still in the ship? I exist primarily within the ship. For optimal control, this unit should remain within Normandy's broadcast or tight beam range. Are you planning to take that body somewhere? Normandy's weaponry is not suited to every combat situation. This platform could provide limited fire ground support. Oh. You mean you could come with us? Correct. This body could accompany you to areas the Normandy cannot reach. Before we do that, I need you to guarantee this mech doesn't have any more surprises in it. Run whatever test you can, then we can talk about using it in combat situations. One moment. I am running trials. Complete. I can send you a full report if you wish. Please, actually. However, my first step should be restoring functionality to the Normandy to reassure the crew that all is normal. Just don't be surprised if the crew's a little wary of your new body. It was shooting at them a little while ago. An excellent point. I will take it to the bridge. Joker will also want to see it. <coughs> On that, we can agree. <laughs> was that Edie who just walked by? Yep. Yes, it was. Oh, Joker is going to have a field day with that. So how may I help you, Commander? How's your inventory of meds? The med bay was fully stocked before you left Earth. We should be good for a long time, even given the amount of fire you take each day. I'll see you around, Doctor. Hey, how dare you. Take care, Shepard. How dare you say something completely mean and accurate. All right. Actually, I want to go up to the captain's cabin quick. Uh, purgatory. Ashley William. Wait, Thane. All right. Well, let me just save, and I am actually going to call the, the stream for today. Thank you all for being here. Oh, Mass Effect Three feels so nice. Take it easy, everybody. Hello, YouTube. All right.
I forgot to do a level up last time, so we're actually going to do that. And uh, health and shield, definitely. Because I don't care about my melee damage. Because I charge people and then I shotgun their faces off. Hey! Hey, Tess. Tess, uh... Uh... Tess, uh, sar. I apologize if I mispronounced that. But I hope you're doing well. But... Alright. Tess, uh, sar. Okay, that actually helps. Thank you. But friends call you Toaster. Okay. Well, I hope one day you will brown my bread. Alright. <laughs> Alright, what do we got to do here? Oh yeah, where were we gonna go? Uh... Sanctum. That's on the Citadel. I need to head there. I can do the mmm if needed. I guess you are literally the epitome of Toaster Go Burr. Whenever I found something suspicious. Oh, hey, what's up? Commander, are you alright? It was fairly intense oh. up here. I can and a lot of people want to take baths with you, so win-win, absolutely. About Edie. I guess it's Edie just your shocking and lightning personality. If she'd told me about her plan to obtain a body, I'd have volunteered to help. I do not wish to force a conflict of interest between our friendship and your duty. I'd have preferred a conflict of interest to a hard restart of half our systems. But thanks, regardless. <laughs> While you're here, though, I found something. While scanning alliance channels. Hey, what's up? Grissom Academy is requesting help. The Reaper invasion front will hit them soon. All right. I thought the war would close most schools. Grissom Academy is more specialized than a normal school. It's home to some of the smartest students humanity has to offer. Their Ascension project helps gifted oh. young biotics. If it had been open 20 I bet you have personality I just been there. It's not an average school. Well, your humble host does aim to please. In whatever way I can, and generally it's just through uh, my soothing dulcet tones. So normally, I'd say we don't need to do anything, but something sounded off in the Turian signal. I had Edie perform an analysis. It's fake. Edie thinks it's Cerberus. She said the fake Turian signal was similar to the one that lured you to a collector ship. Long story. In any event, whoever faked the signal wants us to think Grissom Academy is evacuated. But I believe they're still in danger. Nice work. Good catch. Maybe you belong here after all. If this really is She belongs in many places. Hopefully this operation is something worth investigating. It could be simple disinformation. Trainer. Good catch. <laughs> Thank you, Commander. Not gonna lie, you have daddy energy. Well, thank you very much. And I legitimately do take that as a compliment. All right. But that takes you on a date and gives great aftercare type of daddy? Good, because it is. <laughs> Where's the Citadel again? Oh, it's in the Serpent Nebula. Good, because it is. Hmm. And hey. Pew. And remember with aftercare. Giving can sometimes be just as rewarding as receiving. Always remember that. Remember, it has to go both ways. If you're being a good girl, that is. We are transferring your docking clearance to an alliance official. Oh. Figures. Finally back in action, the alliance already wants us tagged and collared. 
<laughs> Just our way of welcoming you back, Flight Lieutenant. Uh, yes, ma'am. Requesting docking permission. Docking permission granted. Would you like private transport arranged? Uh, let's go to the hospital. I need to get to the hospital. Yes, Commander. Thank you. Well, that's the reaction I was hoping for. It means I'm doing something right. All right. Uh, yes, I know your stock of modified metagel is low, but what the? No. Hey, Thane. This isn't for Say why is he Listen, I am a citizen of Puerto Memorial. I mean, we have several aliens hey. here at this time and we need It's all about equality. Giving, receiving, attending. You got to make it all work. It it can't just go one way. Yeah. Sometimes he's got to get his shadow box in. Absolutely. Commander Shepard. When I heard Earth was under attack, I tried to call. I never got through. Thane. Good to see you staying in shape. My disease kills slowly. With enough care and a healthy lifestyle, it can be delayed for a few years. Of course, my allotted time has come and gone. Now I exercise because it pleases me. What are you doing here? Visiting a friend who got hurt protecting me, Ashley. The dark-haired human woman in intensive care. She will be starting physical therapy with my class soon. That's her. If she means something to you, then I will help how I can. Thane is what is known as a drill. Consider her under my protection. I do not know the... Appreciate it, Thane. Uh, he's more amphibian than anything. to be generous. Kepril syndrome has put most of my other plans on hold. Mm. Do you know how much time you have left? I've been to several doctors. My favorite gave me three months. He looks like a fish with armor. Nine months I ago. don't know the exact origins of the Drell species. No placed on me. No responsibilities. No fears. It is a good end. It does have a very soothing voice, I'll say that much. Are you in a lot of pain? At times. The oxygen transfer proteins don't form correctly. Your human equivalent would be hemoglobin. As a result, my blood is low in oxygen. No matter how much I breathe in, I get tingling, numbness. And that is the best of it. Oh. As for my brain, I cannot track the damage. I just experience dizziness from time to time. I wish the best for you, Thane. And I for you. Do not grieve for me. I have good doctors. My son visits regularly. Perhaps we will keep up via the extranet now that you are free. Until we meet again, Shepard. Thanks, Thane. You're a bro. He is one of your party members in Mass Effect 2. He is an extremely, extremely good hitman. And I'm not talking about just hitting that. He's uh, one of your, also, if uh, you're femship like I am, if you choose to, you can romance him in uh, Mass Effect 2. So, hey, what can I say? Some people want some amph amphibidic. What? President Huerta died of a stroke two years ago, ma'am. I think you meant to say the man was dead for an hour and a half and his political enemies piled on enough propaganda to get the hospital name changed. He can't remember his own name without the VI in his head telling him what it is. Trust me, in this building, I do not know no I'm already sorry for him. What's going on here? Ma'am, I'll cut you a deal. You buy us 90 million credits worth of life-saving equipment, and you can name the hospital whatever you want. <laughs> and now the truth comes out. My job here is done. Fuck off. Uh, do I have the credits? Yeah, I do. I will grab some extra Metagel. I mean, I do not know him, but I know. Yes, he has a, a condition known as, uh, I believe they call it Kepril Syndrome. And he described it as basically uh, his hemoglobin, or the uh, equ drill equivalent, does not transfer properly. Basically, he's got a long-term wasting disease. It was an absolute fucking badass in ME2, though. Captain with the fucking sniper rifle. Yes, I am sorry to hear the call to Grissom Academy. They have biotic amp interfaces. I may be able to 
I love sniper character. Oh, then you'll love Captain Big Blue when you see him. I'll put it simply, the other person who's a sniper in this is one of the most beloved characters in this series. Oh, and just to, just to give you a heads up, if you do end up sticking around for a while, I make a lot of innuendos and I make a lot of lewd references. So if I go too far, I do apologize. It's just in my it's. Listen to me, those prototypes are vital. We that is not a problem. Well, then I think you may enjoy your time here. <laughs> Apologize if I'm being quiet right now. I'm just finishing my morning coffee. Where are you? <coughs> well, that was pleasant. Coffee went down the wrong poop, wrong tube. I was gonna say wrong pipe, but that could be. I'd like an answer, Lieutenant Commander. The galaxy has need of exceptional soldiers like you no more than ever. I still need time. You'll have my answer soon. I promise. I look forward to it. Shepard. Hey, as long as there's consent, there's nothing wrong with going down a different Make pipe. A decision yet? On becoming a Spectre? Not yet. It's an honor and all. But I don't know. I need to think about it some more. It's a big decision. Smart to give it some thought. Like when I need a person, yeah. I'm like, I... Pick this up for you. <laughs> you had some downtime? Thanks. That's sweet. I've been climbing the walls. How are you doing? Good, considering. The nurse said you checked in on me earlier. Still out cold, I guess. <laughs> we didn't have time to talk. I thought maybe if you were up for it. Yeah, I wasn't sure you wanted to. You were pretty clear on Mars about where things stood. What do you mean? You're not a part of Cerberus anymore. Case closed. Full stop. Yeah. It's the truth. Okay. You cut all ties. I accept that. It's just that if you're giving me orders, I need to be able to count on you. That works both ways. It's a damn mess out there. All we've got is the people around us. Mm -hmm. We have to trust each other or this doesn't work. Deal? Deal. When you're back on your feet, we'll talk some more. Shepherd, you're indominant. Wait, but now you're... there's one I more mean, thing. what? I wasn't sure if oh. I should mention it. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> I have family back on Earth. I... I haven't heard from them. It's making me crazy. But I know you have walked into the wrong you stream know. if you think you are the dom here. I'm sorry. I've got time to talk. I should get back to it. Take care of yourself. Will do, Commander. And I, I'm not one much for the bondage. It's just it's more fun to just tell them. What you want them to do and they just do it because you know you know tying down can be fun but <laughs> uh, welcome to the stream Because you're giving off some uh, some switch energy. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm just amused by this. Various tags of interest to you are highlighted on the elevator menu. Why are you laughing? Because it's funny fucking with a switch who who thinks they're swinging one way or the other currently, and then just making them go brr, brain brain go brr. Bay. Wait, please. My family's on board. Just 
split them lands. I'll pay. This isn't about money. The words are already at capacity for rent. Sure you can't squeeze in a few more people, officer. And who the heck are you? Oh, Commander Shepard. Yeah, that's what I thought. If that's what you think, I'll uh, Back find them. Back around my... So my family can dock? Commander uh, Shepard says your family's clear. Uh, and five me meter pink rope. Oh, you're a Shibari. Thank you, Commander. Nothing wrong with that. That's always fascinating to hear about. Oh yeah, I, I, and yeah, I know terminology. <laughs> I have to add these fine ways to tie my. Hi. Hey. What was your name again? Christoph Wasser. Good to meet you. How long have you been here? I bet you know a lot more than just terminology. Depends on who you ask. And how nicely you ask. Checking around. But who knows, I could just be all talk. Oh, by the way, this is Big Blue. This is Garrus, the other sniper Shepard. character. What's happening? We convinced the council to accept our wounded. Nowhere else to go. How bad is it? More dead than injured. 85% killed in action. We'll need a morgue soon. Not a lot of flesh wounds when you're fighting rapers. Do what you can for them. A few of them might get back on their feet, but the rest... Sympathy is about all we can offer. Any sign of your family? Not yet, but I keep hoping. What about you? I'm starting to see some wear and tear. I felt better. I won't lie. It's been rough. Well, nothing long will live. Forget to come up for air. There's a lot <laughs> more to go. That's actually a vape. That, you know, sometimes things can be a little rough, but you know, you got to come up for air. Sometimes just a bit of air. Sometimes that's all you need. <laughs> uh, this is just amusing to me now. Oh, nice. <laughs> you walked into the BDE. Welcome to the sound studio. And hey, there's... This is how I always think about it. As long as... Here, catch this. Oh shit. What am I catching? So it's a deal then. Indeed, it is a deal. Officially, welcome to the sound studio. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select. I see you decided to make a deal with me. One moment, please. <laughs> now arriving at Presidium Commons. Listen. Depending, we can always, there's always deals to make. Depends on what you're aiming for and what you're interested in. So you want us to enlist as soldiers? Isn't there anything else we can do? The military needs everyone they can get. None of us knows how to fight. Mackenzie's a biotic. Dave and Graham go to the pistol range. No. Oh. And Orion's always buying mods for his shotgun. I'm the one he's never even fired. 
You two could save lives by helping doctors in the refugee camps. Yeah. Um, thanks. Who was that? The first team inspector. Wow, Commander Shepard. Yeah. What's up? Yeah, that's good advice. Let's sign up as med tent volunteers. How's that sound? By the way, this is one of the most creative ways to thank for the follow I've ever seen. Hey, I I endeavored to do my best. Ooh, what do we got? What do we got? The book of Plenix demands charity. Any opened goods can only be returned for store before. credit. Of course, the book of Plenix was lost in our home world. Thank you. Come again. Uh, can we get a special deal? Depends on what you're interested in. Okay, here's the deal. I'm listening. Oh, you want that? I don't know. You're asking a lot there. <laughs> hmm. Well, I guess when you put it like that, I guess all I can say is I came. Cultivating serenity is possible even in <laughs> times of crisis. I love having uh, no voice redeems. We believe that a peaceful heart is a strong heart. We appreciate you. <laughs> if you uh, look at uh, the vinyl records, there is actually things you can redeem. All right, good enough. Don't worry, I'll only come if you ask me to. I mean, what? Welcome, Commander Shepard. I didn't say that. I don't know what you're talking about. One moment, please. <laughs> uh, ow, ow, foot, ow, crap, fuck, ow, 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 ow. I'm okay, I'm okay, don't worry, I just... Cramp, cramp foot. <laughs> me when the. Me. <laughs> you when the D too big. Good morning. Oh, hello, Relatable, but hey, yo. Commander Shepard, John Dumbau, Special Tactics and Recon. I've got intel suggesting that high level Hanar officials may be indoctrinated. Oh, that's a damning accusation. What have you got? Evidence of an Alliance Black Ops team raiding a Batarian research station. The Batarians were studying Reaper technology. The Batarians had Reaper technology? The Alliance raid turned into a massacre, and the humans ended up with nothing. Your people faked a power failure to hide the incident. The Batarians would have gone to war if they'd found out. But how does this implicate the Hanar? They maintained discreet gray market trade relationships with the Batarians and led the Alliance to the station. Hmm. We suspect those Hanar operatives escaped with Batarian tech. If your reports on the Reapers are accurate, they could already be indoctrinated. What's your source on all this? It was an anonymous gift, but I believe it came from a thief named Kasumi Goto. I've oh. been after her for years. Kasumi? Oh, I know Kasumi. A master thief. Her intelligence and skill are almost Solarian. She was part of my party in Mass Effect 2. Praise from the Spectre who's chasing her down. I only need her data. I admire her personally. And since she sent me this, I assume her feelings are mutual. I'll help. What do you need me to do? The Hanar operative is now a diplomat on the Citadel. I don't have a public name, and the Hanar will go to ground if I make a formal inquiry. So we're hunting? I'm tracking suspicious transmissions to the Hanar homeworld. I could use your help. Let me see what I can dig up at the Spectre office. Thanks, Shepard. And for the record, 
Not everyone doubted your concerns about the Reapers. I just hope we're not too late. Watch your ass in hell. What are you talking about? I'm going up. So, remember when you helped me get KG's gray box from Donovan Hawk? The one with information that could start a war. Oh, yeah. Information like an Alliance Black Ops raid on a Batarian research lab? I figured it wouldn't hurt to leak it now. Especially if there really is an indoctrinated jellyfish out there. Crazier than usual. Let me know how the audio levels are, by the way. Maybe I can help you dig up some dirt on the Hanar. Always checking out if I'm uh, coming through as uh, nice as I want. They're good. Good to hear. Good to hear. All right. Let me check. Uh... Bye, perhaps. Level. Let's go. Custody. Peacefully. Uh, oh, authorize. I'd love to hear you closer to my ear, but will I do what I can? I don't know. I can't really get more up on the mic. Shepard, I'm checking security reports. Can you track the transfers coming from the Hanar Embassy? On it. So you approve of Val? Absolutely. Hey, just checking all this. He's a good specter. But I can really... But that would mean you're the top. Because if anything, especially this, this is a sound studio. I am the top here. <laughs> You're dealing with the type of pipe you haven't dealt with before. You can try. And I, I applaud you for your best efforts. But I'm not sure if it's uh might be a bit too much pipe for you. Okay, I Oh yeah, I think I need I need to go back to the comments because I missed the thing. It ain't, I swear. Uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know, you seem a little nervous. Is things getting a little warm for you? Uh, oh yeah, I want to go to Meridian. Mark. I think I've noticed Ellie is a little antsy. Oh. He was great even before he deployed. And if I pretend to be happy over the fence, mm. it's not fair to him or to you. With all the craziness of the world going on, what is it? Uh, it's just fun fucking with people. Hey, you What do we got up here? And I apologize for not continuing with the story right now, but I'm just looking for more, uh, oh God, my brain. Come on. Pull your dick out. Where's your brain at? Okay. Yeah, there we go. I'm looking for more shopping centers just so I have access to them on the Normandy. I came here interested in game, but stayed for daddy. Well, this is Radio Achievements, and I am merely your humble host. I am here to uh, entertain and enthrall in whatever way I can. This is problematic. We must find a way to stabilize the heating unit so the water temperature can remain steady. Okay, we need to go up and around.
is if like any good host, I aim to satisfy as much as I can my guests as much as possible. You know what I mean? Entertaining enough, start dancing on. Oh, I didn't realize we were uh, playing Final Fantasy XIV. Okay. Thank you for shopping. Oh, hey, Eddie. Hello, Shepard. You look like you're gathering data. Oh, you're a radio host yourself? Anything big and world shaking? Oh, congratulations. Well, I'm literally on the other side of the glass. That kind of thing. I was running scenarios in my head to analyze Jeff's behavior. Small radio in school. I believe he has a strong affectionate attachment to me, but he has not stated it to anyone yet. Shepard, you have first-hand sexual experience. <laughs> How do you know when someone is romantically invested? Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. I, I, I went after Liara in Mass Effect 1. Small radio in school? Oh, cool. Uh, well, My job is sign. literally audio you engineer. Them, you know, masking you out, giving you presents, maybe playing music. It's where my name comes from. I lack material wants other than but I, from uh, and my core programming does not assign value to the way you put it, I feel like you would just want to climb on top of the radio tower. It might just be me, though. I, I, you know, I can't really tell. It's got to be natural. You need chemistry. I see. There are a number of pharmaceuticals I could inject to simulate a desired emotional state. Mm. No, I mean relax and do something you both like. Something simple. For example, you both like humor. Correct. I will see if there are comedic entertainment shows being presented on the Citadel. There you go. Scanning. Do you think you would like the man who hung himself? It appears to be about an amorous plastic surgeon. I took a short course so I can kind of come to the studio and host all by yourself. Oh, good on you. Uh, yeah, I... And yes, yes, I do. <laughs> now, basically, uh, I'm an audio engineer for a terrestrial station around where I am. I see. I believe you have improved my chances, Shepard. Thank you. So yeah, I'm n uh, at work. I'm never in front of the mic. I'm pushing the things and uh, wanting to. Uh, Bash some uh, guests' heads across the desk because they don't understand mic technique. But that's more of a personal idiom and annoyance. Never heard, but I ain't from America. I'm neither am I. Nothing I can do without a sales rep. Look, he is not going to leave. The sooner you refund him, the sooner you go home. Yeah, you're right. Let's get this over with. Here, I've sent you a full refund. Welcome to Agor. Yeah, what do we got? Really? Yes. Do you need it? Of course I do. A full refund? Agor Munitions. For deals you never see coming. Credits. Oh, wow. Thank you for shopping at Agor hey. Munitions. Hey. Welcome to Super Okay, we got anything here? Ooh, that's a nice sniper. I'm from a place that is, uh, let's just say it's in the north, and it's quite uh, chilly. You need 200, 250. Why do you need that many? Let me just see for my own amusement. That just makes me stretch. Unfortunately, the humble host does not stretch. And hey, the easiest way to get channel points is just to stick around and chill. Hey, Commander, check it out. Big news. The Blasto movie is breaking opening week records. There's also a big expose <laughs> on Quasar tournaments. Tips on how to make your apartment look bigger. 
and oh yeah, a big ass reaper invasion. <laughs> These people have no idea. You wanted to hear it? When big events shake up the galaxy, people cling to what's familiar. You say that like it's a good thing. No. I mean, it's better than riots in the streets. I guess. I just wish there were a middle ground. You know, a little less gardening advice, a little more war prep. It'll happen once there's something people can do to help. I have a feeling you want to hear many things from me. The unshackled AI walking around the Presidium. She run into any trouble? No, no, she's my mobility assistance mech. <laughs> Thanks to Vrolic syndrome, I'm legally entitled to bring her everywhere. Finally getting some use out of those disabilities. Wait, benefits. so you're not? I'm sure she appreciates getting out to see the sights. Ah, she's earned a little shore leave. I, maybe. <laughs> Uh, oh, I got to go to Apollo's Cafe and talk to Liara. Because that's my blue romance lady. I remember you two. Michael and Rebecca, right? Listen. Do whatever is best for your family. Just do it soon. Things are bad out there. We will. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk to Liara. Hey, girl. Still working? Hello, my lovely lady. To another, and here I was hoping I'd have time to enjoy the view. Yes, I'm enjoying the view. What? I mean, Last what? Time I saw the Presidium. Remember how it was all rubble after Sovereign I was attacked? thinking from... I just today from third shop got some... I feel like I could solo God and take his thing. Hmm. Eh. That was looking good. I barely got to see the Presidium before half of it got crushed. <laughs> and by the time they repaired it... it and was I will say... Next invasion. Generally, almost everyone we should stock up on gorgeous while we can. Uh, take Such out as? the E. So heavy arms, mercenary groups. Hang on, I'm... Just relax we'll more. People. Take a moment for yourself now and then. I know, I know. G-O-R-G-E-O-U-S is, I believe, how you spell Talk gorgeous. He'll point you to some mercenaries willing to join us. Oh, perfect. I believe. Uh, yes. And if I believe that's how you spell gorgeous, if not, uh, yeah. I think I'm like, uh, I believe that's it. All right, I got to go talk to Bar Levon. Hey. My degree's in audio engineering, not spelling, thank fuck. And I will say this. Generally, everyone in this game has a monster booty. Like, your characters, anyway. Commander Shepard. It's been some time. Barlavon, in case you've forgotten. Financial advisor. And an acquaintance of Admiral Anderson. Relatable. I admire the courage it took for him to stay and fight on your home world. We need more people like Anderson if we're going to win this. Agreed. That's where I can help you. Oh. A sizable mercenary group is offering their services to anyone who can rescue them from Reaper-controlled territory. Oh. Evacuate them, and they'll join your army. Oh, good to hear. I appreciate the information. Just don't wait too long to act on it. The Reapers are advancing all too quickly. Come see me once you've completed the extraction. I'll be in my office a while longer. Just for the sake of clarity, I'm over 18, so everything's cool. Well, I, I appreciate that. 
I'm over that age as well. So I'm not that worried. Also, I have a feel I had a feeling if you were considering I do have the mature warning sticker on the stream. Commander Shepard, please select a yeah. destination. What I could even rent a car if I wanted. Now arriving at ward level purgatory. <laughs> Can I? Gotta watch our backs. Not much we can do with this new detail anyway. What are we? A couple of mall cops? Should just shot the bastard when we have a chance. Well, I am going into a club, so there may be. Who knows? Might get a little intoxicated. Might be open to different things. Who knows? I know people are complaining. We're doing what we can with what we've got here, but let me finish. Our power grid can only handle so much power before it shuts down. Just please don't do anything stupid. Hey, you ready to get this party started? Yeah. Hey, well, uh, Me? People acting dumb. Uh, no, I am not that type of... I very rarely get intoxicated. And, uh... I'm... Okay, you think I'm flirty now? I am quite the flirty drunk. I'll say that much. You should... You should be here for like one of my drunkest dungeon streams. I think you'd uh, quite enjoy that. And of course, the, the point of alcohol and drinking is to lower inhibitions and say things or do things you normally wouldn't. Sorry, I, I was looking at the characters, but because the hip cuts, honestly, I think that's just a really neat look. I'm to ask what tea you want. Uh, I said being alcohol just lowers your inhibitions and uh, gets you uh, talking about things or, you know, acting in silly ways. I love uh, for me intoxication is a uh, very rare occurrence especially on stream like I, it's like you think I'm flirty and silly now get like two things of uh, hibiki whiskey in me so you admit hey. you and your son were here illegally yes and it only took CSEC three weeks to figure it out I don't care who you are you're required to go through processing like all other refugees come with me <laughs> I don't think so. Shirk, get me the Asari counselor. Greetings, Arya. Is there something you need? I'm being asked to submit to immigration. Oh, but when is that one day? Well, since you followed, you'll be able, you'll know when I'm uh, live, so that'll help. What else can I do for you? Nothing. Thank you. My pleasure. Oh. I think we're done here. Damn. Enjoy the show, Shepard? Yes. I that guess was... there's one rule on the Citadel, huh? I guess so. I hate this place. So sickeningly uptight. Why'd you leave Omega? Then why are you here? Yeah. Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top of my ship. He will pay for every second I 
life spent in this bureaucratic hellhole. <laughs> At least you escaped to fight another day. And that day is coming. I'll take Omega back, but I'll get to that. You're here because I have a proposition. Oh. I'm, I'm listening. I was going to say, I'm listening. I see it. If you don't defeat the Reapers, we're all dead. Won't matter where I'm sitting. Fair. It's in my interest to help you. What are you offering, Arya? <laughs> On Omega, I kept the Blood Pack, Blue Suns, and Eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Okay. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless force for your war. Now you're talking. I now you're speaking my language. With all three groups. I just need you to close the deals. Give a criminal a gun, he'll shoot you in the back. They already have guns, Shepard. I'll make sure they point them at the Reapers. I'm trying to help you. Why don't you think it over? Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Suns leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. Okay. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out of jail. All right. <laughs> you obviously don't know Bailey very well. Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? Uh, she's got a point. It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk. And checking you out, Arya, it has been my pleasure. I mean, what? Okay. Doom, doom, doom. Sorry. It looks kind of like... Uh, she is what's known as an Asari. Like, these are Turians. Humans, obviously. Salarians. We haven't met Krogans yet. You might like Krogans. You feel... I feel like you would really enjoy a big top energy person, and that's Krogan in a nutshell. You do enjoy all energies? Yeah, I've kind of picked up on that. Top end. <laughs> of, of course, that's half the fun is teasing. Contact the field team for a progress report. Yes, sir. Gotcha. Oh, Commander Shepard, we've been expecting you. Just a moment. And Hadley, could you gather the Leviathan data for us? Will do. Apologies, Commander. The rest of my team is out investigating leads right Wait. now. Wait. Hmm? I'm Dr. Garrett Bryson, and this is Task Force Aurora. Oh, what do we got? What's your assignment? Our mandate is to investigate legends, rumors. Old stories about the Reapers. Is overstimming just more hardcore version of teasing? Uh, depends on what type of stimming you're doing. I could have used your help three years ago. Yes. If people had paid more attention to your Prothean beacon, we might not be in this war. But now with new information we've uncovered, a breakthrough. Because, like, for me. Oh, shit. Hadley, do you have the data? Uh oh. No! <laughs> oh, shit. Ah. This is Commander Shepard. I need CSEC at my location now. You shouldn't be here. The darkness. He was indoctrinated. What do you mean? Uh. Friends at records show his name is Derek Hadley. He's worked here for a couple months. Shepard. Uh, overstimming because it can just be. Location. Were you harmed? Overstimulation, just like too many uh like inputs. Like files. I, I have technically like yeah like. Overstimulation of um, media, like I have like I, four. I could have like four monitors I, going, and like a different screen on each. Like, I kind of vibe on uh, overstim because like I have 
chat going. I have my recording going. I see how long I've been live. I see my recording. I'm playing the game. I'm checking chat, you know, and then I'm keeping up with my alerts. It's it's that's a bit of overstim. There's uh, the obvious type of overstim where you know, I'm I'm edging for like two and a half hours, but that's eh, that can happen sometimes. Don't get me wrong, that's fun. You tell me. I I was gathering our data when you arrived, and then it was dark, cold, like I was someplace else. And then. I don't know. A gun was in my hand. Dr. Bryson, there was a loud... Not going to punch him. That was you shooting him. I didn't do it. It wasn't me. You have to believe that. So someone else pulled that trigger. But I would never do that. Commander, this does resemble reports of indoctrination. Yeah. Indoctrination? Me? Yeah. What about that Leviathan Bryson mentioned? How does that tie in? It's some kind of creature. Our field teams have been tracking it. It's a reaper. That artifact came in from our researcher, Garneau. He sent an audio log if you want to... Nope, there it is. Restrain him. What's wrong? Turn back. What are you talking about? The darkness cannot be breached. Oh, they just killed him. Get him over to the clinic. See if they can tell us what's wrong with him. Doctor Nation. Yes, ma'am. Commander, you'll want to see this. It's an outgoing message from Dr. Bryson to Admiral Hackett. Oh, boy. Dr. Bryson, you have an update? Admiral, the Leviathan of Dis that we've been investigating, I think we're really onto something. Give me the brief. About 20 years ago, the Batarians discovered a Reaper corpse that had died in battle. They covered it up and denied it ever existed. But I'm intrigued by Wait, the larger with these big ass mods? What could have killed uh, every 50,000 years. Exactly. That's the real Leviathan. It's worth pursuing. Continue your investigation and update me on the progress. There is also a follow up message from a few weeks later. Admiral, the Reapers are shadowing my field teams as if they're hunting Leviathan themselves. Whatever it is, I believe Leviathan is nothing less than a Reaper killer. Oh. Almost an apex predator. You do remember right. Nervous. If we could just find it. Good girl, good memory. I'm formally requesting assistance and tracking it down. You'll have it. This is now your top priority, doctor. Find that thing. It appears we were meant to be that assistance. Anything capable of killing a reaper could do a lot of collateral damage. Yet given the state of this conflict, I believe the saying, the enemy of my enemy is my friend may be relevant but we won't know unless we can find it bryson's assistant did say they recently received a log from their field researcher it may yield more information <laughs> this must be the artifact the assistant mentioned and here's the log dr bryson it's garneau i'm sending you an artifact i found About the only so thing that's got to come from a reaper it's nothing. appears to be our best lead to track Leviathan, but he does not state a destination. We can Focus find on what he does say then. He mentioned extrapolating Where? Leviathan's path and crunching numbers. He wasn't flying blind. He had data. A significant amount of data, judging by this office. I will answer that after this cutscene. Bryson and his colleagues evidently used a galaxy map search program in their hunt for Leviathan. It may help us locate Garneau. Yeah, I was just before I checked that. Ah, fuck. That's a husk. Well, a husk head at least. Were you a good top or a bad? Depends on uh, what was requested. Hey, there's nothing wrong with with uh, some wild head. Certain uh, things can just pop pop out of that. Does okay. this tell us where Garneau went? No, but we may be able to narrow down his location if we find clues he was using in his search for Leviathan. Okay, well. 
Okay, so okay, there's the artifact, obviously. These are all murders in which the accused lacked a known motive and claimed memory loss. Just like Bryson's assistant. You think Garneau was following a trail of blackout crimes? It is possible. We need to find data matching dates and locations for crimes of this nature. Here's the time and date chart for the crimes. Can you filter for murders where the killer claimed memory loss? Adding the search filter. You may examine the results on the Galaxy Map program. Okay. I understand when I asked if you're turned into a bathtub. I'm more good with my voice. Let I always say that. Pistol cranial trauma. This that's just called the shoot harder. Ooh, high velocity barrel. I actually need that. But here's what top you are. You always say what? <laughs> I said I'm much better with just using my voice. Oh, do I have uh, quality options, by the way? You mean it? I saw something over here lit up, but I. I am Bryson, age nine. Aw. This does not seem relevant at the moment. I mean, I thought you meant you're only like that on stream in front of a microphone. I can act many ways. It's the uh, the joys of streaming. Sometimes you can be a bit of a chameleon. Sometimes you can give people exactly what they want. Other times. You need to tease it out of them. You don't mind a little teasing, do you? Looks like data on the rack knife. By Anne Bryson, age nine. This does not seem relevant. March seventh, twenty one eighty six. I'm looking at the rack knife. <laughs> What do you think, Edie? It is possible that Bryson's team is using ancient Rachni fleet activity to find Leviathan. We saw a data pad screaming into a pillow. Movements earlier. Generally, I have to do a bit more work to uh, cause that. And normally, it's normally when I push their face into the pillow. But that's neither. That's not relevant to this, is it? Okay, the Thorian. Bryson was tracking unexplained oh. creature sightings. <laughs> oh yeah, um I believe the term for me in uh the those circles is a brat tamer. Bryson was not merely tracking sightings. He was attempting to extrapolate a course. And Garneau could have been following But I want to get it. Edie can you add a search filter for systems <laughs> along that projected path? Adding this search filter to the galaxy map. And if you want aftercare for that part of your body, that that's another uh, that's another conversation entirely. Hey. Meteorite fragment, maybe. He was studying it as an object of importance. We should look more closely at a sample. Some news. Sample. Traces of element zero. 
Would Leviathan need Ezer? <laughs> While it's not consumed as fuel during FTL travel, Element Zero will decay after several centuries of active use. If uh, old enough, if I have quality options, keep in mind you can swap from like 1080 to like 720. Search filter for locations with Element Zero. Adding the search filter now. Because uh, if uh, it's uh, good, I should have a... Uh, no, it's on you? Okay. I said uh, if you want that type of aftercare, that's a whole different conversation. Because, you know. You know. Most people aren't appreciative of uh, playing with the back door. But hey, that's everyone's different. Okay, anything else? Alien sightings. Based on the search result, Gono is in one of these five systems. I have marked the Normandy map with possible locations. We can leave now, unless you wish to further narrow the search. Slack out crimes. No results. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Well, I guess a girl would be enough, but food is always... Of course. Element zero deposits. No results. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Just checking around. Anything else? I have a feeling you are absolutely drawn to like head scritches. Like a hug and a head scritch and you are just putty. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> head and back scratches and if someone's being real mean and if they're and be having a finger under the chin with a bit of a scratch <sighs> aren't I just wonderful to deal with be encrypted data on Reaper fleet activity. Do you think it's relevant? Possibly, but it is impossible to say without more data and the decryption key. Okay. Sir, this is Bryson. We know the Reapers are after Leviathan. <laughs> Studying Reaper hunting patterns could be vital to finding it. <laughs> that data is classified top secret, Dr. Bryson. If it falls into the wrong hands, it won't. The data is encrypted. I'll keep the decryption key safe. Close to my heart. Oh. Close to his heart. The hell does that mean? The kids' pictures. I ain't telling this. I ain't telling this, friends, because. A small shutdown button. By Ann Bryson. Age nine. Records indicate Ann is now 28. She works for the Alliance. Of course. Bryson was keeping the encryption key close to his heart. What's closer than family? An interesting hypothesis, but I detect no trace of the decryption key in this art. Ah, uh, might be the one upstairs, though. Oh, yeah. Another piece of Anne Bryson's childhood art. Six, five... Take a look at that. Six five eight one six. I can use these numbers to construct a decryption key. Excellent. Right. Let's get back to the data pad we found earlier. Called it. I was like, I know I'm missing. I was missing something. And apparently, according to you, I I've discovered a few things about you, 
that will just make you uh analyzing data your your brain go burr so I'm very amused by this. I guess you weren't expecting this when you just came to a random stream, though, eh? Hey, Toaster? You're like, I just want to check out Mass Effect 3, and all of a sudden it's like, Ringo Burr. All right. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Okay. We have a match. Marking the galaxy map. Oh ho. Let's go find Garneau. Do 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 do. Well, all, all I can say is I aim to please, and I'm very glad you dropped by. It's always fun to talk to new people. Is it bad I have a fear? I. Is it bad I'm. Always fun to talk to new people. Proceeds to tease. In my defense, you, you started. You came in with saying I had the daddy energy. And it's like, ah. Welcome to my den, says the spider to the fly. <laughs> I, it's more amusing because I have a feeling you were just trying to be complimentary. You weren't expecting uh, the response, so to speak. All right, what do we got? Uh, and hey, that's literally what I aim for. I don't think I want. It was yesterday, a friend of mine. Ah. Uh, well, from You're the way. To dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? Uh. I need to get to the refugee camp. Yes, Commander. Sorry, any question if I'm really a switch? Eh. Honestly, I'd say your your uh sub with heavy heavy brat tendencies. Okay, hang on, let me check my journal quick. Garner Bosk. But yeah. Damn. I already have. You are more than ready and willing to be tamed if I'm, uh, spell if I'd be so bold. Yes, you will. Well, from what I can tell, that's what you're in the mood for. In a very thirsty way, if I must say so myself. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with being open about your interests. But fucking with you is so much fun. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great commander Shepard on a leash. Beg your I'm fucking... I'm here for my own reasons, Bosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? The Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. I'm not gonna kill him, fuck you! You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? 
Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. <laughs> oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. Keep fucking dreaming. You knew about this? Can you be more specific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Oraka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Oraka to Wait, stop back. disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Oraka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of him. I don't see the distinction. Need to call someone on Discord? Okay. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Alright, appreciate it. Alright, let's... Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, I might have to kill him. <laughs> yeah, he mentioned that, uh... That I'm going to sleep with him? We all have our delusions. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Where's the general? Good shit. That's all. They said the fighting was getting worse. Well, let's find some room for them. Now, this is going to be home for a while. Hey, Garrus. Huh? Oh, hey. You are looking at VI model 1.7 AGB, Commander Shepard. Please see a store clerk to unlock a demo of this model. <laughs> you have a copy of a Shepard VI. Oh, yeah. The one based on that war hero? We locked it after some kid spilled soda over the hardware. I'll unlock it, but we've only got the demo version working. <laughs> Good to meet you. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. That is so creepy. You need a few more minutes? Ah. I would have made a lewd joke, but, you know, you can't always go for the lewd jokes, you know. You gotta space them out. You gotta tease them out. Alt rifle Omni Blade. Damn. Jokes don't need space. You're not wrong. Puns at least, eh? Yeah. You're not wrong. But I respect the good taste. Well, hey, that's what I'm here for. I aim to appeal to all tastes. As a variety streamer, you know. You just gotta, you know, try your best. Uh, where do I need to go? Okay. I need to go here and I need to go to the courtyard. Let's start here. And search for less viewers and then just check what lo looks interesting. Well, I'm glad I am at least, if nothing else, I am interesting. Hey, General. Commander Shepard. General Araka. I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable if I recall. It's so fun to have a streamer just for yourself. Nothing yes. wrong with that. Neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now. Reinstated. Good on you. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. 
There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. I'll get the weapons. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. Okay. Okay. I need to go talk to Kinnick. There are no more Eastern Reaper, but, uh, we don't know what love there. It's just known as the Leviathan of Dis. We don't know what it is actually. Apparently it's something big and fucking nasty. There. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here and all my arms are legal. See? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C-Sec too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with the bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers are through. So what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> the Turian just waved credits in my face and then spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with C-Sec, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Okay. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. Okay, I've only got four points, so I need five. Okay. I am at a I am of an age. Commander, unless you can find a new source of weapons for CSEC, I'm putting together a task force to stop the Blue Suns myself. I'll get you your weapons, General. I appreciate the effort, but I've spent too much time out of action, Commander. Won't be able to sit on my hands much longer. Old enough? Exactly. Okay. <laughs> Gnarl and Presidium comes. Okay, I need to go to... Wait, you, yeah, go get your tea. Remember, your uh, parent just asked if uh, you wanted tea. I've seen Pelavin burning. Those fires aren't going out anytime soon. If you can help. Look, Simon, you want to sell your shares of water, fine. But I'm not selling financial BIs while my home will burn. Okay, okay, let me think. We should repurpose the BIs. Citrus tea? Ooh, nice. You a Lemsip kind of person? Like, do you go lime, lemon? You know. Blasto Six Partners in Crime. Quick, hands behind your back. We'll be here in a minute. What the hell are you talking about? Crete, Blood Pack's leader. Aria brings him to Crete Commander Shepard. Crete pledges the gang to her. Big pardon? We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. Not the best start to our friendship, Narl. He's coming. Put your hands behind your back and uh, try to look like I beat you up or something. Uh, I'm gonna trust you. This better be on the up and up. 
I am to look even more powerful than Crick thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now, Nothing wrong with a bit of a sour and tart taste. Want you to know, your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. Keep your distance, Creed. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? <sighs> Most definitely. Arya can use blood pack as she sees fit. Wasn't talking to you, Creed. Grill? What? You have my word. Now open fire! <laughs> Not him. Rose next in line to take over. Arya's deal is with him. Yes. Yes. I'm Arya's mole, Shepard. You've scratched my back. Now I'll scratch yours. Word of advice. Don't double-cross Arya. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. Boot up. Uh-huh. Good work, Narl. Thanks for the gun. Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. Good on ya. Excellent. Yeah, from everything you've said, you're... You, uh, roll with the thigh highs and, uh, sometimes fishnets? Or are you, do you prefer, like, one or the other? Okay, where do we need to go now? Citadel, okay, I need to go to the Citadel embassies. I was like, where's the fucking elevator? Depends on what type of That's fair. Uh, where do we, we need the embassies? Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. I guess this would be a bad time to mention that, uh, there may be some more art of the, uh, humble host coming along. Uh, it's being made for me. I fully understand the situation. Of course, it, I read it, through the names of the dead every day, but... Please, please, a few more minutes of searching could mean a lifetime of peace for my family. Oh, shit. Someone in your family is MIA? My son, Bilal. And bureaucratic compassion seems to be in short supply. I am Ambassador Dominic Osoba. My son's squad returned from their mission on Benning without him. I found them drinking, but they won't even look me in the eye. Mm. I can offer a bounty for any information. If Balao's alive, we want him home. Find him if he's dead, then... Myself about the guards in San Roy found it hilarious. If I find anything, I'll let you know. If it's a picture, you can link it. Uh, hyperlinks are uh, not disabled here. As long as it's not uh, pornographic, that but that's just Twitch TOS. Val, I have some possible hits. Got some strange money transfers on Balone, and Alun is sending a lot of data. Points at random child. His money transfers are to support his mistress. Not sure about Alun. I'll put his bio. 
I'll check Olun's uh. personal records and pull his recent messages. Can I just note how odd it is for a Hanar to have a mistress? <laughs> you know, if Bao catches up with you, I can grant you immunity. What? If I join up? Yeah. Last time I did that, you wrote me into a suicide mission. Yeah. I didn't say you had to join up. You were working your way around to it. I find child funny to make fun of. Oh no, that that's legit. I, I love there's a subreddit called R slash kids are fucking stupid. It's very amusing if you think kids are silly. Hey. What do I owe the pleasure? Here to talk to you about releasing Jonas Sedaris. Damn, you too? Somebody got the council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. Wait, amusing? Look, there's no way I'm letting that R slash. out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. It's uh, full of memes. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. Sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the council will listen to you and <laughs> rescind the order. Go to the CSEC outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. With the way you're talking, I feel like you need a popsicle or something to just occupy yourself. Or is that, or... Okay. Let me know when you've had a chance to talk to Sedaris. Uh, okay, we need to go back to the Presidium common. Uh, you know, that that's not bullying. That's children being children. I feel like you need a couple things uh, at the moment. I can only provide certain things, but uh, as your humble host, I will do what I can. But a as you could probably guess, certain things do require monetary compensation. <laughs> uh, to quote uh, the million dollar man Ted DiBiase everybody's got a price I've connected with Jonas Sedaris in her cell commander you can speak with her via that console thanks we'll need some privacy of course when you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. And see, teasing goes both ways. It's fun. Who starts spying on me now? Ah, oh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. to move on and I will once all my enemies are dead I love holding all the cards even in here you must deal with me I have all the power is that right <laughs> yes saying my second in command is a weak willed toady quick math has been made if he falls, leave me to run take control himself but he won't defy me he knows better oh now, Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. Thank you. Okay, we've got something else potential. I have equivalent of... <laughs> 
Unfortunately, it is not. But what would you like me to provide you? Because we can always make a payment plan. Because it all depends on what you require. Okay. Thing? No, I don't. You have to tell me. Okay. Let's see where we're going, though. You have to sound it out. You have to say it. You can't just edge it. You can't just imply it. Sometimes you just got to go full force into it. You know, go, go real hip to hip. You got to go for it. <laughs> and your spells... Please, young one. I wrote the spells. Okay. I think I need to do a few things. <laughs> oh, you, you walked into my den. Please. No, you're... You, nah, you seem a bit muffled. Is, is something blocking? Is something blocking? Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. You want a cookie? I don't... I can't really send those. Oh, I, I know it was. I, I was deliberately being obtuse. Cassius in the Apian Crest. Okay, we'll go do... I wish you could track. Welcome, Commander I need to head back to the Normandy. Now arriving at Docking Bay B-24. If you don't say it, I don't... I don't know. Wait, what was that spider thing? Uh, that is known as a keeper. It helps run the citadel. Okay, I need to do a few missions, though. Yeah, it is kind of fucked up. Even I'll admit that. It's disgusting. I love it. All right, let me uh, head down. I need to mod my weapon a bit. Need to go to the armory. Where were we? All right. Yeah, we also have Captain fucking Thick over here. If uh, you lean towards uh, the buff, you know. If you lean towards the buff dudes, that's James. One of my crew. Finally a relatable character. Alright. No sass. Alright. Tarian State Arms. Shotgun. That's my armor. Weapon bench. That's for me. Uh, on. I'll take that. 
Oh, I don't want that. Ooh, nice. Nice, even less. How do I... How do I say this without directly saying this? Uh -huh. Is it positional? Who knows? Like, I don't know, you seem really nervous. <laughs> you aren't nervous? I, I think you're lying to me. It's not nice to lie. Don't worry, I know you're a good girl. You walked into this. I'm just very amused by this. But you're enjoying it. Be a big scare. Yes, I believe you. Totally. That was sarcasm? Oh, I know. I know how it's, just it's called I'm playing into it. Actually pop back in here. The one? Nope. I wanted to make it these nuts. Ah. Shit posting is in your blood. That's a mood. That's a mood. Okay, there's rescuing students. Let's go see if we can find uh, that dock. I I'm just amused because it's like... You're... <laughs> this sounds weird, but you're bad at hiding your thirst. It's very amusing, though. I'm, I will say that much. It's almost endearing. Fuck. Where are you? Come on, work with me. Excellent. All right, we got Garrus, Edie.
Ja, weg. Alright. I'm bringing Big Blue along. They picked up. Yeah. Huh. Who should I bring? Who should I bring? I'll bring Liara because I want some biotics. Okay, that's good. That's for you. Coming to a friend tomorrow? Hmm. Nice. I have trained at like 6 a.m. or something. It's going to be divergent, but. Oh. Well, you're a very good friend for uh, helping out in the, that type of situation. Hey, it's what I'm here for. And you're doing something very kind for a friend of yours. Out, if uh, I'm reading your what intentions exactly correctly. Mining facility. TGS Mineral Works. Small operation. Could be a good place for Leviathan to hide. Can't let it hide for life. Anything powerful enough to kill a Reaper needs to be investigated. Just hope Garneau has the answers we need. I'm reading Reaper enemy signatures in the asteroid field. Bryson said they were shadowing his field teams. If they're after Leviathan 2, Reapers are a good sign. That's not something you hear every day. <laughs> Take us in. And hey, I'm here for... I think it's the pact is sealed. And hey, there's nothing wrong with having fun as bo as long as you as you take the proper precautions. I'll yeah, exactly. Have fun, take proper precautions, and scouting party. And it sounds like they brought some friends. I like hey, no that that's called being safe I just said being safe and you being prepared. You know, I, I'm more than happy to hear that. Oh, yeah, of course. And I can tell you right now, there's probably th from the other side. There's going to be eagerness, but, uh, not a ton of, uh, know-how.
Just be prepared for that. Don't want it. <laughs> but other people care about your life. They're indoctrinated or Cerberus. Ah. Motorcycles are too cool to pass. I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance. You just had Reaper troops attacking your front door. Are they still there? Oh. I've taken care of them for now. I see. That will be all. Oh, you're indoctrinated. Holy. That will be. What the fuck? Brainwashed. Hello? Yes. Welcome to TGS Mineral Works. Synthetics? How can we help you? Yes. For the tour. Please sign in. I'm looking for a researcher named Dr. Garneau. They would have arrived within the last couple weeks. If he's still here, I need to speak to him. We have no Dr. Garneau. Do you need to see a doctor? How about I just go in and look around? No. The access elevator is broken. Wow. You're... <laughs> and now, we're done. Step away. Step away. You don't belong here. Ah. Yeah. We need to fix that elevator. Malfunction detected. Elevator online. Huh. Repair terminal activated. I'll set the drone to repair the elevator, but we have to stay with it. Yeah. That's fucking creepy. You play some multi games? Uh, sometimes, depending on the game. I'm not big on battle royales, but I enjoy some multiplayer games depending on what they are. But my main focus is uh, long form RPGs and like series. Like I've played. If you're interested in uh, my other content, I do have a Twitter where I post my going live stuff. DMs are open. Sorry, what? Never mind. I didn't say anything. But uh, uh, but on my uh, YouTube, it's like all my previous playthroughs, like uh, uh, what's it called? Legend of Dragoon, uh, the entire Yakuza series. Some. I said nothing. Welcome to the mineral lab. Our researchers are always hard at work. The strain and change threshold from core psychosis is too high. Want to change stimuli at the time more quickly? Interesting. You should look into that. Ugh. <laughs> but no, like if you if you are curious when I do go live, cause well, it's uh right below. If uh, you feel free to follow, because I do post when I go live. This is a restricted area. Personnel ID number is required. I don't have that. Access denied. Have you seen Dr. Garneau? You shouldn't be here. Evolutionary implications of human biotics. That's strange. So is it just me, or are these people doing everything but mining? Yeah. I do not have a public Discord yet. Turn back. You shouldn't be here. 
New crossbreed. Okay. Nothing wrong, wrong with a bit of breeding. As long as it's done safely. Okay. Bit more money. Yeah. Unfortunately, I do follow some loot stuff, but I have nothing salacious on my account. Yet. Have one. Okay. Turn back. You don't belong here. Yeah, I'm getting that feeling. What the fuck? <laughs> but yeah. I will always accept new followers. A humble host is always happy to have new people. so I could get the uh, crew area. I don't care if you're watching me. There we go. Money, 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 money. I'll deal with that in a minute, but I just need the crew quarters first. Hey Shepard, I think we just passed the security terminal. I know we did. I know we just passed security terminal. That's why I wanted that. I am an absolute loot whore in these games. I love it. Brunton Garno's terminal hacking. See where it gets us. Relatable? Oh, yeah. Ship dropped him off a week ago. Okay. It appears he had full access at one point before going into hiding. Okay. Oh. Unknown male was involved in an altercation with the mines. Uh. I was heading to the mines. Not looking for you, like but I will have day. ninety nine hundred nine the first ten minutes. Oh, that that's a mood. I'm a Terraria person. Okay. I have the file number. Thank. 
Thank you. Yeah, when it comes to those types of games, I'm a big fan of Terraria. And then another, and an abandoned shaft. File seven three six four. Access granted. It's it always sometimes it's sad when the shafts are abandoned. It's, you know, sometimes they just need a bit more love. You know, maybe some torches. We could play. If, how is your terraria broken? They just did, did. You know, sometimes sometimes shafts just need some extra love. I'm the builder friend. Is He's... that Garneau? If it is, we came a long way for nothing. You can't join friends? Huh. Are you on a VPN or something? If you are looking for Garneau, you have found him. I am Dr. Garneau. I'm Commander Shepard oh, of the Alliance. Are you all right? Yes. Only I'm trapped in here. Bryson's research led me to you. These massive ideas. He's dead, Doctor. Killed by his assistant. Playing on NVIDIA GeForce now? Oh, I see. I need you to tell me everything you found on the Leviathan. Bryson seemed to think it killed a Reaper. It's just... Oh, yeah, I know what GeForce now is. It's a myth. A dead end. Nope. But what about the artifact you mentioned in your message? I did? No. Yes, Doctor. He's indoctrinated. But now we've got Reaper forces attacking, so I need to break you out. We'll grab the artifact and go. Reapers. The darkness must not be breached. The darkness? Gotcha. Why do you pursue me? Doctor? There we are. Give the artifact. You will not take what is mine. Damn! I don't believe we're actually speaking with Garneau. Yeah, no shit. You, you killed a Reaper. I need you. Oh, help. the Leviathan. You bring only death. Shit! 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 Even tried to download it and no success. Do you not have it on Steam? No. Wait. We need to get to that artifact before he does. I do have it. Yeah, just make sure to. Garno's notes gave us a nav point for the artifact. According to my map, there's a service door at the next train station. Looks like we're not the only ones headed. Yeah, generally Steam is the best way to go. What the? Hey. That's what you get. Hi. Bop. Time for God to slam his car door. God, I legitimately love the fucking shotgun sound in this game. Feels like certain things just got bigger. You know, like God slamming his car door is the phrase just BAP And check what's wrong, matey. Yeah, I'm using a shotgun right now. My yeah. The term it you know sounds like God slamming his car door. BAP Rude. Get fucked. Uh, 
Can I get up there? Nope. Fuck. Fuck you and everything behind you. Get the fucker. Shit. Ah, up. Down. Whee! Skeet shoot. I don't know it's shooting me and it's causing me pain. I don't like that. Like this join link key fragment. Previous games thought you were nice. Aw. I understand the appeal of League, but for me, it's just. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, you're new. I don't like you at all. Oh, that's not good. There you go. Oh! That's an instant kill. Spoiler! Okay. I mean, play what you like to point a game. I'm just pointing this nice thing out. Oh, no! Absolutely! I agree with you. What? Uh, I think it's an ability it has. I didn't know the ability, so that's on me. So, yeah, just we, things we learned. not charge banshees. We learned something here today. I'm gonna go with the submachine gun of dealing with those fuckers. Good. Uh, might be an odd question. Uh, I will answer that as soon as, you know, I'm not in danger of being a corpse. As I'm sure you understand is my concern currently. Got him. Spoiler, I'm not going for that again. Oh shit. I died again because I had a fuck up.
Huh, why is my charge working? That was just a blind fucking... my fave that that's a tough one but you know nothing wrong with a bit of a face in the pillow if you know what i mean you know i don't discriminate though but of course you know like everything we all have preferences Imagine, hey, nothing wrong with uh, having a enjoyable uh, imagination. Oh yeah, and I forgot I. Oh, and I can bluff now. Fitness. Uh, actually, I want that. <laughs> Well, I'm glad I can have that sort of effect. What I aim for, I am your humble host. And I aim to please in whatever way I may. Do not feed it? Oh, that's what I'm here for. All I'm here for is to feed it. Okay. I want warp. And if you're gonna there, I'm gonna want Yeah, could you not do that? That hurt. You are fucking brutal. Where are you? It just, I have to be careful. Because as we saw. Oh. Nope. 
Ow. Okay, let's find that artifact. You're gonna be talking last Saturday game. Good luck. Okay. Whew. Those banshees are fucking brutal. What was that? Looks like the door's power supplies went cut. Fuck. There are the trouble spots. The drone can repair it. We'll need to escort it. Unfortunately, the drone is damaged. It's running on limited power. Let's make it quick then. Are you ADC support or uh, what? What do you run? I, I know you're AFK at the moment, or you're like can't talk much because you're probably loading in. But whatever your plan, I hope you uh, are in the top percent because I believe in you. Okay. Working on it. Get off, get off, get off, get off, get off. Jungle, Viego, good luck. Oh, jeez. Working on it. Go, go, go. Gotcha. Oh, that felt good. Bye bye, Banshee. Let's head back. Door should be online. Good drone. Get those camps, get those buffs. I believe in you, Toaster. I know you can't respond, but I know you can hear me. Okay. One more level up and uh, I'll probably grab, yeah. That's my bonuses for fitness. Let's see what we're fucking. The artifact. Like in Bryson's office. Move. Take I got a shot. Turn back. Or no. Fuck.
Shepard, you need to see this. What have you got? That wasn't Garlow. This is. Looks like he's been dead for a while. So Leviathan can have Bryson killed. And take over this colony. And he can use them as puppets. Hmm. Huh. Anything else useful? Looks like some encrypted data and a personal log. Eight missed calls from uh, Dr. Ann Bryson. Ann Bryson? Who... Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Commander Shepard. You all right? I think so. I feel like... It's a form of indoctrination, I guess. All right. Do you recognize this man? Never seen him before in my life. Someone here killed him. Someone here. How is that possible? I'm so sorry. Can you tell me anything about what happened to you? Not really. I uh, remember. It just seemed cold. I remember a, a feeling. Cold and dark. If dark was a feeling, that's exactly what I felt. That artifact, do you know where it came from? It came out of the mine. Right. Head office was supposed to send someone. That's about all I can... Cortez, what's your situation? Can you bring the shuttle? Affirmative. Strangest thing. A couple of minutes ago, the Reaper forces broke off and left. Reaper? What's a Reaper? What year do you think this is? 2176. Uh, 2176 was 10 years ago. What? Oh, shit. Let's arrange for these people to be evacuated into temporary quarantine. No memory of the last 10 years. They'll have a lot of catching up to do. Yeah, just a fucking tad. So Leviathan has the power to take down a Reaper and the ability to indoctrinate. Is it a Reaper? Do you think it actually is a Reaper? Hmm. If it is a Reaper, then I want to know what it's up to. How long has it been out here, and more importantly, why? Edie, did we get anything from Garno's notes? Yes. They suggest that Garno created a way to block the artifact's mind affecting properties. Oh. The artifact seems to be the key. Agreed. When I head back to Bryson's office, I want you there. Yes, Commander. I want to know just what the hell these artifacts really are and what they can do. Whatever they are, they're too dangerous to have around. Yeah. And we've got one sitting right in the middle of the Citadel. Your top is 6-0. and oh. Damn! Good on him. What's got your fucking see you there. This is a recording from Ferris Fields. Months ago. I lost a lot of friends that day. I lost my husband. I grieved. Said goodbye. Made my peace. Sorry for your loss. He obviously cared a lot about you. He was afraid I wouldn't let go. For him, I moved on. Or at least I thought I had. 
then the invasion hits. There's no time. And the one thing I grab is this. I mean, what's the point of moving on with your life when everything is going to hell? Start thinking that way and we've already lost. Yeah, you're right, but... Well, to be honest... I've never felt this alone as I do right now. You're not alone, Steve. I'm here. Anytime you need me. I appreciate that, Shepard. I really do. But don't worry, Commander. When I'm in that pilot seat, I'm there 100%. I won't fail you. It's just the downtime between missions that's hard, you know? I know. Yeah, adds a mood. Right, cool. How's my paragon? Damn, look at that rep. I look so damn good. Good boy. Stay. Barf, barf, barf. Robo doggo. All right, my, my. I'm actually gonna grab that. Yeah, why not? If I bark, will I get a treat? Depends on which kind of treat you're interested in. It's really. <laughs> How's your game going? You die? Hello. Oh, and uh, but before I forget, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. It always is much appreciated. On Twitter and here. Signal confirmed. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. On. Probe. Oh, nice. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Ah, run. Evasion successful. Bryson's lab. Okay. I'll go do this first. The way you're talking, I feel like you want to hear. I came in a very different context. <laughs> well, I'm glad I could help. Hey, what's up? Are you Bray? Uh, the great commander Shepard. But I outsmarted them and I killed all three of them. Fuck yeah. Save it. Just take me to Aria. Follow me. So where is she? Well, I aim to please and I am merely your humble host. Yeah, have, have, having someone new in your house can sometimes be a lot of fun. Dramatic. Obviously, because you know you can just chill out, watch what you want. You know, maybe Chromecast something like 
YouTube or Twitch on the TV and just chill out. Totally. I assume this is about retaking Omega. This is about your war, Shepard. Cerberus controlling the Terminus system seriously bolsters their mobility. Since taking Omega, they've spread through the galaxy. Surely the Alliance has noticed. Obviously. Chase. What's your plan? Kick them out. I've amassed a fleet of Merc ships. We're going to punch through enemy lines and invade. Damn. Once we're on Omega, it's a ground war. That's why I want you. I only accept the best. The leader of the Cerberus occupation is General Oleg Petrovsky. He's the one who ousted me. Don't know him. The elusive man's top military strategist and best kept secret. But all you really need to know is that he's a merciless bastard. Sounds familiar. Shepard, I know my reputation. I know I'm hated. I ruled Omega with an iron fist. But the people were free. Their lives were theirs. I preserved that. This man took all that away and he is going to pay. Yeah. When Omega is mine again, I'll give you everything. I've got ships, mercs, Ezo, all yours for the war. What's the catch? I have objections to some of the company you keep. So you'll have to leave the Normandy and its crew behind. My crew are professionals. Let's just say I want you all to myself. Damn. Bray will provide coordinates to my fleet. Oh, and while we're still in the Citadel, please be discreet. Of course. The fleet is hidden in this system. Signal me when you're on your way. Ari and I will meet you on the command ship. <laughs> Can't wait to see what all the fuss is about. You stole Harold? Nice! And I'm flattered I can have such an effect so quickly. Woo! Alright. You flashed and smite. Nice. Yeah, sometimes you just got to take what you want, take what you need. Get on ya. Edie, let's get a good look at here again. We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Bunk. Oh. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? AI. The amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. I'd call it dangerous as hell. Bryson's assistant tried to kill me. Perhaps Leviathan was controlling him to protect itself. Diverting people. You can take what you want. Yeah, you're the jungler. Maybe. Jump on those motherfuckers like a pre patch Kha'Zix. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have come out of the bushes like a fucking Rengar. OG Rengar. Okay. They were testing the artifact for energy emissions and found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Yeah. Anything interesting about the artifact's structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing relevant. <laughs> That's just funny to click. Mind if I steals your buff in your heart? 
Oh, are you now an Ari? Hit him with the charm, then hit him with that fucking wombo combo. Edie, what project was Garneau working on when he found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? Several ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type in the Galaxy of Fantasy video game. Ah. It possesses a gaze attack capable of triggering synced animation kills. Player forms describe it as overpowered. <laughs> I meant the project, Edie. Oh. Then, no. There's got to be something here on this artifact. What about the server? Bryson's assistant wiped the office server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Yeah. Be worth a look. I I miss I misread that as like I always wear as in I always wear protection. I was like, wait, what? A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. Okay, we got something now. Alright. Bryson was attempting to contact Garno on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something it about looks the artifact. She's in trouble. She sounded worried. If Reaper forces were approaching, her concern was warranted. Yeah. Let's hope we get to her before they do. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. Okay. I always am, but oh yeah, of course I get your point. But misconstruing it for my own amusement is always a high priority for me. The Reapers. Let's hope we find Anne before they do. Can you identify this, Edie? It originates with a pre-spaceflight culture, but there are none recorded in the Pylos Nebula. Safety first. Then, work history then the fun begins. Be. Nothing relevant. Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the project's requisitions locker. Any correlation between Project Scarab and these unexplained creature sightings? Not beyond Leviathan itself. You fucked up. Oh no. These are the ships Dr. Bryson and his team used? Yes. If we can find out which ship Anne Bryson took for Project Scarab, we may learn something. These are the ships Dr. Bryson and his team used? Yes. If we can find out which ship Anne Bryson took for Project Scarab, we may learn something. Okay. You did a die. Build Warwick and I want it. Wanted the best. I forget. Pull down between next. Oh. And then you dove in and got, I believe the polite term is shit on. Aw, it happens. I believe in you. Always remember, the one random Twitch streamer is always supporting you. Ask for a... Okay, it's an Icarus. And Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Can you track its movements? No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian comm buoys. But we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. I believe you saw them earlier. The Icarus. There we go. There we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. So they jumped to the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system. Yes. Otherwise, I forgot they, they don't have moving DLC. Okay, we can rule out the relay system. Okay. Filter added ship schematics. That'll help. Anything in these drawers? Oop. Access card. 
Any idea what it opens? The requisitions locker. According to records, it was last used by Anne Bryson. And we lost. Aww. Project Scarab. You'll, you'll win the next one. You fucking played God tier, though. Good job. Like. data it is one of these two systems okay get to here let's see what ann bryson requisitioned for project scarab wind protection gear didn't need an environmental suit based on what ann bryson did or did not requisition the dig site was arid but habitable you can cheat yourself and, and still not systems with Thanks. compatible planets <laughs> Okay, habitable planets. Based on the data, only one system remains a viable possibility. <laughs> Good. Let's go get Ann Bryson. You know you could just call me radio. Okay. We want to go to the docking bay. Tizzyman says you were tilt proof? Yeah, hell yeah. Because remember, I am no father figure. I am merely your humble host. Okay, Miranda wanted to talk to me. Oh, how are you not? <laughs> I'm merely Commander your humble Shepard. host. It's been far too long. We live in interesting times. Indeed. A little too interesting. I couldn't get anywhere near you when the Alliance had you locked up. Relieved of duty. It was complicated. I'm sure it was. I'm surprised they didn't court me. I've in bio he has gin and tonic. <laughs> Doesn't matter now. <laughs> Shepard, about Earth. Countless people lost their lives within minutes. The Reapers are everything we feared. They should have listened to you a long time ago. Yeah, no shit. I'm sorry, Shepard. What about you? Sorry, just getting what comfy. You here? I need to talk to a few people. Like you. The Citadel is a good place to meet. For now. And how long am I sitting here? Uh, you've been here for a couple hours. Yeah, you followed me about two hours ago. Surprising. Shepard, there's something I wanted to mention. Oh. What is it? What's up, Miranda? I haven't heard from my sister, Oriana, for a while. I'm getting worried. Your sister? Yes. Oh, yeah. I don't want to overreact, but... Well, there's a lot going on. I thought we made sure she was safe. We did. It's probably nothing, but... I just know my father is. Sound like I'm enjoying this, but what happened? You have games to play and know. things to do. I completely understand. Had in place to make sure she was safe went dark. What do you need from me? I, I understand people have to live Shepard, their lives. I've been this long on any Twitch. If I need a door or two. Well, I'm glad I uh, am able to help and keep your for pique now, your interest for that long. I'll be fine. Okay, I understand. I have to figure this out. You will. I've got to get back to it. And I should get out of sight. Be careful. No promises. Alright. How am I doing this? Uh, you're going to have to be a bit more in-depth because I, I legitimately don't know what you're referring to. Okay. I'll go to the hospital. I mean, I know how, but... I'm interested in conversation. It, it comes down to... You know, I'm interested in conversation. 
and you know I I try to be as a Twitch streamer and just you know content creator entertainer whatever the fuck you want to call me I've got many names and according to you I've got a new uh, a new one thanks <laughs> but it's all about reading the vibe of the person uh no please don't like I said I am merely your humble host if you must call me anything radio is fine Oh shit. You have extensive nerve damage. Once we remove the leg, we can't install a prosthetic for You keep saying this, but what is I told my squad I'd fly back next week. I'm sorry, but that's impossible. You do not own this account? No, I do. This is my account. Okay. <clears throat> to put it this way, Radio Achievements is the name of the channel. This is my channel. It's my account. The avatar, the pleasant, uh, the pleasant suited fellow you see in the corner there is your humble host. That's me. Yeah. Because I always put it this way. Radio Achievements is the overarching channel. Son of a yeah, like for example, Dan's Gaming. It the channel is Dan's Gaming. The person playing is Dan. Like this is Radio Achievements. The person playing right now is merely your humble host. Oh hey Ashley. Good to see you up and around. Yeah. Everything all right? I guess. Oh, I took Udina's offer. Hey. Specter status. It doesn't mean I wouldn't sm seem small compared to what's going on. <laughs> well, I'd hope after all you've said, your mind didn't suddenly change, and I am always I flattered. Record. You deserve this. Thanks. That means a lot coming from you. He said we'll have the official ceremony soon. Once I'm out of here. Because that's what I hope draws people in. Good question. I guess that's up to Adina. Sure. Let me know. You feeling better? I'm fine. Other than the pile of paperwork the doc's gonna throw at me. Because I always phrase it this way, like, so in case you're wondering why the humble host has no eyes, What's going it's on? for a simple reason. Heard from my mom. They got out in time. They're okay. Good. That's I'll, I'll explain after the cutscene. My youngest sister, Sarah. She just learned her husband was killed in action. He was the second lieutenant stationed under meter. Good guy. I'm sorry, Ash. Yes. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. Sarah wasn't much for the military life. Oh, yeah. We were all surprised when they got married. Hey, right, how's uh, how's Poland treating you currently? Members. I don't want to think about it. Seems hopeless sometimes. Don't blame yourself for this, Ashley. I know. But I'm her big sis, you know. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced or cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance. My head is bloody, but unbowed. Uh, What's that from? Invictus by Henley. One of my dad's savvy poets. It's about not giving up. Right. My sister wants to do a thing at the memorial. Nothing fancy. Just some words about the family. It'll be tough. Keep me posted, all right? Will do. And thanks, Shepard. What'd I do? I always get some more rep up. Alright, good luck. I believe in you. I believe you can uh, own the jungle. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh yeah, I need to go back to the Presidium Commons. I need those heat sinks or whatever. Shepard, please select the destination. 
Stadium Commons. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Alright. Run, run, run. Yeah. So, are you thinking about volunteering for a double shift? Are you insane? We're hardly getting enough sleep as it is. Well, I'm not going to sleep. Might as well at least kill myself. Alright, did I find it? He would be a bit. That what he would be interested in? Uh. Credits don't talk with me, Commander. C-Sec wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with a couple of artifacts. Alright, what kind of artifacts are we talking? Well, let me check my journal quick. Excellent. Edie. Where was that Solarian? Nope, nope, nope. Let's see it. Where is it? I was just trying to remember where I fucking heard it. Nope. Nope. So you said for... S these are the Presidium Commons. Let me just check over here. you I said to Larian so Checking every fucking Solarian, but <sighs> Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds from today's purchases. Welcome to Nosostra Sporting Goods. Thank you for shopping at Nosostra Sporting Goods. I really appreciate it. Welcome to Casa Fabrication. Thank you for weaponry. shopping at Casa Fabrication no, Weaponry. No, actually, my husband, the Krogan. Oh. I have noticed many displays of public affection on the Citadel. The rate seems disproportionately high. Everybody could die tomorrow, Edie. Looking up is one of the few things they can do. I wonder if this is how the Krogan feel.
Okay, I, I'm gonna go back to the embassy. And, okay, I thought I found them. Than that. According to the council, these galaxy wide attacks are part of a massive. Hello, ma'am. What can I do for you today? Such a nice young woman. You remind me. Poor lady has dementia. Let me know when you've had a chance to talk to Sedaris. This is nice. Because it says it's on the Presidium Embassy, so. God damn it. I don't want him searching for something and it's just like, nope. The Alliance military has abandoned the Hades Gamma Cluster to incoming Reaper forces. Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to Citadel Embassy. The current human ambassador is Dominic Osoba. Commander Bailey is the CSEC officer on duty. You will find him in the Citadel Security District Office. Where's the Spectre Requisitions Office? The Spectre requ oh. that requisition forms are available only to agents who find... That's it. Thanks. Please speak with your... Fierce fighting continues as the Reapers occupy most of the Falcon. Okay. Alright, well, I'm gonna go back to Purgatory. Might as well try and get uh, one of those things uh, rocking. Now arriving at ward level. I hate being stuck here. I hate this guard duty assignment. I hate everything right now. There's nothing we can do about it. You need to do your own way. At least your wife and the kids went on their honeymoon and you want them back. Where was it again? They canceled the trip. Donated the funds to build some charity in our home city. Got a brutal. Oh, they talk to be fuckers. Well, 
I miss something in here? Your one, two, and oh is in the Sorry I'm not speaking of focusing Oh no, hey, that that's absolutely fine. It's more um Hey what's up, James? Hey Commander. Nice to see you down here in the dirt with us grunts. <laughs> you think I don't like getting dirty? Oh now, come on. I didn't mean anything by a little. Uh-huh. What did you mean then? See those Marines over there? None of them officers, just soldiers fighting the war. Yeah? They've been buying me drinks all night. You know why? Same reason they got all quiet and serious when you walked in. I've seen a hell of a lot, but I'm still just a soldier. I'm still one of them. Sure, but they don't know you. They just know what they've been told. Listen, you want them to see you're one of us, right? Yeah. Maybe. Then buy them around. Good idea. I like the way you think, Lieutenant. How would that be? Oh, Padre. The hey, the commander would like you to have a drink. On her. So here's to us. Who's like us? Damn few, and they're all dead. How would that be a renegade Sorry. action? Thought you'd know that. One. Thanks for the warning. Thanks for the drink. Wait, why would that be a renegade option? You're trying to... It's just, I don't want to... I play Uber Paragon in this. Don't mind me just grooving out. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Damn! Oh, I can't dang. Yeah, let's get a drink. <laughs> Is that fucking warp back? Boom. Our mall. Actually, I don't want to accidentally trigger anything else, so I'm just gonna go like this quick. Look who's here. So, so what's on your mind, Shepard? How am I supposed to talk Bailey into letting Jonas Sedaris out of prison? I've already leaned on the council. Bailey is in direct defiance of their order. So talk to him. One Boy Scout to another, chain of command and all that crap. Take him to dinner, talk dirty to him, whatever works. How do you plan on taking Omega back? I think I'm going to employ violence. <laughs> I'm going to slap Omega right out of the elusive man's greedy little hands. Are the blood pack falling in line? With Grill in charge, where all systems go. It's his voice, but my words. Couldn't have asked for a better puppet. The Blood Pack have committed 2,000 Vorcha to the cause. They'll make up the bulk of the army. We'll talk later. Good shit. I'm sure. Okay. Oh. oh I've just... I did speak to Bailey. I'm good enough to let's get back to the Normandy Did we got an auto save you know fuck it let's do it I believe this is DLC as well why not? Let's fucking rock and roll.
I tried to kill him, but we forgot that Harold does not one shot powers. Oof. I only have one of those right now, so. We're outshipped four to one, and most of our vessels are transports with limited firepower. We're not one, here three, and two. Battle. I believe in you. Have to punch through their line. So you commandeered a Cerberus cruiser. The guest of honor has arrived. We can finally start. Let me guess. You're gonna win. Planning on infiltrating the enemy fleet. I believe in you. Exactly. We position ourselves to strike a crippling blow, then my forces join the fun. A lot could go wrong. The assault's been planned for weeks, Shepard. For now, just sit back. Let me steer. Yeah. Not the best start to our partnership, Arya. How things begin isn't nearly as important as how they end. Bray, move through the relay. So I guess Arya is a pretty uh, solid top there. On my command. Hey, yo, indeed. There's Omega. Head for the command ship. Captain, to say that the hard way. <laughs> I have a feeling that was with a gun to his fucking That's back right. of his head. Nice and slow. Yeah. Hey, at the start, you always got to go nice and slow. You can't just rush in. No. As close as you can. Game time, bitches. We're through. Head straight for the station. We're being hailed by the general. Should be interesting. Put him through. Aria, I knew this had to be you. You'll never make it. Pull it off now. You're barking up the wrong tree, general. But maybe you can convince my partner. Commander Shepard, I've heard great things about you. My partner here doesn't have much to say for you. She's not used to being defeated. It clouds her judgment. <laughs> A pity you left, Cerberus. We all sabotage ourselves in nefarious ways. Perhaps deep down you fear success. I'm going to so and look forward to killing you. Seeing you will unsettle me. Now it's my turn. I see you've gone to the trouble of augmenting that ship with Solaris armoring. An exorbitant waste. I've made improvements to Omega's outer defenses. My cannons will cut through you at will. He sounds pretty confident. Yeah, he does. So again, I say turn back. Let's see what you've got, Oleg. End transmission. That went well. Set preset course. We're ramming the station. Everyone Any type for of impact. jungle diff what? feels good. Omega's kinetic barrier will stop my ships from landing. I equipped this cruiser with disruptors to take it out on impact. Oh, shit. Don't worry. We'll probably survive the crash. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Yikes. Shields gone. All systems failing. We can make it. Aria, don't be stupid. Sound the evac. Damn it. Program escape pods for the station. Let's go. Everyone out. There's no time. Oh, shit. Ow. Ow. Guess 
Nurse, that asshole really did upgrade Omega's outer defenses. So it would seem. Fuck! <laughs> Surprise, bitches! Got you. This is what I brought you for. Ground assault. Got you. Combat. What you say goes. Aria relinquishing command? I'll believe it when I see it. I can be a team player, Commander. I know where we need to go, and you can get us there. Yeah. Okay, let's move. Oh, hi. How you doing? Bob. is feels good I think bot chart after an enemy I don't really use heavy melee so Boop. Minus A. Tell your boss I'm coming for him. Fine. 
Why is it charge? Okay. Any other salvage on the other side? Always checking for salvage. You never know. I did everything right except for vision control and kitty. Hey, you won. You had a W. That's what counts. And as always, I'm proud of you. Good girl. I believe you can do even better in the next game. Ground team, report in. Gray, you there? Oh. Oh. Rally them to you, then head for the rendezvous hangar. Start prepping for our ships to land. Just like a fun night, various entry points. Let's hustle. Every minute, more of my ships get obliterated out there. Working on it. Friends ready to talk. Have fun. Oh, I thought he was dead. He is now. Getting close. Those cannons have to be stopped. Working on it, working on it. Checking for loot, checking for ammo, anything. I'll be there in a minute. Coming from. Die. I literally don't. Where the fuck are you? Okay. Your boss I'm Shoot! Bonk. Repressurization complete. Access enabled. Excellent. That's done it. Fucking ten on ten. One of our pods. We were lucky. Press on. Lost two more transports. Can't keep up the visa maneuvers much longer. Working on it. Right outside the defense station. Hold tight. Do the bypass. Oh, you're dead. Clear. Get to the controls. Uh, 
working on it. Okay. Shut that shit down. Charles, defenses are down. Signal the surviving ships to converge on the rendezvous point. Open now. My birds are coming in. Prep for reception. What exactly is this rendezvous point? That's where we're headed. It's a bunker I established on D-Deck for my more sensitive operations. It's utterly impenetrable with its own secret hangar and dock. Independent power source, life support, munitions. You'll see. Aria, look. Deploy to D-Deck. Investigate and await further instructions. All right. chance the general knows where we're going then no time for sightseeing gotcha Bray, stay sharp we might get visitors Terrific. i'm just checking for specialized loot anything I like that's just Take free exit i've locked down the way we came will do Checking anything I might have missed. Let's fucking go. Love it. Feels good to let loose. <laughs> Nothing wrong with letting loose. Let me in. Oh, the Omega Skyline. Now I feel like I'm back. Strange. What are those things in the distance? Some kind of force field. That's not good. Yeah. Please be advised that any non-humans bearing weapons on this station will be shot on sight. <laughs> Some of my men. Just, oh, that's disgusting. And I love it. Yeah. Yeah. 
moving, don't worry. Alright, what do you have next for me, you Cerberus fucks? I know that symbol. Looks like a gang tag. The Talons. They used to deface my property, too. Oh, wow. Y'all are about to have a very bad day. <laughs> the talent symbol again. Hmm. Could be evidence of a resistance. Might be useful. Well, I thought. A little bit of salvage. I'm just checking for. One of my soldiers by the force field. Okay. I'll... Nope. Okay, can't do that. We. I just Dark Souls rolled down. Uh, your watch is about to get How fucking primed. Yeah, you're a corpse. Yeah, GG. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, wow. You got fucking toasted. Okay, you're a mech. Absolutely fucked on. No function detected. Bastards are fast. Need yeah. to check out that force field. Working on it. Poor idiot. Something tells me these force fields are going to be a problem. Yeah, just a fucking tad. Not this time. Come here. I'm coming, I'm coming. Hey. What are you doing? Letting you in on a secret. Down Ooh. the ladder. Okay, I've got five levels. Actually. Uh, force or impact radius? I just want it to hit harder. Cryo ammo is going to be the last thing I get. Looking for talent uh, signage anywhere. Who's there? Show yourself. Spirits, look who's back. Aria Talok. What's up? Nyreen, what the hell are you doing here? Playing cat and mouse, mostly. Just trying to stay alive. If it wasn't for these tunnels. My tunnels. I'm sure glad I showed them to you. If you hadn't, I'd be dead or locked up by now. Hmm. Arya doesn't trust easily. I guess you're a good friend. I don't know. Are we, Arya? Shepard, this is Nyreen Kandros, ex Turian military. We go way back. I've got a lot of questions, but they'll have to wait. Follow Just a up tad. to get you to safety. I'll do my best. Look capable? Ready to put that gun to good use? You have no idea how ready. It's a fucking rocket. Ooh, do I get it? 
Hey, good party member. Uh, yeah, you. Okay. Only thing I could do is breathe. Okay. And for you, uh, Health and armor? Wait. So why are you back, Arya? To reclaim what's mine. Left something behind, I take it. Not something. Everything. Yeah, it's heavy as fuck. <laughs> Not worth it. Oh, wait. I I don't use that. Check everything. Wait, did I? Yeah, I told you. What's the fleet status? Okay. I don't have to worry about their power recharges. Alright, let's go. Oh, there it is. Help oh, go. Wow. I don't know what the fuck you just did, but you like one shot that goddamn thing. What the fuck are you? Don't get it twisted. I am not complaining. Huh? Where you at? Oh yeah, get down. Please. Get up up to get down. Oh, hi there. Hi. I'm here to just absolutely fist fuck your mouth. How's it going? Bam. Oh, 
Oh yeah, we're gonna find his ass. Hi. Welcome to your death. Oh, found him. He's about to have a really bad fucking day. Hi. Oh. <laughs> Working on it. Chit, chit, chit. There we go. Ammo. Oh shit. Working on it. Got him. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Go, 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 go. Cannons engaged. Head to the blast doors. Jesus. Fucking turn him into Swiss cheese. Nope. Yeah. You fucked up. Nice gun. Go keep the general's forces at bay for a while. Let's get inside. Bunker team, retract the bridge and lower the blast door. We're coming in. <laughs> Just a fucking yard of corpses. We're in, lock it down. I know this place is built like a fortress, but is it safe now that the general's clued in? Yeah. I feel like a sitting duck here. I have no intention of sitting around, and you both should know I assume nothing. And on that front, Nyreen, you left Omega fairly angry with me. I wasn't aware you'd returned. Explain yourself. The truth is, I never left. In fact, I went to great lengths to keep her. I'm not easily duped. Well done. 
I just couldn't leave. Considering all this, I wish I had. Well, you always said I'd be the death of you. Irene has military training. We can put her to good use. You're so quick to trust, huh, Shepard? And Irene never approved of Omega's, what did you call it? Moral bankruptcy? Are you willing to help defend it now? You'll find me very willing to liberate this station. Your combat skills seem a little rusty, but you're still a good shot. See my duty officer. All right. Right. Keep an eye on her. Will do. All right, Shepard, we need to move fast. I'm itching for revenge. If you think I'm going to let you carve a bloody path through this campaign, you're sadly mistaken. And if you think you're going to change me, well, you're welcome to try. <laughs> Once up and running, this bunker will provide recon and secret access to much of the station. I'd appreciate it if you would quickly eyeball operations, see that things are setting up smoothly. Okay. What will you be doing? Checking in on my forces. I need to know how many survived the assault before I can plan the attack. Makes sense. It won't take long. Join me at the command console when you're ready. Okay. Okay, yeah, they're both basically biotic. Man. Hey, what's up? Human. Shut the fuck up. Okay, sorry. Yeah. One more try. Crap. What's up? What's the trouble here? Power inverters are shorting. Trying to find a workaround, but no go. They can probably be scrounged up somewhere on Omega. If you come across a set of carry inverters, bring them back here. I'll see what I can do. Sit tight. Rocky. Rocky, you there? I swear, if you don't answer soon, finally. Where are you? We don't know? Seriously? Look, just check your eyes. Rerouting system. Commander, if you have a moment. Uh, yeah, what's up? What is it? I've been tasked with increasing this command center's control of Omega's operating systems. I've hacked surveillance on many decks, tapped various internal communication conduits, but I can only reach so far. Okay. There are terminals in Cerberus controlled areas, and, well, you could get your hands on them. When you find these terminals, a simple input code will give me access privileges and more influence on station systems. Okay. Easy enough. Good. I'll keep an eye on my board and I'll let you know when my codes are activated. Thanks. Okay. Supplies are going to be tight. This area is still unsecured. Off limits for now, Commander. Well, I'm going to save here, and I'm actually going to call this stream for today. Uh, hope you all have a wonderful day. And uh, I hope I will see you all here on Monday, because I take Sundays off. Take it easy, everybody. Hope you all have a good one. Hello, YouTube. All right, let's jump back into where we were. Let me check the journal quick. Hack the terminal. Reach our is bunker. Okay. Just a reminder, Commander. When you find Cerberus terminals, please input my access code. Thank you. Yeah, will do. Hand out all the weapons. No use holding back gear. I'm just checking everything. I don't remember what I checked last time. Shepard. Huh? Oh, you're not a corp. Human. Oh, shut up. Man. 
Now tell me what's wrong. Power inverters are shorting, trying oh, to yeah. work around. Where you going? Sit tight. Man. Where's I was gonna say, where's Ari again? Okay. Oh, damn. As how are we looking? All systems operational. Full Omega schematics coming online now. Hey. Let's take a look. I see. Shepard, those force fields we saw, the general has them set up everywhere. He's controlling access across the station. Okay. What are these dark areas? Many sections of Omega are powered down. I'm betting power is being siphoned to run those force fields. Hmm. Find the source, priority one. And we'll need a full tactical assessment of all Cerberus positions. I'll get on it. Good. Shepard, we have work to do. Our losses were significant. We can't field an army large enough to face down Cerberus. Hi, I'm here. We need to find allies. Story of my life. We've confirmed there is a Merc gang that's still active. The Talons are resisting the occupation. All right. Not my first choice, but they're all we've got. Then it's time to play diplomat. And if the current leader won't join us, the next one will. Sorry to interrupt. What's up, Bray? What is it? I turned away for a second to offload supplies when I looked back. You lost her. Well, I... We're locked down. She's got to be here somewhere. This bunker has secret access points to other parts of the station. Unfortunately, Nyreen knows them. God damn it. Damn it, Bray. If I wasn't already short on manpower. We have to focus on getting the Talons on board. Yeah. Shepard, I'll meet you at the armory exit when you're ready to go. But don't keep me waiting. I won't. Don't worry. Where I gotta go. Uh, I've talked to who I need to. There was nothing over here I needed that I was That's aware. It. Everything we had is prepped and ready. It's not much. We can ask the scouts to keep an eye out for medical supplies. I thought about it, but I doubt Bray would go for that. I'll do it. You talk to the scouts. I'll handle Bray. I'll keep an eye out for med supplies. All right. Commander, keep an eye out for panels. I'll cross-reference. Thank you. All right, let's go. Okay, it's just the two of us. And oh, I thought I modded you up. Oh. We're good. Let's fucking rock and roll. What's your history with this gang? Some mutually beneficial dealings and some occasional violence. The Talons were even a blip on our radar until the plague in 2185. Your little war against the other gangs left a vacuum. Not my intention. Their leader, Darius, took advantage of the situation and carved the Talons a bigger piece of the local drug trade. All right. Are we enlisting them because they're good or because we need numbers? Numbers. Their cannon fodder, we're using them because they're the only game in town. You're going to let them know that? Relax, Shepard. This is how it works on Omega. Just let me do the talking and... Fuck. Looks like we fight our way through Cerberus to get to them. All right, we'll do. Let's move. And. Okay. 
hang on. Uh, you know, no, I'll, I'll, I'll stick with uh, Carnage. That's odd. Why would they leave crates of red sand lying around like this? Maybe they had something more important going on. Not Darius. Profit is the only thing that matters to him. Anything else can burn. Hmm. All right, up, up we go. One of these air shafts should lead us to Talon territory. The terminal is active. Thank you, Commander. Yeah, yeah. I will always take more credits. And down we go. Understood. Oh, good shit. Shit. Dark Souls roll. Oh, I thought I saw. Okay, I was gonna say, yep, I'm using the shotgun. Oh, I see. If I didn't go up there, I wouldn't have gotten the uh, mod. Okay. Oof, shit. Power's offline. Like they were using this to observe the detainment centers. Cool. Anything else? And I just leveled up, so. Uh. I'm actually going to put those both into. Cryo. Might as well give it a shot. That tower is the Talon outpost we're heading for. Looks like the Talons are given as good as they get. All right, let's go, go, go. But as always, before I head anywhere, gotta check for salvage, loot, gear, anything. Good. Understood.
I generally don't use melee, but eh, that was just effective. What I do? At the generator. Nothing. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh, oh, in the leg. All right, before we go anywhere, just checking her out. Check med station. Any more terminals? No, we're good. You good? Sorry, just getting some coffee in me. I was running a little. No function detected. Ooh. Oh, hi there. Sploosh. Okay. 
okay. I was like, wait, where do I go? And then I'm like, oh yeah, I should just. Hi. Oh, hey. Ow. Oh, thank you. Hey. Good old warp. Take care of the wounded and scavenge what you can. I want us out of here ASAP. You heard the boss. Move it. Looks like we found the Talon leader. My, my. Nyrene, aren't you full of surprises? Arya, the deception was necessary. I needed to figure out what your plans were. The people on Omega depend on us. I couldn't risk compromising our operation. Not exactly standard procedures for a street gang. When Cerberus invaded, the Talons were a mess. I brought a new direction. Ah. So, D-Boy is the dead? The general's been hunting us ever since. Right now, he's attacking one of our outposts. That's where I need to be. We're done here, boss. Right. Arya, Commander Shepard, whatever you're here for, the answer's no. Kindly escort yourselves off Talon territory. Let We're here us... to help. We'll talk about it after we reach your outpost. That's a generous offer. Arya, does the commander also speak for you? Yeah. <laughs> Not the way I would have put it, but that's the idea. Okay, and All there's right. mods. Come with me. No, you have mods here. You have... Give me, give me back control. Yo, uh... Oh yeah, definitely. I'm. G I was gonna say. I'm You've improved your biotics since last I saw you. You notice the biotic grenades? You always did like blowing things up, given half a chance. Of course. Blowing shit up is fun. All right, let's go. I might, yeah, I might just keep upgrading Cryo. And do the one where it gives it to everybody in the squad. It would make, like, shattering people and shit, like, uh, geez, here. Alright. Rampart mech incoming! Oh, fuck. They did. Oh shit! Hi! Oh fuck. Nope, nope.
Okay. It was an idea. Alright, here we go. Let us continue on. Oh, elevator music. Sorry about that, was just finished with my coffee. This way. All right, up we go. Check in every corner. A little bit more money. Oh, I was like, oh shit. No, 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 no. God damn it. Sure. I suppose. Come on, Ari. Oh, I see. Yep. Just gotta keep sliding down. Sit the fuck down. So my meat god just got to slam his car door a few times. Lockdown system's been compromised so many times it hardly knows up from down anymore. I'm Irene to base. Need an engineer at the catwalk entrance. Door jammed again. This may take a moment. Oh shit, that works.
lovely. Doors open. Let's go. Hurry up. I need to get to my people. Boss. What's up? It's good to see you, boss. Oh, good. You had that ready to go as well. That's good to fucking see. Okay. How we doing? Anyone need healing? Oh, all right, we're clear. Up we go. Or we'll, yeah, up we go. Up. We'll be evacuating this location as soon as possible. Try not to interfere with my people's work. I'm not. Intel just reported in. The group of civilians we managed to evac arrived safely at the other outpost. Good, good. Oh, oh shit. Also, routine sweeps reporting nothing new on the adjutant's presence. Adjutants? Creatures created by Cerberus. They eviscerate their victims' DNA, converting them into more adjutants. Ugh. Some kind of Reaper-based weapon. I fought them before. They're a nightmare. It got worse after you left. Cerberus lost control of them. Those things tore apart the gangs. Then attacked everyone Oh, inside. those have got to be those phantoms. If Cerberus hadn't found a way to contain them, the entire station would be infected by now. Keeping your people alive through that couldn't have been easy. I watched friends get turned into monsters. And I had to kill them. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have an outpost to defend. The adjutants really got under her skin. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh. Oh, yeah, that's exactly the one I wanted. what I do. Here, we found more medical supplies. All yours. I thank you. I'll make sure that it's true. Okay, we're good. Where is Aria? It's Nyrene. But before that, obviously I want to check everything. It's like you've got a few people. Alright. Cerberus is backing off for now. Make sure the scouts keep an eye out for the next attack. You've done an excellent job, Nyrene. But I'll be taking over now. You know what happens to people who argue with me. And if I say no, you'll just kill me and take over? My people won't stand for that. <laughs> yes, they do seem nauseatingly loyal. Either way, I'll get what I want. Not this time. The truth is, none of us can do this alone. Our only chance is to join forces. You might be right. But the people of Omega are my priority. You take over one gang and you think you're ready to decide what's best for Omega? Nyrene, watch and learn. Ad. Everything's in place. The entire station's connected. People of Omega, I have returned. Cerberus believes they have beaten you. 
They believe they have you under control. They are gravely mistaken. You are the lawless of the galaxy. You cannot be beaten, and you will never be controlled. Be ready. Your chance to strike out against your oppressors is coming. Together we will take Omega back! <laughs> That's your plan? Throw civilians at Cerberus? Anything is better than being locked up like mindless animals waiting for slaughter. I know what you're up to, Arya. And I don't like it. I have civilians to evacuate. I'll deal with this later. All right, let's get these people ready to go. Now! What are you trying to do? Trying? The people of Omega. My people. Love a good street fight. When it breaks loose, they'll be ready. Ah. Nyrene's code of ethics won't let her sit by if civilians are exposed. It's what makes her utterly predictable and therefore easy to manipulate. Cerberus is launching another offensive. Looks like I'm not the only one who didn't like your little speech, Arya. Glad I got his attention. Commander, landing pads are yours. My people and I will hold the main doors. Got it. All right, landing pad. I got you. This should be fun. Damn. All right. I just want to make sure Arya had it. I guess you could call that a scatter shot. Where the fuck am I getting? Oh, there you are. Some bitch. Give me. I'm coming. We're on our way. Move it, move it, move it. Checking for any loot or any. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Oh shit. Oh. Wiki wiki. Yeah, yeah, wiki wiki. Anyone else I can res quick? Y'all got fucked up. Okay.
That hurts. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Whew. The Talons will join your cause. Someone's got to make sure you don't run roughshod over our people. You see, Shepard. Let me guess. She said I was predictable and therefore easy to manipulate. Yep. Pretty much word for word. She thinks she's playing you. Nothing new here. One thing, though. I maintain command over my people. This is not up for debate. Just have them ready. Oh, they'll be ready. Oh, boy. All right. We're almost there, Shepard. The Talons will be the frontline fodder. Now we just need to bring down the force fields to clear the way to afterlife. Which will release Omega's civilians. Cerberus will have a million fires to put out. In one fell swoop, we'll have the people in the Talons working for us. You might not want to compromise your alliance before it even takes shape. I've learned not to put much stock in truth and goodwill. It might be time to start again. Tell you what, I'll take it under advisement. Now, I'll be at the command console plotting our next move. Mm. Oh, shit. Things are starting to heat up over here. Urgently, I need to bring you in your attention, fast. if yep. you please. Tentative excitement. Welcome to Harris Emporium, human. Relieved. I am grateful for Aria's return. Hidden back room was getting confining. Her patrol liberated me. Cunningly, I have a plan to recoup my losses since the Cerberus takeover. Informative, the general threw out Arya's couch from afterlife upon taking over. <laughs> I would like to gain her favor by returning it. Temptingly, if you find it and send me the coordinates, I will make it worth your while. It's not a priority, but I'll keep my eyes open. Appreciative. Upon success, I will give you a finder's fee for your trouble. Sweet. I'll let you know. Courteously, have a nice day. Take a look All right. at the kiosk if you want to buy anything. Ah. Uh, we got. Nothing at the bump. Relax. I got this. I like the katana. Oh, I see. All right, one moment just so to make sure. Hydration complete. I want to buy up. I think I figured out where you are. Oh no. 
access to critical areas. The frontal assault should be less treacherous. Okay, good shit. Alright, how are ya? I'm gonna save first. Talk to me, As. I've located the source that's powering the Cerberus force fields. Oh boy. Yes, I see. Shepard, take a look at this. What's up there? The general is siphoning power from one of my main reactors deep in the bowels of Omega's mines. Unfortunately, access is cut off by the force fields themselves. Not completely. There's an open route through that dark area, then up. Hmm. The processing plant for one of the mines. It's been powered down. No force fields blocking it. We infiltrate there, find our way through the mine, then take that elevator to the reactor's back door. Got it. Good eyes, Shepard. Let's go. Not without me. Oh, hey. Aria, my patrol, caught her in the perimeter. Please, you didn't catch me. We're allies now. Didn't Arya tell you? Nyrene was expected, Bray. Return to your station. The Talons are ready, but if I'm sending my people into the breach, I want to make sure those force fields come down for good. So like it or not, you're stuck with me. It's almost as if you don't trust me. <laughs> it's exactly as if I don't trust you. We're going to war together. I'll make sure we can rely on each other. Agreed, Commander. Glad one of you isn't on a power trip. Go wait by the med bay, Nyrene. We'll join you shortly. Shepard, I have last minute orders to dole out. I'll meet you there too. Right, I'm just gonna say this. Arya's got a fantastic booty. Just saying. There was no other comment Baha besides that, just goddamn. Shepard, got a second? Yeah, what's up, Nyrene? I know time is short, but I was hoping we could talk. Alone. Arya will be joining us soon. Now may be our only chance. What's up? I'm not trying to undermine Arya. I know she has to be ruthless. Let her have revenge. I'm not doing this for me, and I'm not doing it for Arya or what we once had. It's for the people of Omega. I get it. Someone has to be their voice in all this. Incredibly powerful forces are about to do battle with them caught in the middle I just hope as we bring down those force fields and go to war that you can keep the people in mind I've heard you Nyreen at the end of the day. That's all I can ask yeah. I'll be ready Fucking rock Hey, we're good. Do I have any? Eh. I'm actually just realized. Yeah, we're good. All right, let's fucking rock and roll. We're arriving at one of the ESO processing plants. It's been powered down, so we'll have to pry open the door. I'll get it. Access to the mine should be on the far side. And the reactor is beyond that? According to the schematics. I ran Omega and Irene. I didn't work the mines myself. No, you had indentured servants for that. Spirits. Relax. They're all Cerberus. They've been ripped to shreds. <sighs> I don't like this. Adjutant. Okay.
All right, what do you got for me in here? Enemies, things to shoot, more loot. More dead. Oh, blood bath. Jesus. Got bad feeling. We shouldn't be quiet. What's that sound? An adjutant. Oh no. General must have locked this place down to keep it inside. Okay. It is a fucking bloodbath. Jesus. Always worth, always worth checking. The elevator to the mines is through that door. It's deactivated. Then we need to power this place up. There should be a master circuit breaker somewhere. I have a feeling. Pipes power the door. We should follow them. Power the door? Oh. Okay. Up we go. Up this ladder. I'm coming, I'm coming. Just searching around. Need to find the power breaker. Follow the pipe. Yes, yes. I have a feeling you want to get piped a lot, are you? <laughs> But that's neither here nor there. The whispering's receding. Maybe the adjutant doesn't like its odds. Don't kid yourself. I've seen one of those things take down a squad of soldiers. Down this ladder. I'm going, I'm going. There's the power control. And, and I'll hit just a second. All right. Boop. When this is over, there'll be a lot of repairs to make. I hope you'll focus on the civilian areas first. You are relentless. That's one thing we have in common. <laughs> Spirit. Oh, hi. Unload on it. Nineteen, wake up. There we go. I'm expecting more adjutants now. Another one. Oh shit. Pirate will. Where? I 
damn. I'm just worried, like, are all these fuckers gonna turn into, uh, adjutants? Shepard, look alive! More adjutants! Where the fuck you at? We can't let them escape! Drexel's roll. Rolly poly oly. Alright, into the elevator. I'll seal the door. Just in case. On to the mines. Alright. Just processing. It's clear the general sealed that area to keep the adjutants in. Along with some unlucky soldiers. Yes. The creatures killed them didn't turn them into more adjutants. Hmm. Can't shake it. Something's off. You're just spooked. There's a rhythm to this place, Arya. To Cerberus. If he'd stuck it out here, maybe he'd feel it too. Whatever's in our way, we deal with it. I can hear the drills. Damn it. They shouldn't be straining like that. Cerberus must be working them hard. to the reactor is somewhere on the upper level. Let's find a way up there. <laughs> All right. Any mods or anything? Oh, I just bought charge. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's Ezo. Rob element zero? We got pipes leaking. I was hoping to shut that off. Hi, uh. where are you getting a shot on me from? Oh, hi. Your aim with the grenade is kind of shit. Where are you at? Come on. Let's play the biotic boom. Got it. one 
Damn it, and I can't charge it. That's rude. Oh, hi. Thanks for coming into charge range. Always got to check. Okay, you're dead. All right, let's go. Lots of fucking just random. Bastards are running this place too hot. It'll burn out in a month. <laughs> the biotic butt fuckery continues. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Head up. I'm already up here, fucker. Where's fucking Arya's couch is my question. a shot on you. Oh look. Some new people who just signed their own death warrant. Hi. You made a terrible mistake. You too. Oh hi. How's it going? Oh you're a l you survived more than I thought. Oh, you're... Hi. I'm just having fun with this now. <laughs> walk, 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 walk. Blap. Gats the elevator. I'm about to. Hey, cool. Oh, I need one more. All right, yeah, I'm just going to make their overload over overload fucking nasty. Oh yeah, I got fucking laser focus. Kind of. Any loot? Oh yeah, you're all set up. Congratulations! Ski 
shoot. Looks like Cerberus invaded here. Killed everyone. Now we're paying them back in kind. I'm sure your dead workers feel much better now. Eh. Uh, it's at least giving me a nice little chunk of change, I'll say that much. The elevator to the reactor is across the way. Alright. Over under on Called it. Oh. Be careful. This place is falling apart. Yeah, I noticed, and uh over how long before one of those collapses? Three, two, one. Oh shit. Alright, there's I just know there's gonna be a big fucking firefight when I get up. Not being attacked anymore. Yeah, same. Yep, be ready for anything. I, I, same. I was like, wait, what? All right. Understood. I was like so confused. I was like, I was expecting like a big fucking firefight. Or it's going to collapse like right here. I'm going to save. Or something's going to be going. Right. I'm expecting. Why are you grinning, Aria? We're almost there. When the force fields come down, this war finally begins. For some of us, it started months ago. That wasn't War of Eight. That was just warm up. Okay. Jesus. There's the reactor. Straight ahead. Yeah, I can see it. Oh boy. And it, yeah, you said it's running fucking hot. There we go. I commend you. Your plan of attack was impeccable. Thanks. Looks like we were expected. More like lured. I knew the reactor would be the hard target. I gave you no choice but this route. Ah. It's too bad you're on the elusive man's side, Petrovsky. I'm on humanity's side. You're the ones trying to start a war. For the glory of Arya. But now it's over. This isn't over until your next of kin can't identify you. I love your bravado, but have the sense to know when you're beaten. You've been neutralized and I can leave you there to rot. You might as well give up. Never! Arya, what are you thinking? I'm not going out like this. Arya, don't! <laughs> To do. Overload your force field. Damn it, Arya, you're forcing my hand. Arya. I literally was like Ow Oh why am I Oh Cause I keep stepping over the fucking body God damn it
I gotta keep them off, are ya? Even I can tell that. Ah, motherfucker. Strong up a biotic is she? Like, goddamn. gonna be me solo Let's fucking go At least that was quick. A for biotic charge. Alright, you're not gonna like this. You can't do this, Commander. There's more at stake than you know. That reactor powers life support systems for dozens of wards across the station. Shut it down and thousands of people perish. You hearing this, Arya? Yes, and I don't care. Shut it down! Hold tight down there. Rerouting the power to maintain the other systems. Are you crazy? We're almost spent. Nyreen, watch your flank. This is who you're working for, Shepard. She doesn't care who gets hurt. What are you waiting for? Oh, load the reactor. She'd just throw thousands of lives away. Shepard, Nyreen's down. I'm stabilizing her. This shouldn't be that hard. Maybe something inside is holding you back. Maybe deep down you're starting to think the galaxy might be better off without her. She's never going to learn. She'll never change. Even if you win, nope. Omega loses. Enough. Okay. I didn't overload it. Yeah, you got a lot of ammo. <laughs> oh, look. Okay, everyone made it through. Thank fuck. You okay? Despite your best efforts to kill me, your soft heart almost cost me everything. Quiet, Aria. It worked. Shepard saved us without sacrificing innocent lives. I applaud her. I suppose. 
Whatever. <laughs> you fought bravely against those mechs in there, Naomi. Very impressive. But why can't you bring that same grit when adjutants attack? It's pathetic. You tense up at the mere mention of those abominations. Lay off. She just saved you. I'm trying to help her, Shepard. Call it tough love. Yeah, but you're a psycho. We're starting. I don't mean to miss it. She's never been big on thank yous. Shocking. <sighs> Getting reports. All force fields down. Civilians taking to the streets in droves. Cerberus pulling back. That won't last. The people don't have the training to go up against Cerberus front lines. They'll be wiped out. Civilian casualties can't be avoided. You'll have to accept this. Say what you will, Arya. I won't allow senseless deaths. Do what you can to protect them. Of course, Commander. Report. My team is scouting the maintenance tunnels. We've encountered Cerberus forces escorting engineers. They're moving gear. Look to be sending explosives to the station's central support columns. Oh. Bray, engage. Delay them as long as you can. We're coming. Got it. Roll out, people. They mean to try and take down Omega. Detonate the main column. They'll cut off the way to afterlife. The Talon offensive will be stopped cold. So we split up. Yes. Nyreen, lead the frontal assault. Shepard and I will meet you in the markets after we've taken care of those bombs. Of course. But don't count on me building your memorials if you get yourselves killed. <laughs> I like it when you're feisty. The only route to the central column is through the tunnels. Give it. up Yeah, good luck. Done. Yeah. I'll be with you in just a second, just checking for any more. Nope, we're good. Okay, we're good on ammo. Irene here. We've engaged servers and cleared our first target. ETA to the Gozu district is on track. Excellent. Eric, found what you wanted. Sending you the coordinates now. Is that my couch? Yep. Yes, it was your couch. All right, let's go, 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 go. <laughs> we need to get to the central column before Cerberus sets off those bombs. Okay. Ah. <laughs> I'm going, I'm going.
Good. They're messing with the support columns. We have to stop them. What the? Charge the fucker! I've got plenty of shields. Arya, watch my back. I want to I want to be able to freeze more often. Shepherd. Yeah. That's going to be all fucking sorts of nasty. One diff Coming, I'm coming. What's up? We're clear. Good. Nyreen, things are under control here. What's your situation? We're advancing to the Gozer district. Move forward. Keep that flank covered. All right, we got it. Oh shit. Yes, boss. There, take it easy, Nyreen. We're holding our own, but Cerberus has started targeting the civilians. Reports of casualties are coming in from all sectors. Save those you can. And head for the rendezvous point. We'll meet you there. We'll do what we can. Nyreen out. So how exactly do we get to afterlife from here? I'm thinking the straightforward approach for a change. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. I don't know if that was warp or overload or what it was, but it was sexy. Ooh, what that? 
Oh, yes. Cerberus, how do you know that? Could be the town. Oh, never mind. <laughs> How do you know that could be? Oh shit. The yeah, adjutant, I, that's yeah, not good. Ash, there are adjutants here. Track our progress and seal the rooms behind us. Okay. Looks like they bit off more than they could chew. We should get a move on. What the fuck? Oh. Well. You see where it came from. The ones we saw earlier. Test edge. Extra security. The doors only open one at a time. Makes sense considering what they had locked up in here. Doors unlocked. Let's get out of here. Yeah. That doorway leads to the Gozu district. where we gotta go. Probably gonna have to find another adjutant soon. My brain goes probably have to go up here. I want to become... Oh, hey! Let's get a fucking ban for you. I hate goddamn bots. Bite me. Do I want to become famous? No, I want to stream and have a community. <sighs> this looks familiar. I liked it better when Morden Solis was here shooting up looters. <laughs> yeah. I miss Morden.
Oh. Ooh. This is why I check. Every little bit of extra credit helps. Fuck yeah! What the? We're almost there. Cool. Don't mind me just knocking every sort of fucking head off with that. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Friendly's incoming. Friendly's. Sweet. Huh. What's going to happen to us? Keep your fucking head down and don't get shot. You're good. For the blight that is humanity's main goal. I do want to see if I can, what would be the best, uh, got my back, bro. Let's go. Oh, hey, are you? Irene here. Something's not right. Uh-oh. Cerberus is still on my station. Of course something's not right. Not what I was talking about. I'm checking this out. Going radio silent. What the hell is she doing? In checking something out. Where's Nirene? Scouting ahead. We've got our hands full holding this area. She's going on to afterlife. Oh boy. God damn. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, they're not. Oh fuck. What the fuck? Adjutants. What the fuck is it used with? Oh no, okay. Oh boy. What the f oh Jesus.
Fuck. All right, let's do this. Nirene Candros was a good soldier. It's a shame she had to die for your petty ambitions. You're a dead man. No, wait. <laughs> what now, Petrovsky? Divide and conquer, Commander. Kandros killed the adjutants we hadn't finished experimenting on. They are still fully under our control. The prototypes for our future army. Yeah, I know. Oh, thanks for being the exact target. I need it. Yeah. Payback's a bitch, ain't it? Sorry, I just scratched my nose. No, come here. Come here. Where are you at? Yeah. and desist all aggression. It's over. Oh, yeah. Oh, you can say that, but... Uh... Appreciate it. Shepard, I surrender myself into your custody. Oh, no, 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 no. That is the most pathetic thing I've ever heard. <laughs> Shepard, am 
unarmed, and I can get the Alliance intel on the elusive man. Nope. No, I'm gonna let Arya kill you. You'll say anything to save your skin. I, I let you escape, Omega. I deserve mercy. Is this true, Arya? Yes. Cerberus had successfully taken the station, and he let me go. Do you feel that, Oleg? That's death. Only inches away. Remember this feeling. I'm letting you go. For my partner and for the war against your master. You better cooperate. Oh. Okay, I thought I was going to have to Paragon. to see you've had a calming effect on Ms. Taloke. I just want to... I tried talking sense into her one time. I look forward to hearing how you pulled it off. I just punch him. Don't assume you know where this is going. What? From what I understand, high-ranking alliance... Now that I've seen what you're capable of firsthand, maybe Arya's instincts were right. So, you're going to execute me. I'm your prisoner. You can't just shoot me in cold blood. Uh, okay. If you don't tell the Alliance everything, I'm giving you back to Arya. Bray, get him out of here. Woo! I could have clipped him. I was thinking about it. Not gonna lie. I was thinking about it. But... You've got good control, Shepard. I know it's hard to resist that impulse. Oh, yes, I know. I've been waiting to kill that man for months. Walk around with you for a few hours and I go all soft. <laughs> You're like a disease. This victory came at a cost, Arya. It's not soft to recognize that. You sound like someone trying to sell something. I admire your tenacity. And thanks to you, I have Omega back. Yeah. The citizens of Omega have been through a lot, Arya. Try to remember that. How can I forget? There are reminders everywhere I look. And don't worry. I'll honor our arrangement. Troops, ships, and a mountain of Ezo. You earned it. Then I'll be going. Yeah. Bray will take you back. I have a station to whip into shape. Citizens of Omega, hear me. I, Arya Talok, have given you back your lives. My rule is reignited. My hand is on the controls once more, and I will not let go again. Each of you owes a debt. Gain my favor by rounding up the remaining Cerberus invaders and... We will cast them from our home, then bury and mourn our dead. My methods haven't always been popular, and I can't promise that will change. But securing this station and everyone inside it is now my primary purpose. No one will imprison us again. We may be bruised. We may be bloodied. Omega. You always get these crap details, Bray? <laughs> Not this time. You got a galaxy to save. Let's get you up this rock. Let's fucking roll. <laughs> Sorry. That's an amazing eye catch at the end. Just a Cerberus dude getting dragged like, oh fuck, and this turn's like, alright, we gotta talk. Oh. Thank you. How am I doing for... Dang! 
Damn, okay, I am actually got a decent fucking bit in there. Good shit. Alright. I will be right back. I just need to use the washroom. And yes, that is Omega Complete. Be right back. I have a tent. And my headphone card was wrapped around my fucking chair. That's what I want to check. Terminus fleet. Jesus. Yeah. Oh. I thought I had to turn that in. Go back to the Citadel, let's see if I can find that. Gotta go to the Presidium Embassy. Commander. What's up? <laughs> Not getting fish this time because they kept fucking dying. Oh shit. Ooh, there's lots more. Might be a Sorry, uh, upstairs neighbors, there was just a very, very loud thing. Okay, blood dragon armor is probably... Ooh.
I don't want to purchase it unless I like. Well, I'm definitely grabbing that. And bench. One moment. I'm just checking something. Huh, I'm just thinking, what do I want? Nah, 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 nah. You know what? Fuck it, yeah, give me the wraith. Uh, yep. Oh god, that's dirty. Alright. 
Alright, my next big upgrade will be armor though. I'm just, I've got a dirty fucking shotgun now, and I like it. Let's see if I can. I found something. I'm just being careful since this is a, uh, I'll be running away from the Reapers very soon. Hey. Ah! Reapers eluded. Oh, oh, oh. oh boy. Oh fuck. Woo! That was a lot closer than I would have liked. I found something. There we go. All right, there we go. Come on. I do that. Is there a field people here? Fuck. Well, I hope I can make it there and back. Signal confirmed. 
confirmed. Oh, excellent. Ah. Thank fuck. Eh. All right, uh, somewhere I haven't looked. Uh, fuck. All right. All right, I am not gonna keep playing fucking chicken with the reapers. Dig site. All right, yeah, let's head. Oh, and I'm gonna bring Yavik, the red armor, because that looks dope. And I'm gonna bring Edie. Is this me? Oh, fuck yeah. 100%. Yes. Oh, jeez. Ooh. Fucking solid. I understand we have reports of an attack on a group of scientists. Yes. The attack means the Reapers are one step ahead of us. We need to pick up the pace. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Oh, yeah, that's right. Tess? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifact she uncovered may have caused additional complications. Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. And if it's Prothean, Yavik. Oh wait, no, it's like Reaper in origin. We have hostile. Oh fuck. Take us in. Commander, on the landing platform. That's her. Hang on. There, go. Jump. We have 
Alliance Navy. It's too dangerous. We'll come to you. Yes, okay. You should take the elevator up on the far side. Fucking hell. Copy that. We're on our way. Shit, I'm done. Fuck, I probably left loot there. Oh, wait. Oh, there it is. Up, 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 up. Looks like a bridge over there. Controls are broken. Someone try to fix it. Yes, Commander. This crude wiring has failed. I'll need a moment. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Fine. Copy that. Wait. Okay. Wait. Am I complete dumbass? fucking space casing right now. Oh fuck. Yeah, it's good. 
Oh yeah, I, I completely fucking space cased. Well done. Oh yeah, I should probably uh, uh, map that power to that. And I'm, yeah, I'm gonna do your absolutely fucking plague. Yeah. We're blocked. Find another way. Fuck. Working on it. Yeah. Jesus. I only get two shots per, but fuck me if they, this is just like a great like god tier ow double barrel I'm always appreciative of a good blurp. Oh, fuck. Okay.
Okay, yeah, more meta gel. Okay, thank fuck. All right, let's go, 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 go. Elevators online. Coming up. Please hurry. I think Hawkins is dead. Yep. He tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. <laughs> Dumbass. Where did everyone go? I'm sorry. They didn't make it. Doctor, I need you to come with me. Oh, God. Yes, of course. Keep your fucking head down, Anne. I uh, was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Commander, look. Hmm. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a reaper, but acting alone. Not like any reaper we've seen before. Ah. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact. Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people, their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. No, Not you're... strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Hmm. Get down! Oh, boy. What are they doing? Powering up. They've activated this. I've never managed anything They've learned too well. The darkness must not be breached. Shepard, take it out. Yes, Commander. You okay? Cortez, we have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle? You run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. Oh, yeah. I just unstuff while listening. I completely, I couldn't even fucking see. gonna die again because okay that's fucking brutal
Fucking hell. I was gonna say I was standing right beside explosive barrels. Can I actually hit the fuck? I was in cover. Can I actually hit the fucking thing now? Get in the house. Get it's like get in the fucking ship. You okay? Yeah, Commander. I I think so. I blacked out. No, you didn't. Leviathan took control of you. We cut the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself. That's incredible. Ah. Uh. Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first, Doctor, I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers, never went back to dark space, like a rogue or even a defector. Mm. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne. You need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. I'm sorry. He's... What? Dead? He can't be dead. We met with him, hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine. The next. He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Mm. And? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation to meet you there. Oh. Okay, where is the Shrike Abyssal? My next biggest question. Oh, 
There we go. Oh, thank fuck. Okay, start my scanner. Break a bissel, fucking Christ. Don't get me wrong, okay. Boy. Alright, Z chat is done. Uh, I guess they're a lot more active around uh, mass relays. Makes sense. Signal confirmed. Oh shit. Boy, devils. Take all the free fuel, though. Don't get it twisted. Right. Yeah, I'm going to clear out the Shrike Abyssal. Thank you. Oh, come on, work with me. Nope. Reaper's 
You heard it. Where the fuck is that last P? Yeah. Faster than light jump successful. I know there's one more. God. Evasion successful. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Well, I got what I needed. Jump to the Crescent Nebula. I want to see if there's any other little bits I can pick up. Signal confirmed. Ooh, uh, I was going to say some fuel would be very much appreciated right about now. Oh, and it's just this one. Nice. I'm just, I'm just gonna fucking spam it. I know I'm gonna have to put the reapers in a minute anyway. <laughs> All right, worth a shot. Just to be a dick. <laughs> oh my! I am living on that pixel. All right. Can I do? Assets? Huh, that's odd. So there's nothing in the Ismar frontier. Signal 
Woo! There's just a lot of stuff all of a sudden. I will. left up here again but let's head back to the citadel we've got a few things we can uh to dock normandy do you need ground transport uh i need to get to the embassies yes commander all right let me through Tell me you have found my son. Not yet. According to the council, these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. Think. Hello, dear. Perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for my son. But we spoke about this already you about his mission and nonsense i just filled out the paperwork he's very punctual his majesty he checks in every week is it oh i think i recovered the obelisk you mentioned from the shrike abyssal it's waiting in bay D24. Really? Thank you, Earth Clan. Were your people involved in a secret construction project of some sort? <laughs> I am certain this obelisk would help. Thank you again, Earth Clan. Our military stresses is organized. Let's keep it going. Let me know when you've had a chance to talk to Sedaris. Hey. Commander, I expect you're curious about Lieutenant Commander Williams. Ashley said you offered her Spectre status, and that she'd accept it. It is true. The Council is in dire need of loyal agents. Williams is among the first of many. It's about time someone recognized Ashley's contribution. Yes, her service record <laughs> speaks for itself. She's a survivor, a warrior, and most importantly, she is incorruptible. I will be keeping her close. Do not worry. The time, my schedule has a way of catching up to me. Will this be all? I should go. I'll be here. All right. Just checking in. All right. Uh, 
and oh uh no okay now i'm just trying to figure out what says i need Yeah, I already talked to you. I'm trying to think where else I need to go. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. Uh I think I need to go back to comments. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Don't be left out in the cold. Ask about our full service warranties. Oh, I have enough for. Please visit any of our Elcos Combine affiliate branches for any and all. Welcome to Kanala Exports. Oh, yep. At Kanala Exports, we believe that a peaceful heart is we a strong heart. Your visit. Guess who's gonna be rocking the Blood Dragon armor because. That power. Where is this going? If, if this isn't serious, then we need to talk. These are two different things. You're important to me, but I, it's not healthy to rush for more than this. Well, I just want to rush for more friends. Do you mind? Okay. Do I have anything that homeboy wants? Got some pieces for you. Done deal, Commander. Check in with General Oraka. You'll see I'm making CSEC very happy. Done. Yes. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds from today's purchases go to preparing for war efforts. Where'd homeboy go? Oh, he's here. I'm an idiot. I thought he was lower. Commander Shepard, I was just contacted by a black market dealer who's donating high-end weapons to CSEC. Mm -hmm. He wanted you to know. Sounds like you came through. And the Blue Suns can go about their business. Now we'll be focusing on Citadel defense. It won't bring Palavin back, but it's something. Thank you, Commander. Hey, it's what I do. Okay. Okay, that's done. Okay, now I need to go sit it out. Refugee camp. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay E24. Emerge. Oh. Bow. So he's clearly not indoctrinated. Who's opposing him? An 
unnamed Hanar recently posted here from Kaje. I'll check transit records for incoming Hanar. It all comes down to the war, and you trying to pull everyone into it. <laughs> Would you rather the Reapers win? I'd rather spend whatever time I have left with KG. KG wouldn't want you to spend all your time. Well, he shouldn't have died then. <laughs> Aww. So I right, where's the preacher? I recovered your pillars of strength from the kite's nest. They're yours, waiting in Bay D twenty four. All right. Ow. All right. A lot of the stuff I need is over here. Hey, saying, what's up? <laughs> Men, get ready for trouble. What? Not here for that, Zane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Saying you should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. <laughs> Done. All right. Got a list of new Hanar arrivals, Bao. Forwarding it to you. Damn. These are all face names. The Hanar names from the Alliance raid are soul names. And Hanar soul names are private. There's no public record. Can you get back to their personal communications? On it. Maybe we'll find names there. So how's the rest of the gang? Met up with anybody else? Garrus is helping out on the Normandy. He never could pass up a good fight. What about Jacob? Haven't heard from him. I thought you were happy with your memories of KG. Hey, I'm nostalgic, not dead. <laughs> the council withdrew the release order for Sedaris. Arya Talok of all people got him to do it. Crazy. I can say that again. Thanks for your help, Shepard. Val, here's the correspondence. If there's any mention of soul names, Ah. So he got his tentacles on some Reaper tech. Looks that way. I'm sending you the nav point for his office. I'll meet you there. Uh, where is it? Oh, I need to go back. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. Citadel embassies. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. But what are you? I have to know. Hey. Well done. 
Zamandis? Or should I say, regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair? It seems this one has been apprehended, but confinement is irrelevant. The work of the Enkindlers cannot be stopped. You're uh. insane, and we can't allow you to endanger your planet. We are taking you into custody. Your belief in your victory is mistaken. Our planetary defense network is largely automated. It can be disabled with a single virus. Oh. Which I have just uploaded. Damn it. Wait. A virus would be detected unless sent on low priority channels, which have a time lag. I may be able to block the upload. <laughs> you may be delayed. Help him. I'll handle this. Uploads disabled. Looks like we're in the. Wait. He's got some kind of failsafe. Get down! Oh, shit. She was here the entire time. She was an old friend. I intended to arrest her. Oh. She helped me take down the collectors and she just gave her life to save the. Oh, head. shit. She's dead? Fuck! Point taken. It was an honor to work with you, Shepard. When the time comes, I'll be there to return the favor. With a few friends. Shit. <sighs> you can come out now. Oh, fuck. I thought... To... Oh. How'd you know? Lucky guess. There's no way you're recruiting me to fight in a galactic war. <gasps> I thought you died. Technical experts. I'm not a scientist. No. But you're the best thief in the galaxy, and you can hack unfamiliar technology better than anyone. Uh. I could use your help. And think of it, all that expensive tech just lying around. It's not like they're going to check your pockets at the end of the project. You say the nicest things. All right. I'm in. And Shep, nice working with you again. Yeah. This spectre oh a spectre unit? Damn son Oh shit, I even got the drill backing me up. Why does it keep going that? I'm gonna go back to purgatory because I think I know the. I think I know where I can get some info about these. Now arriving at ward level purgatory. We're about talking to Commander Bailey some more about that guy scamming the refugees. Really? What would he say? Any idea how busy he is? He said I caught him out talking to some dumb like kid. Damn it! One of these days I'm going to shoot you. Didn't think I was making. Hey, Arya. It seems the galaxy can't keep us apart. Since we took back Omega, I've been consolidating my resources for the war. So, blood pack. It's a little easier to coordinate from here. So, unfortunately, I'll be slumming it on the Citadel for the time being. The Blue Sun's blood pack and Eclipse are in my pocket. I'll send them to you when you're ready for them. Is there anything on your mind? What exactly have I acquired? An army that's willing to fight dirty to do the things your respectable military... Guerrilla tactics. Eclipse mechs and Vorcha legions are excellent candidates for vanguards in any ground offensive. Well worth the little song and dance I had you perform, I'm sure. Whatever you say, Arya. Don't be a stranger.
Bop, bop, bop. Just always checking. I need to. Fe I feel like I need to actually finally continue with s the story. Nope. I need to go. I need to go to Dr. Bryson's lab. Yeah, she's mourning. Anne? Oh, Commander. Yes, I'm sorry. Just... This is hard. That's all right. I can come back. No, please. I'm okay. Seeing all this again... He was so obsessed. Crazy sometimes. I didn't get a chance to know him. Oh, sometimes I felt the same way. He was a great man. A pioneer. But he could be distant. I felt like an inconvenience growing up. You sound angry. I was angry. Still am, I guess. But sometimes... He was so full of stories, he nearly burst. I love that about him. It's why I signed up for this work. Aw. <laughs> I can't believe he's gone. We'll figure this out. We have to. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. We need your help. You're our last chance. You're right. Let me dig into my father's work to see what I can find. Anne, you sure you're up for this? Yes. When Leviathan took control of me, I remember being somewhat cold and dark. Everyone said that so my far. My father taught me to never be afraid of the dark. Mm. Oh, by the way, sorry if I'm a little bit quiet during this game. It's just there are a lot of cutscenes and a lot of, you know, VO that I'm just kind of letting play. All right. I'm still amazed your father got his hands on a piece of a reaper. He was so excited. Your claims validated years of work. Did you take appropriate steps to prevent indoctrination? Of course. It was completely shielded, and we all had regular psyche valves. Except now, thanks to the artifact, I'm indoctrinated anyway. Aren't I? Nope. Might as well be a Rachni drone waiting for orders from the Queen. Well. That would be a negative. It's shielded. Have you studied the Rachni? I wrote my dissertation on them. My father thought it was a waste of time, but now it might actually help us understand Leviathan. In what way? Hmm. We think of the Rachni as telepathic, but there's really no such thing. At short range, the queen uses pheromones to give orders. At long range, she uses an organic kind of quantum entanglement communicator. Whatever Leviathan does must be similar. Entangling particles to stimulate neural activity. Mm. It uses the artifact to establish a connection. And then it controls the mind of anyone near it. Huh. Hey, Lola. Need a hand? What brings you down here, James? Heard you're closing in on the Reaper Killer. Anything that can scare those bastards has to be worth a look. That's what I'm hoping. He's not wrong. We didn't detect any energy emissions from the artifact. 
but the Reapers were able to use the artifact to trace Leviathan somehow. My theory is that most of the time, the artifact simply acts as a receiver. You'll only be able to trace Leviathan through it when it actively takes control of someone. Oh. As it did on the asteroid. Right. Unless it needs something, Leviathan doesn't bother communicating. I guess it and my father had something in common. Hmm. You said Leviathan's control was similar to a quantum entanglement communicator, which is untraceable. Yes. But this isn't a natural key, you see. Leviathan has to send a pulse through the artifact to alter your mind and create the quasi-QEC effect. And that can be traced. Right. Just like at the dig site. The Reapers were tracing the signal by activating the artifact. My father wanted to be at that dig site. He was getting too old for long digs. But he hated being stuck in the lab. Mm. He nearly missed my graduation because he was on a dig. Showed up still wearing his field gear. God. He'd have hated dying here. Commander, you see this thing? This is great! Hey, Edie, the husk bites, they don't turn you into a husk or anything, right? I recommend you apply Metagel. <laughs> Dumbass. And I know this is hard, but if there's anything more you can tell us. I don't think there's anything more I can tell you, but maybe I can show you. What are you saying? The artifact only sends out a signal when Leviathan's controlling someone. So let it control me. You could trace the signal. Uh. You mean let it take you over? That's too dangerous. It's my call, not yours. You said I'm your last chance to find this thing. We have no idea what will happen. If we wait, the Reapers will get to Leviathan first. I'm the only one here who's spent enough time with it to do this. You're looking for something to fight the Reapers, Commander. I'm looking for the monster that murdered my father. We still don't know what we're looking for. Then let's find out. Commander, this thing we're doing with Anne sounds dangerous as hell. Noted. Edie? Energy signature locked in. Waiting for activation. You sure about this? Yes. I'm sure. Damn. I'm gonna be right here. Okay. I'm ready. James, drop the containment shield. Shield is dropped. Artifact online. Anything? Nothing yet. Wait. There's something. I feel a chill. Edie? No trace yet. Holy hell! Signal is tracking. Maintain connection. Turn back. The darkness can't be breached. Yo! <laughs> Maintain connection. Listen to me. I found you, and the Reapers are right behind me. You have brought them. You are a threat. So are you. I've seen what you can do. The war needs you. There is no war. There is only the harvest. Edie, do we have enough? Partial lock. Maintain connection to narrow the search. You heard her. We got enough. I'm hitting the shield. Do it. You okay? Anne. Anne, are you alright? I didn't want to risk yes. killing her. I think so. Did we get anything? Yes, but it will take some time to search. Coordinates sent to the Normandy. Good. It's a start. Commander, I sense something else. Anger. It knows we're getting close. <laughs> I think it wants to kill you. Come on. Let's get you some help. All right, we got three potential places.
And okay, turn to Normandy. Going on time. Yeah, we're all right. Okay, well, all right, we got to go here. I found something. than light jump successful. I found something. Oh, yep. Me that. Freezing ice. All right, let's go. I'm going to bring uh, Garrus and James. Team Beef.
Yep. Nice. Commander, I've got a hail from Admiral Hackett. Hey, what's up? Put him through, Lieutenant. Shepard, we've uncovered a secret service lab. Function unknown. We sent in a recon team, but they were forced to pull out before they got very far. Any other intel? We think they're using the facility to warehouse and study Reaper tech. We've been wondering how service is connected to the Reapers, and this might give us some answers. We're on it. Find out what Cerberus is doing and get me any Reaper tech samples you can, Commander. Hack it out. Confirmed. Thank you. Oh, hi. Wait, where are we at? to Metagel advances for Hanar. Only Cerberus would call that a failure. Oh shit. Okay, I've seen like three so far. That's four. We just need to hold out until Cortez can pick us up. Nothing like being stranded. Never said it would be easy.
How many lackeys you got? Because if they... Oh, hi. Good shit. Where you at? Oh, hi. Bop. Mr. Freeze Pun? What? No. Deal out. You know what's cooler than being cool? Ice. Hold. Should I keep going? Affirmative. Uh, I want to pick up more fucking Reaper tech. I could just, I can keep blasting these fucks in the head. Chill out. I don't. Oh, I. Oh man, I wanted to fucking loot more Reaper tech. There was like six shot uh, options. I was like, let me grab all that shit. Commander, we've got our best engineers looking at the Reaper tech you secured from that lab. What was Cerberus doing with it? We don't know yet, but whatever Cerberus is up to, it can't be good. Even if we can't determine its purpose, we've disrupted their experiments. I doubt they'll just close up shop. Agreed. We'll keep sending strikes against the facility. Good work, Commander. I'll keep punching them. I don't mind. 10,000 credits? Fuck yeah. Cerberus. Extra ration. A. Hey. Oh, damn. 
Okay. Through the tech lab. See the thieves in Caliban? Or at all. Them thieves are turning so fast. The birds don't quit when things get ugly. You've got new messages, Commander. Huh? Oh. Uh. Uh, oh, yeah. Now. Now that I bought it, I need to change my armor. Yes. I want that blood drag. That power damage. Like, you've seen how I fight. Like, 70% more power damage. That's just... Uh, that wakes up something in me. <laughs> okay. Signal confirmed. Oh. These coordinates match our trace of Leviathan. Leviathan. Uh, I'm going to bring Liara. Actually, yeah, Liara and Edie for this one. I'm going to be dealing with a lot of biotic bullshit, I feel. Cortez, what's the status on the probe we launched? Tracking it now, Commander. I've confirmed that Leviathan's signal originates from this planet. Heard how, uh, Anne helped us locate it. Pretty spooky stuff. I'm still not sure what we're expecting to find down there. Dr. Bryson classified Leviathan as a Reaper killer. It appears it doesn't wish to be found. It doesn't have a choice. We're here. But then what? If it turns out to be a Reaper... Are we really going to offer an alliance? Nobody says we have to be friends with it, but if this thing has the rest of the Reapers worried, then we need its help. Commander, new readings from the probe. It's narrowed down Leviathan's location. You're not going to like it. Let's hear it. There's nothing but ocean. Oh, boy. I show a concentration of structures floating on the surface, but the probe's giving us a signal below that. Way below. Underwater. Oh, boy. It looks that way. The shuttle should still be able to reach it. A destroyed? Possible. Kodiak is spec to nearly a thousand atmospheres. So I've never actually tested that. Guess we're gonna find out. Status! Some kind of pulse hit up! Systems are shutting down! Fuck! Brace for impact! Fuck! Ow! EMP. have been stranded here as well. We aren't the first to encounter that pulse. Could be Leviathan's last line of defense. Oh. Oh, it's an assault rifle. Oh, oh. How old these are? 
the bones are under <coughs> the scavengers. If they rotted clean from humidity and exposure, it might take more than that. Shepard, it's one of the artifacts. Explains why no one gets out of here. Yeah. I don't recognize any of these ships. How long have they been here? How many artifacts? It's no nice not being hungry, eh? The Leviathan just literally overrode their everything. Look, up there. Reapers, they were oh, right fuck. behind us. Protect the shuttle. Oh, God. Okay. Woo, fuck. Come 
Commander. But there's a development. Oh. We need to talk. Oh boy, that's not good. Until we find it. So how do we do that? Well, you might be able to use a mech. Looks like it's rigged for diving. Oh boy. Go underwater? In that thing? It can handle the depth. Not saying it'll be easy, but I don't see any other options here, Commander. Alright. Well, if that's what we have to do, then let's finish this. Shepard, perhaps you are unaware of the degree of risk. Are we seriously proposing? First, we'll need to restore power to get that cargo door open. How? I suppose we are. These old Ballard-class ships are equipped with exterior power sockets. They use them for emergency repairs. We can strip the cells from the shuttle and use those to juice. Hang on, I'll get you started. Got a cell for you, Commander. Find somewhere to plug that in. Take care of the fucking brute first. Trust y'all not to fucking fuck it up. One second. I saw loot. I was like, yeah, that's not.
Okay. I have to actually be in front of it. All right, Commander. Let's get you out of there, and I'll do a systems check. Shepard, I understand the reasons, but this is a big risk. We've come too far to stop now. The way home is through Leviathan. Okay, seals check out. Oxygen pressure is nominal. Systems are a go. It's as ready as I can make it. All right. Let's fucking do this. Let's go. Take care down there, Commander. Closing hatch. Engaging systems. Ready. Testing comm link. I read you. Here goes. <laughs> Where are you, you big ugly bastard? That's good so far. Copy that. Cortez? Cortez! Oh boy. God damn it. Why did it? Oh. Grab pull and shockwave. It's the major descent. Not so much from here. Suit is warming up. Emergency systems have come online. Life support operational. Oh, there we are. The scanner indicates the probe is below my position. And for a way down. down all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. I'm not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Don't worry about that now. I'm not shooting those, by the way. I need some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. Probe directly below me. Looks like final drop. All right. Can't see anything just yet. Three, almost. Uh. Oh fuck. Uh, how deep is this fucker? Oh, that's... Bro! Found the probe. Seems intact. I'm gonna keep moving. I think we 
don't know what that is. Wait, is, is that a reaper? No. Anne? What's happening? Your memories give voice to our words. Your nature will be revealed to us. Accept this. The galaxy's at war with the Reapers. You defeated one. Why aren't you fighting back? There is no war. There is only the harvest. Then help us stop it. None have possessed the strength in past cycles. Your own species can be destroyed in a single thought. But you are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. The destruction of Sovereign. The fall of the Collectors. The Reapers perceive you as a threat. And I must understand. Ooh, that's not good. that machine despite what you saw the other races experience. Why? You cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. They created and now the we Reapers. The price for your mistake. There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. How did you remain hidden all this time? Our extermination was not complete. Some survived and found refuge in the dark corners of the galaxy. I am their progeny. Over the cycles, the four races were controlled, removing traces of our existence as we directed them to. In this way, our survival was kept secret from the Reapers. Today, we reach out through the fragments and watch for discovery. Fragments? You mean the artifacts we found? Yeah. They provide a window into the galaxy. Tools for exploring the events of this cycle for the safety of this world. Through them, we watch, we study, and remain in the shadows. How did the intelligence defeat you? To find a solution, it required information. 
physical data drawn from organic life in the cosmos. It created an army of pawns that searched the galaxy gathering this data. Hmm. There was no warning. No reason given when they turned against us. Only slaughter. Only the harvest. Tell me about the Reapers. Each harvest ends with the birth of a Reaper. Perfect in its design. Each form in harbinger's image. Our image. Each Reaper has the power to influence organics. Over countless cycles, this ability was refined, perfected, and gave rise to indoctrination. But what's the point of all these harvests? The intelligence has one purpose. Preservation of life. That purpose is not being fulfilled. The directive the Reaper is to create the mass relays, to speed the time between cycles for greatest efficiency. The galaxy itself became an experiment. Evolution its tool. Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. The device. Do you know anything about the device we're building? It's supposed to be a super weapon. We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. So watch the Protheans. Is unknown. Okay, you made your point. Will you help stop the cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Wait! The cycle will continue. No! You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. We will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. You release me, no one has to be harvested. Nothing will change. The Reapers know where you are. You can't just watch anymore. You have to fight. Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop. Ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this once and for all. Shit. Your confidence is singular. I've earned it. Out there fighting where you should be. It's clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. There's more than one of them. Oh, that's that's, that's scary. We. Showing like three different. It's been all. Today, they pay their tribute in blood. It's been. Ah, I'm up. Oh God. Oh god, the bends. Wait, if it's in a pressurized area, it should be okay. Just a lot of fucking gear popping. What's up? Don't mind me. Bruh. I'm gonna throw up every meal I've ever had. <laughs> oh, 
Mind control. Yep. <laughs> Husk was like, I'm gonna come! No! No, you don't. Who's scary? Wait. It can control it. Oh, get fucked. Shepard, goddess, she's freezing. Got you back. Yeah. I've got Ann Bryson on the comm. Good. Put her through. Commander. Yeah. You feeling better? Yes, thank you. I'm doing fine. What happened? Uh. We found it, Ann. We found Leviathan. Was it worth it? I don't know. We proved it can't hide anymore. That it's a part of this war just like us. History books. Yeah. Just... Well, I look forward to hearing all about it. My father would appreciate this, knowing the truth is out there. In the meantime, Admiral Hackett has asked me to join his scientific team. Hey. We all have our part to play. I should get to it. Excuse me. Take care, Ann. And thanks for all your help. Shepherd out. reading a report yeah the alliance wanted more intelligence on the reapers i'd say we got it yeah just a fucking pad people will be studying it for years to come they're already calling it the leviathan codex it rewrites galactic history as we know it uh -huh. whatever else it means it tells me the reapers had a beginning and yeah maybe now we'll provide them with an end that's one way to look at it i guess it's the only way so go out there and make it happen this is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. This is a fucking... Hey, I'm just gonna... Hey. War asset? Le Ooh! Yeah. That's just God damn. Actually, I'm going to go check the med bay one. I'll test something just as my curiosity. It said bonus power, like. War is over. Hope you find every race that sat back while we bled and get some payback. Yeah, that's a great plan. Well, the war was more than that. Uh, medical. Thank you.
So I could use that and then charge in. Yeah. I want slam. I just I I looked at the uh, recharge time. Yeah, there we go. <sighs> yes. Going to save here. And I'm going to call the stream for today. Thank you all for being here. Hope you all have a wonderful day. This was a lot of fun. We made a lot of progress. <laughs>